I feel like it's been a while since I streamed, but uh, I don't know. I think I streamed like three or four days ago. It feels like a while since I streamed like a game that wasn't like a roguelike or TF2 or Dead by Daylight. And of like a story game. Oh, I was gonna change the title to like a free pathetic or something, but I did not. So I think the cutscene's gonna be really loud. I also oh no, did I lose? Hold on, is it just because this? Oh no, I got it. Okay, I thought maybe I lost control or control. And it went to like mouse and keyboard, but I need to actually put this on like medium because I was testing this out earlier and with settings on high, I was getting a little lag, but. With medium and with streaming, I probably should get a lag on medium. I hope so. Hope not. Uh, where is. There we go. Advanced settings. Put everything on medium. Oh, I turned off, like. Depth of field and motion blur. I can't believe that shit was on. Sure, that seems fine. So I didn't bother watching the cutscene, but I just went to, like, the first boss of the first area and ran around. New game! Okay, please don't be super loud. It was super loud last time. Oh, it's when super loud. Savior oh my god, I can't handle it. From his duty. <laughs> it's so the fire keeper took charge. <laughs> I gotta take my headphones off. That's a good idea. Yeah, we'll just have the headphones off and away from the microphone, hopefully. It's so loud for me. I have a condenser on stream, so it should be that loud. But I don't know why it's so loud. Oh my god. Oh man, sorry, that's very kind of you. Very generous of you. Thank you very, very much, Sat. That's very, very kind of home voice, man. Welcome to the fire keepers. You're champion. doing well. Okay. Cutscene over. Oh, thank God. Oh, nice. What's that working? Oh, it's working for me. Humphrey Pathetic. But, um. I think my voice is probably just quiet because the cutscene was super loud. I don't know. My voice should be okay. Uh oh, maybe not. Let's be bad. That's a nut good. My name is uh, Humphrey. Sweet. Yeah, it's working for me, so I'll repeat that. It works for me. Uh, yeah, gender male, sure. Wait, what? Reset? Oh, yeah, that's fine. Age, let's be mature, because we're all very mature here in the halfway stream. Deprived. I'll look at the other classes just because they're cool. Crestfallen and undead with a lot of potential and little hope. This is high vigor and vitality. Hunter, outcast. Ooh, he's cute. Priest, paramancer, scholar. Duelist is cool, that's like a dex user, but I mean, I'm playing Deprived, there's no way I'm not. Starting class, or starting gift, if I blessing. Raja, nah, I don't think so. Sovereignless Soul, maybe, a single quote. These are all like consumables. Ooh, Black Fire Bombs. I kind of want Sovereignless Soul, but give me Black Fire Bombs because there's like a tutorial boss. I played through this. I don't know, played like 20 minutes of this game. We'll go with the pale guy. Build, just fine, whatever, appearance. Sure. Finalize, yeah, let's go. Give me in there. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Damn, listen to two voices once, yeah. <laughs> so I took off my headphones because the cutscene was so loud. So I bet some of the cutscene was being played through the microphone and some of it was being played, you know, through the stream. I don't know why it's so loud, man. Fuck. Shit was crazy. <laughs> pathetic. <laughs> pathetic. I love the pathetic emote. It's so good. It's so good. Oh my god. Oh. So it seems that the um the glitch of having everything on <laughs> The glitch of having every single item on screen when you target an enemy persists through this mod, so I guess I gotta restart the fucking game. God damn it. Fuck. <laughs> well, there's just no more loud cutscene to blare my eardrums out. So that'll be nice. Ooh, this is a wonky close of the close of the game there. All right, we'll try again. We'll relaunch, I guess. That's so funny. Yeah, they never fixed it, I guess. Shit, I don't know how long Dark Souls 3's been on PC, but it's been a while, I think. Oh, that's funny. I originally played on PlayStation, PS4, Dark Souls 3. But I don't know, that glitch was ever there. I don't remember anything about it. These weird, um, loading screens. They seem kind of out of place. Let's get rid of the shield. No, I can, I can use the shield, sure. I'm just using the shield, you know? It's okay. Lightning urn. Oh, I need to equip black fire bombs. Yeah, I have eight of them? So there's a tutorial boss that I died to. 
Like one of those bosses that you're probably supposed to die to. I'll try beating him. Just because I played this game for like 20 minutes, just ran around, tested it out. Wait a minute. Parry, repose, yeah. Tutorial stuff. Hello, night guy. Give you little pokey poke. Oh, oh, I miss. I guess I good. Oh, no. I want to be full health for the boss fight, but it might not happen. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be full for the boss fight. Little R1 spam though takes care of him. Yeah, I do remember this is Dark Souls 3 and R1 spam is king. Ooh, broken straight sword, that's cool. Move dash, okay, it's just tutorial area. Funny that like a mod has a tutorial area. I mean, it's good that they do, but could have probably easily just skipped that. Like, ain't nobody playing this mod that hasn't played the actual Dark Souls 3. In no way. Prison area, boss ahead, open menu, change weapons. <laughs> Pathetic. Pathetic. <laughs> Not full health for the boss fight. Pathetic. Nice go. Okay. I don't know how big the demo is, but there's like five areas? I don't know if I can play all five areas though. Like the one random area that I picked to go into let me go into it, but maybe that was the only one you could go into? I'm actually not sure. I mean, it would make sense that there'd only be one area to play. It's just the demo for this like uh, overhaul mod or whatever. What's going on with this guy? I don't think I can hit him actually. I said coin. I found like a. Oh, I can hit that guy. Hey, get out of here, guys. I found a unique item while I was running around exploring. It was like feather or something. Not sure. So here's boss, which you think would be super easy. In phase one, he is, but then phase two, he actually gets hard. So I think I could just black fire bomb him to death. Hopefully. I'm kind of nervous. I kind of like want to keep trying to beat the tutorial boss. Like I might make a new character after this. I don't know. We'll see. See what happens. Hello, Demon Vanguard. Ooh, I miss. Ooh, he's got a cool big axe. Wait, doesn't the. Oh, yeah, I do have like a special power. Oh, I didn't mean to spam that there. More damage from my. Oh, I can't slide between his legs. damage from my club when I use like the special power. I really need to look out for phase two. When he hits phase two, I'm just gonna run away and smack him with fire bombs. All right, here's phase two probably. Yep. Oh, this is not, not do as much damage as I thought it would. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. You think? I mean, there's something past this arena that I see. Well, okay, I'm not gonna go back and try to beat him. <laughs> Shit. Lovecraftian? Yeah, he's like the Demon Souls, like, tutorial boss, I think, right? I mean, I guess the Demon Souls tutorial boss is similar to the Dark Souls tutorial boss as well. Could it be the first boss, huh? Pathetic. 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 I was playing the night class and I didn't get one shot, but uh, playing deprived, I'm, I'm getting one shot by that guy. Is he Dark Souls one boss? The, the Demon Souls has has a tutorial boss just like him though, right? Silent? No. I think Demon Souls and Dark Souls has very very similar tutorial bosses. Yeah, isn't Demon Souls too? Yeah. Banish the shadows, so my journey is ever safe. Whoa, whoa. I did not remember that detail. Beautiful chest ahead. That's getting screenshotted. Is that from Dark Souls 3? I think that might be a unique asset. The statue of Gwyn? Gwyn? Guinevere? Who's, who's that? I don't know. Guinevere? I get Guinevere and, and like the prince mixed up. Mixed up. Hey friend. Dear, forgive me. I didn't see you there. Not bad voice acting. This guy's not bad. Greetings, traveler. I am Erwin of Karim. It's not a bust, Silent. It's the whole yes, statue, you know? A bust would just be like the, the head. <laughs> it's, it's a whole statue. Dude, I think that's a unique asset. I think I think they made that statue for this game. 
I don't remember the statues from that game. I definitely would remember something like that too. But we have received no word from her, nor her nun. Miracles are tales of the. Hey, well, at least they didn't use AI voices for the video game. Saw so it. Ooh, ooh, salad. Ooh. If you wish to learn, <laughs> I can teach. Oh, he teaches me spells, miracles. Okay. Oh, he's like a. Okay. What do you think he'd be like a paladin, priest kind of character? I guess he's got a whip and a talisman. Hello, you bet. Hello, welcome to the face twenty. That you are doing well. You're playing a little Dark Souls three mod. Ooh, merchant over here. Hey, fine. No, no, no. I see no dark within you. I have. Oh, this guy's it's Tuesday, isn't it? <laughs> if you wish to find <laughs> oh my God, Tuesday, isn't it? <laughs> to do visage. Until then, be gone. Wait, what am I supposed to do? If you wish to find strength within the curse, embrace man's true. Okay. I gotta find strength in the curse. Okay, okay. I can't take it anymore, yeah. Too bad we miss you, too bad. We miss you, too bad. Stage 5 clinger? What? Oh, is Silent's a clinger? Yeah. So that's an orbiter for sure. Silent orbits. <laughs> He's an orbiter. <laughs> Ooh, pretty area. All right, don't recognize. There's like some tentacle guy over there. I don't know what that is. Like a wolf? Yeah. Ooh, there's Sif. There's Lord Gwyn. There's tree guy from Dark Souls 2. Bad game, Garbo game, and there's Guinevere. I think Guinevere is like the the prince princess kind of deal. I like Guinevere a lot. Pathetic. <laughs> Pathetic. Oh, there's a chest here. Looks like it's not a mimic. Oh wait, I should double check, though. Okay. Ooh, binoculars, key. Cool. Firelink shrine's a little different. I played through like the first area. It's kind of just like a remixed area from the first game, but you like go through it a separate way. Did you see the new Silent emote, Jibet? Silent was being very mean to me, so he made that for me as an apology. As an apology. It's locked. Can't go there. In Dark Souls 3, I get a key to go there. Just from the firelink maiden. ABAB stands for all backseaters are bastards, you bits. That's what that's what that emote is. If you ever see somebody backseating in a stream, you just spam that emote at them and they'll go away, hopefully. God, I hate backseaters. They just ruin the vibe. <laughs> I hate the backseaters. Ooh, double friend. There's lots of people to talk to. Cool. Oh, Ash and Estes Flask. I'll probably just... Transfer that into a normal SS flask. I hate it so much. It just ruins the vibe. Oh my god. Greetings. I am Empress Phoenix Sculptor. Oh, it's Sculptor from Sekiro. Well, before it fell, I escaped with my life, and I've been traveling the world ever since. Yes, <laughs> Silent still has the two head emotes. Dude, Jibet hasn't streamed in like five months. <laughs> oh shit. What's this guy sell? Okay, just general shop. I don't see any key here. No key. Oh, hello, Shadow Glooms. Hello, welcome to Alpha Stream. I hope that you are doing well. Yeah, Jibet bought it from Etsy, Silent. <laughs> well, the other ones then. Yeah. Yeah, what the heck did you. Wait a minute. I just got this, didn't I? Oh. Where'd this come from? I just got- this guy just had a flask, and then he dropped his armor, too? I mean, that's armor swag. Will it tell me if I'm light rolling or whatever? Oh, I'm all swagged out. Damn, they give you some swag right away. Custom armor? Very cute. How's my roll feel? Feels medium. 62% weight ratio? I think I need to be below 33% if I want to light roll. So I might be able to wear a little bit of swag. Yeah, I'll make my way towards the helmet. Looks like I can wear this for now. What about the legs? Yeah, I guess just that for now. Get rid of the shield. Emissary's blade. I mean, I guess that's cooler than the club. I'll go with that, I guess. It weighs less, too. 
Alright, I kind of got a derpy face. I kind of want a helmet, but no helmet for me. I don't do light roll all the time. There's Andre. I'm sure he's just the same Andre, right? I'm Andre of a store if it requires anything. God, Andre has such a beautiful hairline. I'm so jealous. Yeah, okay. I don't know what kind of weapon I want to use. I used a scythe when I played Dark Souls 3. I'll just see what I come across, I guess. I don't recall seeing you before. Oh my god, Shadow Gloom, we have a new Humphrey emote. It's Humphrey Pathetic, made by the silent. Tell the truth? Uh, sure. That's not where I came from. The name is Thomas. I'm certainly no stranger. <laughs> Pathetic. Nexus. Pathetic. If you plan on visiting I mean, I think it is her art, like whether she made it or not. I think legally she owns it. I think that's how it works. Commissioned artwork works. Allow me to ease your burden. Rest assured, there's not much else I'm good for. Wait, is he just storage? He's not storage box? They made storage box a character? What the heck, heck? <laughs> storage box is a character now. Oh my god. I can't believe storage box real. Okay, Shrine Maiden. Ooh. She's pretty swag too. We kind of have matching armor, actually. And she has like green in her armor or dress, I guess. To the Nexus, lost soul. I am a fire Wait a minute. I tend to the flame and tend to the this is a unique voice actress, right? I think. Yeah, it is. Cool. Arch Thrones, that's the name of the mod. Q. Coiled sword. Oh, I've got green gems in my blade, I just now noticed. Yeah, Humphrey Tubbs of 17 emote, but maybe it needs to be a real Twitch emote. Oh my god, I am fantastic, Shadowgloom, thank you for asking. It's my first day off. Oh my god, I love playing video games and not working, it's like my favorite thing ever. Hope you're doing well as well. Assuming that was directed at me. Ooh, mushrooms, cool. I like mushrooms. Oh, there's- <laughs> it's Mushrooms of Dark Souls 1, it's- What's her name? Are there actually eyes on that mushroom, though? I think there is! It is Mushrooms from Dark Souls 1. I don't think they have mushroom dudes in... Dark Souls 3, I think they're only in Dark Souls 1. Oh my god, the hug! Oh, so sweet! Oh, it's very, very sweet of you, g -Man. Thank you very much for the hug! I can't hug myself, though, because the webcam's not on, so I'm just- I'm just being a sunflower, though. This is sunflower. Right, let me stab this into the bonfire. <laughs> Pathetic. Pathetic. Fuck! What the heck, idiot? Oh. I skipped that dialogue that popped up. That was probably some kind of gameplay mechanic that I'm now very much unaware of. Oopsies. <laughs> Oopsies! Ooh, my blade is right next to her neck. Okay. Let me rest. Can I level up that bonfire? Oh, I got the rest emote. Can't do that. A lot of Estus, though. I don't want any magic Estus. Yeah. Give me all health Estus. Oh, no. Do you bet? No, not the backseaters. No. We hate the backseaters. We hate the backseaters. <laughs> Joke's on you, Jubat. I never sleep. I have an alarm on all of my phones that goes off when the Jubat stream starts. So I'm very much aware. I mean, when I tested it out, I went to this place. I guess I'll go from left to right. Or yeah, left to right. We'll go here first. Will it let me? Really? How's this demo work then? Can I just go to all five worlds? What the heck? What the heck, dick? I don't know how big this demo is. Maybe I should have did some reading on like how... Oh, it's Poison Swamp level already. How big it is. Let me get used to this attack. Okay. So, schmicky schmick. Humanity. I don't think humanity was in Dark Souls 1. Let me check out what these items I got. Restore half of maximum HP. Oh. Reverse hollowing. Okay. What's this thing? I'm serious cuff reminiscent of the Firekeeper's Crown. Okay. Some sort of key item. <laughs> it sells don't sleep. Man, poor Jubet. Yeah, it's rough. I don't know. Yeah, it's rough out there for the gamer girls. The backstaters just gravitate towards gamer girls and they just 
They just love backseating the gamer girls for whatever reason. I don't know. It's a very strange phenomenon. It's very strange. Yeah, Shadow Gloom knows what's up. Yeah. I, a girl streaming? I gotta go backseat her. Oh shit, it's Dark Souls 2 area. Oh my god. But Dark Souls 2 is a bad game. What the heck? Alright, I'm already impressed. I'm already impressed with this. I guess it's just a demo though? Part of me was like, hmm, maybe I'll just play the full game. Ooh, yeah, bonfire right there. Just like Dark Souls 2. But I don't know, I, I need a good game to play after playing Dark Souls 2 the other day. What's this? Harvest ingredient? Oh. Okay. So there's, maybe there's crafting. Oh my god, G-Bad Queen. G-Bad Queen, make the... Make the backseaters pay to read their messages. <laughs> Not reading message. Can you do that? I think uh, Twitch experimented with like a... A super chat function from YouTube. I don't know if that went through or not. Oh, I'm getting Dark Souls 2 flashbacks fighting this game. Uh. Oh no. Give me a dead. Where like you could pay and have your message like pop up at the top of the chat. Oh. I think it's only a certain channel. I don't think it's been for a while. I don't know if you can do it anymore. Maybe it's certain channels. It's like partners only. Man, I really don't like fighting this guy. He's got a lot of health for like a first kind of area. But that's a stagger, but no visceral opportunity. Just a little smicky smick. Oh, I can backstab him. Okay. I didn't do as much damage as I thought I would. Oh, I miss. <laughs> Shit. Ooh, I miss. Ooh, did some good shooty pup. Yeah, I was in a stream where they were like, oh, you should enable like TTS, Twitch to chat or text to speech, text to speech. And the guy was like, yeah, no, I don't really want to be like having people like hijack the stream with like their text to speech messages or whatever. Like, I feel the same way. I don't want anybody to be able to like have any kind of like noise make on stream or anything like that. That's really from perspective of a viewer and as a streamer. No, 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 no. Yeah, I could do subscriber only chat, but there's no reason for me to do that. <laughs> Definitely not gonna do that. Uh, stage six clear. <laughs> stage six clear. Yeah, like um, I don't want any like I don't know custom things going on. Like make like a meme pop up or something. That's just my perspective, though. It was butter. I, I remember who the streamer was. They were like, yeah, I don't want anybody to be able to make- Well, uh, okay, well. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Alright, Shadow proves a good point. I guess if you give me money, I let you make a little noise on stream. Where did this guy come from? What the heck are you- What's Shadow Gloom? That's a very, very kind, very generous of you to pluck Mega Mitty into a Pikmin. I don't know where this other dude came from. I think this mod might be harder than Dark Souls 3. That would make sense. That would make sense. Unless this is like a higher level area, maybe? Because uh, you could go to like five different areas. I do like no damage to this big guy. It takes so long to kill him. In Dark Souls 2, you're not supposed to go to this area right away. Maybe that's what the game is telling me. It's very, very kind. Very generous of the Shadow Moon. Such a sweetie indeed. All right, let's go back to the Nexus, I think. Yeah, Nexus member. Let's go back there. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Maybe she paid five bucks. I'm so greedy. I'm so greedy. I'm so freaking greedy. Uh, I mean, there's no way I can level up with the amount of souls I have. I did not beat the tutorial boss like a newbie noob. Yeah, let's try a different area. In Dark Souls 2, you're not supposed to go to that area. I don't understand how this works. I haven't played Demon Souls, but Demon Souls has like a similar system, I think. Are these blades different? No, they're all the same. It's like an Elden Rune or Elden Ring blade. I guess I'll try this area. I think Demon Souls, you can go to any area you want in any order, but I don't know if there's like scaling based on the order you tackle the areas. 
I do not know. Mm. Shadow Gloom. <laughs> Got her message read for five dollars. Yeah. Oh, cool. Carthus of the Sands. Oh my God. Oh, there's a guy mining over there. Let me go bully him. Oh, there's a worm over there. Oh my God, it's it's Dune Sandworm. Wait, is this guy an NPC? No, he's an enemy. <laughs> I couldn't target him. Little R1 spam. I mean, I need to level up. I have very little stamina, very little health. Shmack, shmack. Little R1 spam takes care of him, doom. Alright, there we go. Maybe that sword isn't all that great, but I like it better than the club. Travel by glowing blade. I wish. I wish I could just glowing blade my way to work and back into the grocery store and stuff instead of having to drive my car. Oh, there's black fire bombs. I try to destroy the- try to kill the tutorial boss with those, but I wasn't impressed with their damage and I got one shot, so maybe another playthrough. Donation. I don't even know how to do that, Shadow Gloom. So I definitely won't be doing that. Ooh. Beautiful woman of the desert. Hello. Well, well. Cool knife. Another emissary. Seeking soul. Yeah, that's me, have we? Does your fire keep it? Yeah, AI is pathetic. Pathetic. Carthus is a ruin. Although original like text to speech voices, I don't know, is that? that artificial intelligence? I'm not sure. Because that's been along for a long, long time. Interesting, interesting. <laughs> Chat GPT explained a silent way AI is our friend. Oh pardon. <laughs> oh shit, that's funny. Terrible manners. Welcome to Carthus <laughs> of the Sands. Oh, I shit. am Layla, the witch, as they say. Ooh, she's looking at me like pathetic. She's looking turn, down on me. Pathetic. Pathetic. Flame. Your flame. You know yeah, that's what they said about automation, Shadow Gloom, but I'm still working fucking 40 hours a week to survive. <laughs> fucking late stage capitalism. Fuck you, AI. <laughs> Fuck you, late stage capitalism. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, I ain't reading that shit. Yeah, that I shit. I ain't reading that. <laughs> I ain't reading I that shit. Simply waiting for the right moment to get moving. Some highwaymen have taken roost up ahead. Ooh, multiple men. Savages engorged on souls. But I suspect a hero like Ooh, that's me. Will make I'll be the hero. It may even be enough souls to satiate the. <laughs> hmm. So maybe there's a boss in each area. I don't know how long this demo is. Ah, oh, cool desert. What was that monster? What monster? The, the sandworm? The dune sandworm? Oh dear. Get the worm. The worm yeah, I shot. I shot. The damnable thing has fed well on the High Lord's conquests. And with the Empire in disarray, there is no one to put it. Do be careful. <laughs> hmm, okay. This might be a high level area as well. Farewell. So she's the pyromancer of the desert. Highwayman? I don't- I can't target him. I mean- okay, now I can. Oh! Oh, I thought I had a bow. Okay, he's got poise. No, I've been one shot. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh, this game might be harder than I was expecting. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Maybe I should have played deprived class. Ah, oh, so you suck, chat GPT. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck. Yeah, I've got mixed feelings about it, you know. You know I've got mixed feelings about it. Shin, that's a very kind, very generous of you to rate the halfway stream. I hope that you had a good day and a good stream. Alright, see, so I can tab out. <laughs> Let's see, let's see if that works. Oh, it worked! We did it! Alright, sweet. Let's see, what was Corruption playing? Fortnite? You know, Fortnite's pretty crazy. Oh, it just keeps getting updates. It reminds me of a game I used to play called TF2. So sad. No more... No more TF2 updates for me. With Sally. Hmm, I'm unfamiliar with Sally. Hmm. Sally? Do I know a Sally individual? 
This guy, mini boss, he kind of seems like an NPC. Like an NPC encounter. Like he might not respawn when he dies. You heal off that backstab. Smack. 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 Nope. Okay, at least I don't get one shot completely. I need to heal again, too. He's leveling up his sword. Eh, right away. Smack. <laughs> I'm sorry, Shadow Gloom. I just, I kind of like the static PNG. I think it has a certain charm to it, you know, that doesn't move around at all. I looked into it. Like, I tried to do it. Even Silent did it. Silent did a good job, but even though it, like, moved around when I talked and it looks kind of cute, honestly, I preferred it not to do that. I'm going to throw a firebomb at this guy. Fuck him. Yeah. All right. Sweet. Um, hopefully he doesn't respawn. I went through all my Estus. I didn't get a lot of souls either. Oh, my souls are down there. There's like a green speckle down there. Are those my souls? I don't think I died that far down though. Hmm. Let me take a little rest at the bonfire. It's not about you, it's about me. Me, 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 me. Oh, he does respawn. I right, get rid of that out of my hotbar. Man, I feel like every area is too high level for me. Like that one guy was really tough. Hmm. I mean, it's a mod, so I think Generally speaking, it's gonna be harder than like actual Dark Souls thing. Yeah, I don't know why my runes are down here. I don't think I died down here. Weird. Alright, I got some runes back though. Can I level up at the bonfire? Let me go see. Maybe I should use the shield. Like a coward. <laughs> just cause game too hot. Too hot for me. She's still just chilling. No, I can't travel. Yeah, it's a mod. Corruption, it's a mod for Dark Souls 3, so it's not like a real Dark Souls game, but um, all the areas are pretty cool so far. We'll see how the bosses go. Oh, Shadow Gloom's so sweet. Oh, such a sweetie. Yeah, sometimes I just don't want to, don't want the webcam on for whatever reason. I don't really know why. I'm not really sure why. I've mentioned before that, like, it drains me ever so slightly less. Like, it's, it's a little less effort to stream or whatever. Ooh. Bug. Bug, bug, bug. Die, bug. Aw. I know, I feel bad. That gave me five souls. I thought maybe it'd give me, like, an upgrade material. No upgrade material for me, though. There's another, like, hard enemy over there. Oh, no, it's not good. How much R1 spam can I do to this guy? Okay, a decent amount. A little more R1 spamming. Yeah, back up. More R1 spam. Perfect. We got him. Yeah, these guys are no big deal. Do I have? Yeah, I have ring slots. Oh, what's this? Further increased max HP while embered. Oh. Ooh, so it's like Elden Ring where you can put on different great runes, probably. And get different effects from your ember. Okay. Bug. Come here, bug. I want to give you a little smacky smack. Ah, they hurt me. <laughs> no, bug. You're supposed to be my friend. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I thought maybe they were like upgrade bugs. But they're just normal enemies, I guess. Give you a slight amount of souls. I try to find a dex weapon. I don't think this is boss arena. Yeah, get the little schmicky schmick. Man, bunch of unique enemies in this area. I haven't seen an, an enemy from Dark Souls 3 at all. Same thing with that other area. When I tested out the game, I went to an area where there was nothing but reused Dark Souls 3 enemies. This gun's a bunch of unique enemies. Uh-oh. What's going on with this sand? I don't like what's going on in this area. Titanite shard, upgrade. I need to find a weapon I actually need to want to upgrade, though. No, don't smack at me. It's probably not backstabable. I don't like the way he moves around. I can go around- Oh, bonfire over there? Hold on. Yeah, there's like a flame over there. I don't think it's a bonfire, though. Oh my god, I went to go see Dune 2 in theaters, G-Mance. In IMAX? Oh my god, it was so cool. I think a lot of what IMAX offers you is not just uh, visual, but audio as well. Like, it just the sound system is just crazy good. Like, you don't really get the same experience in, like, a home theater. Yeah, it was really good. I think I enjoyed the first one more. Dune 2 was more of, like, a spectacle. Not that Dune 1 wasn't a spectacle. But Dune 2 has a lot less talking. A lot less dialogue. A lot less, like story points where it's mostly just a spectacle of like the desert and the action and the special effects and stuff. I mean there's worms in the first one too, do you bet? 
But yeah, there's worm riding in the second one. Ooh. And there's a baby worm. Not a spoiler, but there's a little baby worm. Oh, so cute. Oh, little, little guy, little worm. Yeah, Jubat wants to ride the worms for sure. <laughs> I went for the bucket. I said hello. One dune, two bucket for the Humphrey Preach. And he said, oh, sorry, sir. We don't have those. And I really don't want to fight this guy again. I mean, I'm tempted to run past him, but that's probably a bad idea. He is not staggering. <laughs> he just hits me with his shoulder and I die. <laughs> I don't think they had the bucket. If they did, I didn't see it, but I didn't really look for it, to be honest. I didn't really look for the Dune 2 bucket of, like, the... I guess it's a worm, right? Yeah. The worm. I'm trying to think of where the boss would be. This area. I really want to recover my souls. I really want to level up. I really want to level up. Oh, yeah, yeah, one dude, two bucket, please hold the popcorn. I'm just here for the bucket. Oh, shit, that's funny. I'm just here for the bucket. Doink, doink, doink. Oh, my God, G-Bet. I did not need to know that. I did not need to know that, G-Bet. That is a message I did not need to read tonight. Thanks for sharing, G-Bet. Really, really didn't, want, didn't need to read that. Oh, my God. Did they use it, G-Bet? Did you, like... See them use it, or did you just see somebody make it? <laughs> yeah, that's a vanish. That's a vanish I've ever seen one. Oh shit, that's funny. No, let me get my souls over here. I had a cat pop out of my mouth, out of my, you know, like a fake tooth that goes over like my real tooth. So whenever I inhale sharply, it kind of, it's very sensitive. I don't like it. I don't know. I'm kind of upset about that. Kind of makes I don't know talking a lot kind of hard, but I'll get used to it. Hopefully, I'll learn how to like. I'll breathe around it. If I inhale sharply, my fucking tooth hurts. God damn it. Fuck. I got an appointment at the dentist next week. Ugh. That is unfortunate. But I can't stream if my teeth hurt. Dentist, no. No. Alright, what do we got in here? I think that's something to put on my weapon. Yeah, it's like um, the nerve is exposed, you bet, right? I have a crown. No, 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 Jubat, you weren't listening. I had a crown pop off. I had a crown come off. A fake tooth come off my real tooth. Jubat was not listening. She was worried about her Dune 2 Fleshlight bucket. <laughs> no mic streams, muted streams are probably. I actually watch a muted streamer who, you know, she's mute, like she can't talk, right? So she, like, talks to chat by, like, typing on stream or, like, drawing on stream. It's actually not a bad time. It's actually not a bad time. Yeah, probably a little too much sodi pop, honestly, Shadow Gloom. I do love the sugar drinks. Ooh, I can hit up this guy with a bow. Uh, I think I got a bow, didn't I? No, I didn't get a bow? Hmm. Oh, I got arrows, okay. I have to come back here when I have a bow, I guess. I can't get on top of this building, I don't think. Yep. Yep. Oh, come back here. Come back here. I know, Jubat remembers too, Shadow Gloom. <laughs> And then I started talking. <laughs> yeah, you had the best. Man, I wish I could still do those streams, but honestly, I mean... Honestly, I did that for an entire year. I'm surprised. I'm surprised I got away with it that much. These graphics look kind of like cell shaded or something. These kind of things look kind of wonky. I'm hoping to kill this miner before that big guy comes back. I've got a decent amount of souls to level up. I need to find a weapon I actually want to upgrade to. Probably not this sword. Bam, 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 bam. Ooh, I worked out on stream the other day. That felt good. That felt good. Not only the working out, but just to actually do something that I said I would. Because I wasn't doing it because I was a bad streamer boy. I a bad streamer boy. <laughs> I knew I was always giggling. I was a giggly boy. Just a little giggler. Okay, this lady's an issue, I believe. Ooh, she's a bit of a muscle mommy, though. Poke. I can get her, but fuck. This might take a while. Next stab? Nope. Uh, just stab. Ouchie. Alright, I heal. I have very little SS. I thought maybe that was a buff fire spell, but it was just a fireball. What? 
I was texting my- I remember I was texting my friend from the warehouse while I was on stream. And I texted her like, lol, like, la mal, like, haha, that made me laugh. And she messaged me like, hey, you didn't laugh from that, I've been watching your stream. <laughs> you didn't laugh. You didn't laugh, you liar. I said, oh no, I'm so eep, I'm so eep. This is my Malau. And then she like messaged me, this is your Lamal face, and it was my straight face looking at my phone or whatever. Called out, yeah, captured, called out. You didn't Lamal, Humphrey, you fucking liar. That's okay, Rice. Hey, don't even welcome to the Humphrey's way. Hope you're doing well. You're tying my sunflower today. No webcam for me. I'm just, just a, such a shy boy, you know, I don't want to be on camera. Ooh, I'm too shy, too shy. Didn't actually laugh. Pathetic. <laughs> All right, I'm putting on a shield. How's my equip load? I think it's okay. Actually, it might be below 30. I might not be able to wear this shield. Yeah, whatever. Shields are lame anyway. Shields are fun losers. No shield for me. If I just farm these fucking, like, minor guys, they're like the one enemy in this area I can actually kill. <laughs> I guess these guys too. The little grasshoppers. Yeah, thanks for stopping by saying hi, gay rights. I wish you luck in your final exam tomorrow. I believe in you. You'll do great. You'll take care of that final exam, no problem. Um, check. P O V Humphrey is lamowing. <laughs> That's my lamow face. That's my lamow face. Check. Oh, I miss. Yeah, I just want to get my souls back. I guess round two, fight that. I'm trying to think of what kind of weapon she has. It's not a scythe, it's like a hook sword. It's not a curved sword, because it's like a hooked sword. Yeah, I'm not sure exactly, but it's very cute. It's a very cute. I saw a meme of like, TikTok advice, and it was like, you know, what guys do to get girls to like them, and it's like, be the where's my hug at guy. Girls love that. <laughs> I said, oh my god, that's me. That's literally me. Where's my hug at? That's me. <laughs> where's my hug at? Where's my hug? Where's my hug? Oh shit. <laughs> oh my god, I love Where's My Hug. That shit is so funny. I gotta take my sweatshirt off, fuck. The Where's My Hug has got me cracking up. Where's my hug? <laughs> where's my hug? Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh yeah, that's good stuff. Oh, where's my hug? Where's my hug, goody girl? Where's my hug, goody girl? <laughs> oh shit, that's funny. <laughs> Oh, hug for the silent. Hug for the little guy that does so sweet. Dude, I'm doing that to every single woman I see. Where's my hug? <laughs> Where's my hug? Oh my god. <laughs> That's so cringe. <laughs> oh man, it's on brand for the Humphrey, you know, though. I gotta, I gotta, where's my hug, girly girl? Girly girl, where's my hug? Alright, when she's dead. <sighs> Can I just sneak past her? I'm gonna try sneaking past her. I'm gonna do a little sneaky sneak. I mean, there's- oh my god. It's the fucking dune worm. Oh, he's killing people for me. Is he far, maybe? Okay, we got a Sekiro mini boss over there. Ooh, spear user. Chad, Chad, Chad. Is the sandworm gonna come back, or... Was that just a one-time thing from the sandworm? No, Moist Man, saying where's my hug is ultra Chad move is super cool and based and women love when you say where's my hug. Ooh. Ring. This guy seems aggro, he's moving around. Is he gonna run up at me? Oh, he's coming after me, okay. Uh, yeah, you got it, Moist Man, yeah, you got it. It's, it's an annoying guy kind of deal. I'm just memeing around. Don't actually be the where's my hug guy, because that shit is not okay. <laughs> that shit is not okay. <laughs> Don't actually be a where's my hug guy. Um, I got a ring. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, you got it. Ooh, dexterity, dexterity boost. Yes, please. And I can be a little sneaky when I roll around. I don't really care about that too much. I'm curious about this guy if I can just sneak on past him. Probably not though. Yeah, be a where's my handshake guy. Oh, that is not destroyable. Whoa. All right, fight me guy. Oh, he doesn't have that much health. Is he just a straight up Sekiro guy? <laughs> he seems like it. Oh, he one shots me. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn it. I need to get more health, I guess. Fuck. I really want to get my souls back. 
Where's my handshake? Where's my handshake? Where's my handshake? <laughs> where's my hug? Oh fuck the where's my hug guys, they cracked me up. I, I want to be that guy, but I just can't bring myself to do it, you know? I just can't be a where's my hug guy. As much as I want to be one. I am playing deprived class, so... I have the worst stats in the game. I need to level up. Where's my souls, guy? <laughs> where's my souls? Where's my handshake? I mean, I'd fight that spear guy if he might drop his spear, but I'm not sure if he will or not. Side hug. Where's my side hug? Where's my huggy hug, girl? Where's my huggy hug? I think I'm good to run past her. It's the Fortnite of Dark Souls. Oh, she walks really far away. So I'm guessing the worm's gonna pop out, right? Where's the worm? No? No worm? Where's the worm? Uh... Okay, that girl didn't aggro on me. Like, if I beat this guy, what's he gonna give me? I don't know, but he one-shots me, so maybe I shouldn't fight him. I wanna see that item, though. And I can't, like, bait him in the sandworm. I guess it was just once, and then he doesn't come back. What? <laughs> Coming right up. Yeah, I could be a where's my side hug guy, you know? That's a little less cringe, I guess, from, uh... Where's my just straight-up hug? Oh, Ember's nice. I'll probably save that, though. I'm just, like, avoiding all the enemies in this area. I don't feel confident fighting any of them, really. Can I have the sandworm kill this guy? I think so. Alright, we're running past all the enemies. This always works in Dark Souls. This never comes back to bite you in the ass. Sandworm? Something's happening. Okay, nothing up. Ooh, chest. It's a real chest, too. Rusted coin. I'm guessing there's mimics in this game. In this demo. I checked the chain, but like, you know, the chain might be different on this demo, which I'm guessing it is. If the chain is curled up, it's it's a normal chest, but if it's like, more straight, it's a mimic, at least in Dark Souls 3. But I'm not playing Dark Souls 3 right now, so that's kinda cute. Caravan. Light him up there. I'm trying to find like a second bonfire. Oh! I think I see one! I think I see a bonfire! Is the sandworm gonna pop out? Maybe, maybe, maybe. That dexterity boosting ring isn't bad, especially because I like dex weapons. Hold on. Can't make it up this sand. Oh, there's another big Sekiro game. Ooh, Sekiro, that's a video game I could play. It'd be a good time. I don't know how big this demo is. I was hoping to complete it. Oh, lighting glitches. Okay. That's okay. Not a huge deal. Please don't one-shot me, guy. Okay, bonfire found, sweet. That's progress, baby. Oh, hey, guy. Ouch. Ouchie. I probably can't back so. I mean, I guess I'll fight him here. I can't use the bonfire. Okay, that's a stagger. I'll try backstabbing him. Mm, I don't think that would work. I need to get stamina back. I have such little stamina. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Music's changed. Sounds like there's custom music. I hear, like, custom music. Do little sippy sip. This guy's probably a lot of souls if I get him. Nope. Wait, is Neo an enemy from Neo? I only played Neo very, very briefly. I was not impressed with Neo, but you know, you know that's how it. I mean, I'm learning to the text. I have no heals. I'm on a zero heal. Nope. Nope. <laughs> nope. Is Dio an actual enemy? Actually, I didn't know it. Alright, so far I've beaten zero bosses. That's not good. <laughs> I'm not feeling too super confident. It's my souls right here. I want to go back in the desert and just like... Get all those items? This might be boss, actually. Ooh! Boss arena, okay, cool. Alright, let's go... Wait, is Neo from the Matrix, Silent? <laughs> oh, I gotta go back to... Firelink Shrine to level up. Lame. Lamey lame. I think it's boss arena. Oh, 
Wait, where is Fire Maiden? There she is. Alright, I'm emissary in this game. I get two levels. Where are they going? I don't know. One into health, one into endurance. Yeah, we'll do that, I guess. Wait, vitality is like equip load, yeah. Yeah, Neo, I know. I know Shogun. I played it, but eh, I wasn't impressed. I played it for like, eh, probably too long, honestly. It's got like, decent combat. I don't like the loot system, and I don't like... The exploration. I have some souls I could use. Let's use one of these. How many do I need for a level up? Oh, just use one more? Sure. Doing. I have level up, but or, or reinforcing materials. I'd like to find a weapon that I actually want to use. I don't think it's this sword. All right, two points into health, one point into endurance. I think it's boss arena coming up. Oh wait, I don't teleport from here. Okay, I go up here instead. I don't even remember which one was the desert area. Was it this one? <laughs> I don't remember. Okay, it was. Arc Throne of the High Lord. Yeah, it's got like the thing, okay. Little visual glitch there, just was like... Little area preview was just like a white... Square, rectangle. I guess I'll see the boss. I don't have a ton of souls, so I don't care if I lose them. I have Homeward Bones. Let me see how many I got. One. Okay. Alright, Bush. Fight me. Oh, not a boss arena. Wait, maybe? There's, like, other ways to go. There's more paths. Yeah, probably never Shadow Gloom. Probably never. I think I'll skip Helldivers, too. I mean, I don't know. Maybe. I really, really like co-op shooters. Like, Left 4 Dead 2 is, like, a fantastic game, but... And I guess it's, like, really, really good, Helldivers, too. Ooh, Black Blade. Is that a dex weapon, perhaps? Not a huge fan of swords. But I might like that more than I like this weapon. Pyromancer gear. Hand axe. I can't use it because I don't have the attribute requirements. But I could get there. Dun, 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 dun. It's so good Silent plays it. That's not the flesh you think it is, Queen. Silent plays Callisto Protocol. <laughs> Never not mentioning Callisto Protocol when Silent's in chat. Okay, we have like a ghost enemy, they bleed. This enemy seems more manageable than all the enemies in the desert. Ooh, I miss. It's definitely like a friend kind of game. You want to play that game solo, probably. Ooh, I miss. Yeah, like they had half as much health as any of the other enemies in the desert. Ah! You scared me. I kind of want to go back. I mean, the desert's like the first area. This area seems easier, though. I just ran through that guillotine. Chopping block, whatever that's called. Didn't have any collisions. Can I backstab these guys? Trap. Oh, there's another trap here. Let's trigger it. Yeah, cool. I can outsmart the enemies. Trigger it again. Yeah, sweet. Actually, I'm glad there's a trap here. Come fight me, ghost lady. But not really. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Silent. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Silent. Yep. Yeah. Silent. Fine. 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 Oh, I really wanted to hit the pressure plate there. Okay. Well, that was rather silly. <laughs> Pathetic. <laughs> Pathetic. Silent needs a hug. Pathetic. Yeah. Yeah. Silent is my friend. I really want to just kill this guy. Where'd they go? What the heck? Okay. I have no more healing. Let's just do a little exploration before. Tiny shard. Yeah, I need to find a weapon I actually want to upgrade. Pressure plate there. More ghost people. I think I got a retreat. Pressure plate here as well. I'm guessing it's the same trap, fire arrows. I mean, I could probably fight this guy. Yeah. Alright, let's go back to the bonfire. Oopsies. Yeah, I need I need souls. I mean, I'm playing as the deprived class. I don't know. It's it's a weird structure where it's like demon souls, and you go to each area like I don't know, at any order you wish. I don't I don't really yeah I don't know. Like I don't know what area is level is the is the 
is like you know the area you're supposed to go to as far as like level goes i don't know if like enemies scale based on how many areas you've completed i don't know all the enemies are real cool though they're all like custom enemies custom areas and it's dark souls 3 so like you know the mechanics are all there the movements there i'm guessing i go each catacomb area and activate some sort of lever opens up this big door and then boss i mean that's decent level design not bad level design anything in here i don't see anybody cool oh, that's a dark souls 2 enemy i'm pretty sure that's why this mod is bad is because of the creator of the dark souls 2 fan just kidding just kidding <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it's a mod, so I think it's supposed to be, like, harder than Dark Souls 3, I feel, but... I just don't know what area to go to. And I'm not sure if it's really this area. Hmm, I don't like both of these people here. This looks like a shortcut elevator. I think I'll not fuck around with this. I'm gonna go back to the other catacombs, I guess. I need to find a weapon that I actually want to use, and I can upgrade it, because this sword ain't it. Black Blade is interesting. The level requirement is too high, though. 18 strength and 18 dex. I mean, if I two-hand, I don't need that much strength. Ooh, it does bleed. It's a katana. Kind of a small katana. Like, the reach is maybe slightly more than this, like, short sword. Yeah, hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Very interesting. Man, I really wish my tooth wasn't bothering me. Fuck. If I, like, inhale sharply, it's sensitive. It hurts. I don't like that one bit. I do a whole lot of running past everybody. Oh, what? That, like, arrow trap didn't hit that ghost? What the heck? Let me just run around like a madman and hit all these traps, maybe? Come here, ghosty ghost. Come on, come on. Die to the fire arrows. Dun, dun, dun. Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, I'm tempted to go to a different area. Like that, uh. Sand area seemed a little too strong. The one area I went to, like, before I was streaming just to test out the game, see it working properly, seemed kind of low area. But I don't want to go back there because, like, I already been there. But maybe I will go there. But it's so weird because it's like, I don't know what area to go to. I don't know if they scale based on. How many areas you completed? Yeah, I really just find trying to find gear. I am playing deprived class, which is my own fault, but there's no way I don't play deprived class. It's my favorite class. I've got to play it. I forgive you, Silent. I forgive you for being critical of the med. You are forgiven. Okay, some things here. Ooh, loincloth. It's uh the guy. Oh, can they not get me? Is this a firebomb moment? Yeah. I believe it is. Die, 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 die. How many more firebombs do I want to use on these guys? Alright. Not bad at all. Alright, easy. Easy soul farm. <laughs> Alright, good deal. Yeah, this guy's still here. I don't think I could bait him out of there either. Like, I think he just stays there. I don't think he can go through those. Oh, he can. Oh, sheesh. Never mind. Go backstab. R1 spam is real strong, though. It's Nexus 3, after all. No, not really, Moist Man. Um, people like the Deprived class because... All your stats start out at 10, so if there's a build that you want to do, you can kind of build the perfect character. None of the stats are wasted. That's why people like the Deprived class. So if I look at my stats right now, they're all 10. I mean, Dexterity is 13 because I have a, a ring that's boosting that. And I put two points into health and two points... Or in, in one point into... Wait, Attunement? What the fuck? I leveled up the wrong thing. <laughs> attunement? That's like that's like spell fucking... Um, uh, inventory. That's like how many spells that I can have. I meant to do endurance. Oh my fucking god, I messed up the build already. Fucking pathetic. <laughs> oh my god. Why is attunement in the second, like, slot? I feel like it should be endurance. Attunement. Hold on. Attunement. Yeah, it governs my magic. Also determines number of attunement slots. I wanted endurance. What the fuck? 
I mean, there's no way the mod switched around to Tumen and Endurance. I just don't remember Endurance not being the second, like, slot from the top. It's always, like, Health and then Endurance. Because, like, you need those on all characters, no matter what kind of playstyle. What the heck the heck? Oh my god, I'm playing Deprived with Attunement leveled up. Oh my fucking god. I'm gonna rage quit. Jesus. <laughs> Dude, what the fuck? I leveled up the wrong stat. I don't give a fuck about Attunement. I'm not gonna use fucking spells. <laughs> Alright. Oh my god, I gotta, I gotta take a deep breath after that. I'm fucking tilted. Jesus. Alright, let's make sure not to die to a trap here. Oh wait, dead end? Ain't no way. There's gotta be an illusory wall around here somewhere. I mean, I guess that... In the other direction... That elevator wasn't like a shortcut elevator? Um, oh! There's freaking stairs to walk up. I'm a dummy dim. Dummy dim. Another trap. Oh. Sense fortress. I, I saw the pressure plate, I still like walked through it. Where that you could just like walk through those... Guillotines, for lack of a better word. Chopping block thingies. So I'm guessing that's death down there. How am I timing this out? Ugh. I'm not actually sure. Let's see. Can I walk through them? Yeah, it looks like I go two and then stop. That's what I see. Yeah, really, that attunement slot is a embellishment. What? What? Wee. Oof, that was skewy. All right, here's the last run through, I think. This looks like the one. Uh, they're all like going at different speeds. Hmm. Really trying not to fuck this up. Like now. Oh nope! <laughs> I changed my mind. <laughs> I changed my mind. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> fuck. This one's the hard one. Oh no. Uh. Okay, I think I see it when they're like both. Go, go, go! Alright, there we go. Sweet. Alright, sweet. Uh, oh, Bell! Bell of Awakening? Maybe? No. I can't interact with the bell at all. Oh, I can. I can ring the bell. I hear a shiny lizard. I guess I'll ring the bell. Does this kill the worm? Ding. Oh my god, rope sound effects. Am I gonna get a cutscene explaining to me what the fuck that did, or. We just ring the bell. Oh god, please don't tell me that was the Sekiro Demon's Bell making the game fucking harder. Jesus, please no. Please no. Well, I can't ring it again. There's the entrance. Weird lighting effect glitches, but what are you gonna do? Um... I rang the bell. Don't know what that did. 50 ghosts heading your way now, yeah. Uh, this is just shortcut mech. Okay, I don't do a ton of damage to the lizard, but hopefully I'll do enough. Please don't go away, lizard. I really want to kill you. Stamina, stamina. I didn't mean to kick. Nope. All right. Give me some good upgrade. Okay, technically tight out. Yeah, I might use that if I find a weapon I want to use. Huh. So I rang the bell. I don't know what that did. I got no cutscene. I wonder if there's a setting to make these lighting effects not so glitchy. Shadow quality, no shadows, maybe? I'll try no shadows. Where is... Oh, here we go. Shadow. Can I turn off shadows? Yeah, off. Eh, I mean... The game looks worse, but there's no more <laughs> glitchy shadow effects. Oh, there's items up there. This area reminds me of Legend of the Zelda... Uh... Desert Temple. Because, like, you go to the main entrance, but there's also, like, a place, like, really far up. That you like hookshot across. Was there Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time? I mean, I fixed the glitch, I guess. I mean, I guess I'm going back to that bonfire. Hmm. I don't think I can avoid this guy. Can I actually hit the bonfire, though? I want to turn shadows back on. <laughs> oh, hey, guy. Hello, Flynn. <laughs> yeah. These interiors don't look good without shadows. I mean, I guess you can turn shadows completely off. Shadows. I don't think low will fix the glitch. Guess I'll just put it back on medium. So I ring the bell. Did that open up the big door? No? Hold on. Let me go level up, I guess. There's like a 
Looks like a smoke. Like a black smoke in front of the door. That's what I see. Okay. Okay, okay. I see you, game. Let's go here. Yeah, I don't know if that black smoke appears on stream, but I see it. <laughs> I see it. I see it on my monitor. Um. God, I can't believe I fucking leveled up attunement. Jesus. Oh my god. Yeah, I guess attunement was always in the second slot. I don't, I don't remember that. I want endurance, though. Fucking wasted attunement. Uh, yeah. One point of endurance only gives me one, but then two gives me two. I'll do that, I guess. <laughs> Another stat attunement for the meme. Yeah, start do a magic build. I may as well do a magic build now. I may as well be an int user. <laughs> I may as well. Might be able to get another level. Use one of these. Ding. Oh yeah, big levels. Health. Yeah. I keep getting one shot by things. I have stamina issues still. I will eventually find a weapon I want to use. Oh my god, I need like a tiny amount of souls to level up. I can go kill a cricket to level up. I guess I'll just use this. Might be kind of a waste. Wing. 800. More levels for me. Yeah, give me the endurance now, sure. No, I don't want to talk to you anymore. So, back to the desert area, I guess. I'm kind of committed to the desert area. I rang the bell. Maybe I can open up that big door now. Looks like I go up above the big, like, sand temple or whatever. I'll probably explore the desert when I actually get, like, a decent weapon. This is, like, the starting sword, I guess. I like it better than the club, but it might not actually be better than the club. The club does have, like, a unique attack. Maybe I should go to the club. What's that do to my equip low? 28? That's fine. I think I need to be below 30. Go to the club. Yeah, there's, like, a black smoke here. Hello? No? Okay, did ringing the bell activate the elevator over here? Pretty sure that's a Dark Souls 2 enemy. Schmack. That's not a secret passageway. Oh no, I didn't even try the elevator over here. So maybe ringing the bell didn't do anything. Maybe did something in the desert? Hello, ghost fans. It's me. Hopefully. So I probably couldn't pull this lever until I rang the bell, but maybe I'm wrong. Ooh, I miss. Wait, did one of the ghosts fall down? <laughs> I seen that right? Yeah, one of the ghosts fell down the elevator shaft. Ooh. The club has a actual, like, attack combo where like the third swing is different i don't think that's from normal dark souls yeah the fourth swing i do that i don't i don't know if that was in dark souls 3 or not i mean the club you replace pretty pretty quick any elevator secrets ghost taking fall damage pathetic pathetic i didn't see any elevator secrets i'm guessing that's what ringing the bell did oh i hate these guys oh another bell for me to ring I don't doubt this guy. We can yell at each other. Not cheat. Okay, I don't get one shot now. I got some levels into health. Can't see him because the bell's in the way. <laughs> Is he gonna roll at me? Do something, guy. Oh, there's like Harry, I forgot. Or, um. Counter attacks? Oh, this might be a bad idea. This seems like a bad idea. Oh, jeez. I uh, don't really want to be on the elevator with this guy. Okay, that was weird. Um, I took fall damage somehow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, I can probably avoid him and just get back on the elevator. Uh, yeah, there's a counter guard, yeah. He got on the elevator with me. I kind of wanted to jump off the elevator. I'm not jumping off the elevator now, though. <laughs> This is so clowny. Clown Fiesta. Where'd he go? Alright, he died of fall damage. We did it. We freaking did it. Nice. <laughs> Easy souls. Nice. I like rubbed up against the side of the elevator and then 
fell off. Okay, another bell to ring. So this is two bells of awakening. Let me admire the desert. Pathetic. Dying to oh, there's another... Seems like big area over there. That's where I spawned in from, though. Is it? No, I started over there. There's the bonfire. Another area over there. Alright, we'll see where this other... Bell does. Doing Cutscene! That's two bells. Maybe... Boss Arena door opens now. I got some health, I got some endurance. I just need to find a weapon that I want to use and I'll be Gucci. So, probably not dropping down. Yeah, I don't think that's happening. Let me just double check over here make sure there's nowhere to explore. Gotta love exploring. No illusory wall. I'm glad I decided to play this. Part of me was like, eh, I don't really want to play like the demo. Maybe I'll wait for like the actual full release of the mod, but I couldn't really, I think I couldn't really decide on a game to play. Let me look for any elevator secrets. Don't see any. Yeah, I love exploring. I think I am. I think I am going to do the Humphrey Lore Community Challenge. I think that's going to be a thing. A little Humphrey Lore quiz night. I need to talk to some participants I have in mind to see if they'd be willing. Like parts, of, part of me knows that it's it's like not gonna be great. It's kind of kind of it's gonna be like a sucky stream, but I think it'll be fun. And that's what matters. It's just having fun, you know. Because you know, in my mind, I imagine like the side that stream where like you know he gets in character and he's running like a game show and it's all very high production value and he's in character and stuff. Which I don't really do that. Not really that kind of streamer, but as long as it's fun, that's all that matters. So I think that'll be the next community challenge, Humphrey Laura. I've got like a bunch of questions written down on my phone. I know, there's some good Humphrey lore out there. Yeah, it'll be fun, it'll be fun, it'll be a good time. Health? 15 health. I can't believe I have a fucking attunement level, oh my god. Endurance. I might want to start getting dex and strength. Like, this black blade is probably a really good weapon, but... I don't know, I want to find a weapon that I really, 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 really like. Dun, dun, dun. Of course, Silent, of course. Silent Deserve. Silent Deserve. Alright, desert area. Maybe I can open up that big door now. Maybe there's a third bell in the desert. There's a couple areas I need to explore in the desert. Dude, I know. As soon as I get the ability to respec, I'm gonna. It's gonna cost more souls to respec to get rid of that one attunement. <laughs> but but I, it's so embarrassing. Oh my god. I'm guessing you'll get the respec ability at one point. Maybe not in the demo, but... Oh my fucking god, I can't believe I got a tomb and thinking it was endurance. What's going on with this smoke? Hmm. Maybe... Maybe I can't do this area yet? Maybe... Oh, maybe... I don't know. What's this time with demos? Where you get to an area that, like, you can't progress any further. It'll be like, you know, in development. Can't get past this demo anymore. Maybe it's saying, like, I need to go do other areas? I don't really understand what those bells did. There might be a third bell in the desert. I guess I'll explore the desert. Hmm. I guess I'll do that. I guess I'll fight this guy. I'm a club user now. Smack. This guy has a hairy back. I'm so jealous. To a shippy ship. Oh. <laughs> I was not expecting the hand thrust. Your little spam roll away. Your little running over here. Shippy ship. Oh, he has to like walk around the bonfire. That's kind of funny. It's kind of cute. Hmm. I don't know if that like black smoke is saying like, oh, that's the last part of the demo. You can't go further. Hmm. Not sure. Yeah, this is where I'm like, uh, maybe I shouldn't have played the demo, maybe I should have waited for the whole mod to come out. If, like, I can't get past an area. I was thinking it would just be, like, one area. One complete area with, like, a complete final boss of that area. You'd be able to play that one area, but it seems like it's all the areas, but maybe not all the areas are complete. It's just, like, the first area to each area. Okay, let's rest, I guess. Ugh, I really want this guy to die. I don't want him aggroed on me as I'm exploring the desert. I didn't have stamina for a second swing. I went for it, though. Smack. 
I got a decent ring in the desert. Dexterity ring. Fighting him on the stairs here is kind of wonky. Okay, that's not bad damage. Okay, I can't interrupt his, like, level up. He just gets fire on his sword. Even if he doesn't complete the animation. Yeah, that comes out faster than I expected to. The little, like, hand smack attack. Sadly, you're not doing a very good job backseating me, honestly. <laughs> if you're trying to be an annoying backseater, I know you can do better than that, King. I know you can. Mm, I guess I'll heal. Ooh, that was a mistake. He's so close to dying. This is where I choke. Schmeck. Alright, sweet. That took all my S's. How many souls does this guy give? 640. Oh, is that a put fire on my sword spell? Hmm. I don't really use spells. Reinforce right weapon with flame, yeah. Pyromancy. Uh, can I, like, use that? Hold on. What's, like, requirements for this? Is this big guy gonna respawn? I have no S's, so I should heal. <laughs> That's the password of the secret dungeon, the amount of hairs on this guy's mech. Oh, he doesn't respawn. Sweet. Maybe the other guy doesn't respawn, too. That other area. Oh, I have the requirements for this. Hold on. I need, like... I think I need a talisman. I don't think I can do it with the pyromancy flame, can I? Actually, I don't know how spells work in Dark Souls games. I think I need a talisman to do that one. Let me equip that spell. I think I can do that at the bonfire. This is where I got attuned it, baby. Now, can I use it? How do I, how do I do it? No, I need a ta- Oh, there we go, that did it. The block does it? The block is like left hand. Okay, okay. That's actually really good. I'll actually like use my magic now. Okay, cool. So block one-handed. Cool. My club goes on fire. Yeah, I think the club's actually better than the sword. It has a special ability too that I like. Okay. So I'm looking for a potential third bell. Might be it for this area though. Like you just go to that little temple, ring some bells, and then that's it. Where there's not like a, a final boss though, and then like you're blocked, or you know, a developer message saying, you know, in development, check back when mod release out of beta or whatever. I mean, there's more to explore. Hmm. Oh, there's a oasis down there. That's super cute. I'm screenshotting that. Uh, actually, I'm not. I was gonna press my keyboard, but then I'm scared that I might fuck up my game controller. Ooh, a well. That's looking like death. That's not looking like I can go down there. The hooked sword lady is scary. Maybe that shortcut? Fight him over here. I don't know what happened to the sandworm. Give me like a spear or something. Give me a weapon I want to use. Oh, I aggroed somebody. Hey, guy. It's on me. Off we. Oh, that was quick. That was quick roll out of attack. I mean, I can upgrade my sword too. But instead, I will run away. I don't know if he's faster with that buff. I don't remember his, like, roll attack being faster. Can I backstab him? Mm, maybe not. <laughs> it's getting screenshotted, but not really. Not really getting screenshotted, though. Oh, I don't want to fight this guy. Fuck. Let me know, guy. I mean, the big guy didn't respawn. Yeah, I'll just retreat to the bonfire, I guess. God, I can't believe I got attunement. Oh, So freaking garb up. I'm never gonna live that down. <laughs> Levels of Tumen and Dark Souls, oh my god. I thought it was endurance. I thought I was gonna get endurance, no. Yeah, don't believe me. Area over there, I'm just gonna go to this temple, I guess. Did the miners really like aggro on me? No, I think they're just kind of chilling. Cool buildings. Looks like I can go into this mine. Just bury him at Sekiro now. Looks like that guy's guarding the mine. I mean, it's obvious to me that, like, you know, the big boss would be in that temple. I call it a temple because it reminds me of Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Desert temple. Oh, I can avoid these two guys. I'm looking for third bell. Third bell into opening door into... Bosh. Bosh, bosh, bosh. I don't know. I'd have to use a shield if I parried. This shit is not happening.
Can I sneak on past? Oh, bell! Ding! Wait! Was there a bell on the other side? I think there was. With one of these guys guarding it. Hold on. Is this the item run where I just run through this whole area? Ooh, zoom out on the camera. Sandworm, sandworm. Quinn, Quinn, Quinn. Um. So he lightning attacked like nobody. Oh! Sandworm, Quinn, Quinn, Quinn. I mean, I'm just getting free souls, I guess. What's he damaging? Something like underneath? Might be another soul over here. Or another bell, rather. Ah! Um. Let me learn. <laughs> but a wee Humphrey lad. Alright. Yeah, I think there was another bell that I ignored because I didn't think I could ring it. On, like, the far area. Did I see a bonfire up there? I saw some sort of flame on top of that hill. Ooh, I do like this area. Ooh, another bell? How many freaking bells are there? I'm just gonna ring it. I'm not gonna fight this guy. This will be the fourth one, I think. Yeah, sweet. Thank God for item interaction invincibility. Leave me alone, guy. I just want to ring bells. I just want to be a bell ringer. Actually, did that guy un aggro? Nope, no invisible wall, okay. I have a homeward bone if I want to use one. I might just lose my souls and never get them back. Can I get on top of that like a bridge? I don't think so. And like arc in that building. Yeah, Oasis is super cool in the desert. Oh, crab enemy! Crab, crab, crab. I haven't fought one of the spear guys yet. I don't know how hard they are. Oh, hook sword lady. Okay, spear guy did not aggro on me. They probably have a chance to drop their spear, which I really would like, but you know, I'm not I'm not certain, you know, so it's like I don't know if I really want to spend time trying to farm their weapon. Oh, minor guy aggroed on me. That's fine though. I'll fight the minor guy. Where are minor guys? Oh, twinkling titanite. I don't know if I'll use a boss weapon. I need to find a weapon first. Check. Yeah, these minor guys are like the one enemy I'm not scared of. I guess the ghost enemies in the catacombs weren't so bad either. I bet the, the crabby crab drops a cool item. I think there's only one final bell. There was a bell like on the far left, which I didn't really realize that you could ring, I think. Don't want to fight the crampy crabs. There's gotta be like an item in the middle of there, right? Super cool oasis, though. There's kind of an item. Ooh, mini crab guy. Oh, bully the the baby crabs. Bully, bully. <laughs> Mommy crab, no. I'm Joey. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, I kind of want to top off my health even more, but it's kind of a waste. Let me just grab this item real quick. I'm gonna aggro this guy. Oh, this is a javelin guy. That's different than a spearman. Ooh, another ring. Oh, that guy's gonna fight Crab? Where's he going? Where's Javelin guy doing? This is not a unique uh, enemy. It's from the DLC. I mean, it's reskinned slightly. It's got like a red cape instead of a blue cape. And that makes it unique. Crab, crappy crabs. Um, Sandworm. Maybe you ring enough bells and the sandworm dies. Let me take one last chug of my Estus here. It's just the item run. I'm just running through, grabbing some items. Don't mind me. Hello, friends. Black firebomb. Grab this item over here. Was there anything left side? There was the sandworm. I don't, I don't see any items, though. Uh-oh. Might be a little too close to the sandworm. Uh-oh. Ooh, a well-deserved break for corruption. How very exciting. Yeah, you gotta take breaks, you know. You can't just be grinding away all the time. Oh, javelin thrower, how rude. Oh, I didn't even look at that other ring. I think it's like a bleed ring, though. I'm not sure if I really care about that. 
One more SS. That's my final SS going in. I guess the sandworm spawned because I zoomed out with my camera. Don't poke me. I've got a thousand souls. Oh, what? <laughs> Rip off. That's not bad, though. I explored the whole area. I got all the bells. There's one more bell for me to ring. And then I'm guessing it's final boss of this area. And then I'm guessing area stops because, you know, it's a demo. Oh, goody girl went over here. Hello, goody girl. Oh, the, the guy in front of this area, I guess, was the guy she was talking about. Uh, I'm not going to learn any pyromancies. To access the crypt, you must awaken Obidiah. So a loud enough noise should dampen his focus long enough. Yeah, five ritual bells. Yeah, there's one more bell for me to get. Let me go get that. Oh, shippy time for shippy gloom. Yeah, I woke up like uh, two or three hours ago. I made some mac and cheese. Man, I don't know. After my work week, I just like fucking exhausted and I sleep like so long. Ugh. Stupid work. I don't know. I've saw, thought about like go, going on like a consistent sleep schedule where like every day I wake up at like four o'clock. It's hard though. It's hard for me to wake up when I don't need to wake up. Like when I don't need to go to work, I don't have anything going on. It's hard for me to force myself to wake up like that. Um, I want this item, but I also want to recover my souls. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna do both. Give me that. Ooh, embers are nice. <laughs> I didn't realize how much stuff you own, Corruption. Yeah. That's funny. I do like stuff, you know? I'm a stuff enjoyer. I like collecting things. I've got a little video game collection, little vinyl collection. I've got a little Pikmin plushie collection. It's fun to collect, but you know, you don't want to overdo it. You don't want to buy a bunch of stuff. There's a enemy chasing after me. I don't know where my souls are exactly. I don't have a bow, I can't get the corpses out of the trees. Yeah, there's my souls, okay. Ooh, hook sword lady, she's risky. Yeah, absolutely, Corruption. I'm a big, big music enjoyer. Well, so much for recovering my souls there. That's simply not going to happen. But yeah, I'm, I love vinyl records. I've got a vinyl player too. Nya, nya, nya. Nya, 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 you take that back. You take that back, Corruption. It's too sweet of you. Yeah, if you look at the last stream, you can see I have a vinyl collection like up on my wall. All the actual records are outside of the frames because vinyls are kind of heavy and I don't want to put more stress on like the nails in the wall. But yeah, you can see some of the collection. Yeah, it's on display. It's in my room over my bed. I think I think that was last stream, although that wasn't actually live content because I'm best streaming. Is this is a boss arena. Ah. <laughs> Alright, if I want to fight the sandworm, I know where to go. <laughs> yeah, I think I simply will avoid that area. I think I'll go ring the bell instead, unlock the boss, and then maybe fuck off, depending on how hard the boss is. Go to a different area, get some more levels, maybe find a weapon that I want to use. This club just ain't cutting it. Oh shit, that's funny. Yeah, vinyl collection, little plushie collection, video game collection. Anything in this like little area? Okay, there's hook sword lady. I don't want to fuck with her. Let me know. Yeah, I didn't realize I could ring this bell, but now I know. Let's run over here. Ring the bell and let's probably die. That's fine. I can die. At least there's not like a Dark Souls 2 punishment for dying. Because that game is Garbo. Yeah, sweet. Let me ring this bell. Let's get that on out of here. Oh, I keep forgetting to look at that ring. I mean, I've got the ring slots. So I may as well equip it. Ding! Yeah, I'm super dead here. I'll just die. I'm not even trying to roll away. Necromancer awaits me. Cool. All five bells got rung. There's still the... I'm gonna explore the mine before I go to the boss, though. Because I love exploring. Exploring my food. <laughs> Dude, I can't believe I got that fucking attunement stat. It's actually worthless, too, because... You know, I think you need, like, two to... Two to you need, I don't know, a certain amount of attunement to get, like, another spell level. Spell, like slot. <laughs> it's so useless. It's so useless. Alright, let's fight this guy. I like putting fire on my thing, though. At least you know, I can use one spell, I guess. Fight me, guy. Let me go to the mine. Can I backstab? Ooh, nice. It's a real nice start to the fight. Okay, yeah, he doesn't stagger at all. Any enemy that doesn't stagger is kind of rough. 
Yeah, it's different attacks from his roll. Some of them come out quick, some of them not so much. Yeah, like I go for a fully charged heavy, but I didn't stagger off of it, so it's like, is it really all that effective? I want to do a double sip, but I do a single sip, a roll away, and then another sip. Stagger out my sippy sips from my sippy cup. Oh. Okay, well that took all my flasks. I still only have four flasks. <laughs> yeah, it's weird. It's a weird way to do a mod because it's like I don't know what area to go to first. It's very strange. But I guess it's like Demon Souls. Oh, it's like an Elden Ring mine. I guess I get upgrade materials here. Yeah, there's like, um, there's no dedicated jump button. There's like, um, farmable items, like from collecting things. Will this w waken this guy up? Kind of don't want to fight him. Okay, we're fighting him. These guys are easy though. Although I don't remember that jump attack. This guy might be powered up version. My like side swipe missed his head. <laughs> I was scared to roll back there, too, because I thought maybe I'd fall off. I mean, I guess this is just an area to get upgrade materials. It probably loops around and pops back out. Do I want to go back to the mine? I guess I'll go see the boss. I lost, like, 300 souls there. I'm not too worried about it. Yeah, cool. So the boss is... Arena's there. I was in full health, so... <laughs> he didn't quite one-shot me. I think I was a... Oh! The Cormancer, cool. Alright, my damage is not great. Custom boss, though? This mod is awesome. Okay, that's not how I expected that attack to come out. He's doing a bunch of black flame stuff. Yeah, he holds that. Yeah, this damage is not good. I do very little damage. <laughs> it's not even like in the yellow bar. Yeah, I'll probably fuck off and then come back. <laughs> I think it's fuck off time. Go unlock another boss. Yeah, weird. I don't know, like, what area to go to. It's so weird. Like, the very first area I tried, I was doing, like, no damage to those enemies. Yeah, she's still just chilling. Okay. We'll get out of here. Did I not unlock? I did, though. I unlocked a bonfire in another area. I guess like, I gotta go to Firelink every single time I want to go to another area that I'm not currently in. Seems kind of weird. Maybe I start leveling up strength and dexterity to use this black blade. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea, I guess. It's not really the weapon I want to use, though, but it's the only weapon I've found that isn't that, like, level one sword or whatever. Am I going here? This is desert area. Yeah, we'll try this area next, I guess. Ooh, spooky scary. Scary area. Wait a minute. This is a Dark Souls 3 area. Also, my dude is levitating. <laughs> I've learned levitation magic. It's more wind. Yeah, Cathedral of the Deep. Yeah, there was another area that was just like a remix Dark Souls 3 area. Okay. Probably can't open this. Yeah, I don't know for the side. Man, I really don't want to be using the club. I guess I'll use the black blade. Hmm. It's the only weapon I've really found. Wait, what's... Did I see a prompt pop up? No. Chain. Cage dudes. This is like zombie area. At least from the actual game. Ooh, doggies, my favorite. I love the doggies. Uh, what? No? Oh. Hello, doggy. I think they're just normal Dark Souls 3 dogs. Just like a zombie reskin. Ooh, shield. Eh, not gonna use that. Ooh, it is like Bloodborne. Yeah, Bloodborne land. God, I really want Bloodborne for PC, goddammit. <laughs> I would buy that game again. Freaking Sony. Ooh, what's up here? Yeah, they like stagger on one hit. 
And kind of bully them into the corner, yeah. Is there a trap at this item? Ooh, old greatsword. I don't usually use greatswords, but... It's not a club. Oh, I can actually use it too? I have enough strength? Yeah, I do. It's pretty cool. Yeah, I'll use this weapon. I mean, maybe not for the whole playthrough, but I'll use this over the club. What's my special... Oh, it's the, like, lunge attack. Okay. Poise boost into... Uppercut attack kind of deal. Dougie. Oh, no. Come back here. Huh. This is, like, similar damage to the club. I'm still, like, three-shotting these guys. No, it does significantly more damage, though. It's still three shots to the dogs, but... The dog had very little health on the third attack. Okay. I wish I had, like, a little hip lantern, like an owner ring. I'm a security cat. Hello, Dougie. Help me! Oh, it's that thing. Oh, I forgot about my ring, too. G immediately aggroed onto me. Ooh, boost, ro boost rolling invincibility? Yeah. Fuck some of my defense, though. I just won't equip that. Seems kind of wonky to equip that. Just do, like, an item run. I don't know where the witch went. Um, I do not see no witch. Oh, there she is. Plunging attack. That was too short. Too much of a short king. So she's going to grab me here, yep. So the other area I went to off stream. Oh, I did not expect that range. Sip, sip, sip. Did not have like custom enemies, but the sand level had nothing but custom enemies, which is cool. This area doesn't seem to have custom enemies. I'm glad I found this great sword. Oh, that feels good. Oh, she got me some SS back. Iron club? Hmm. Ooh, iron priest hat. It looks like a Castlevania kind of helmet. Oh, my equip load is fucked up with this greatsword. Can I wear anything? Maybe a pyromancer cloak? Yeah, I can wear a pyromancer cloak. Okay. Ooh, I kind of look like a Bloodborne character. She dropped a club. Let's check this out. Iron club. Mm, I think I'll stick with the greatsword. Yeah, greatsword seems fine. I like dex weapons, but I haven't really found one that I want to use yet. This probably doesn't scale with dex at all. Just barely E. D scaling with strength. Oh, I didn't mean to roll there. Okay. Ember is useful. How many embers do I have? Like five? I have five embers. Probably don't want to ember up quite yet, though. I don't want to ember up for boss fights, though, but... Yeah, I'll ember up maybe later. Schmeck. Oh, cage guy is aggroed on me. No cage man. Yeah, I think he hit me with, like, a little super greedy going for a third attack there. Yeah, I didn't think it was greedy going for a third attack there. It should be, like, the AoE of his, like, ground slam, where, like, it doesn't, the pot doesn't hit you, but the aftershock of hitting the ground hits you. Exploding bolts. Another cage, dude. I think I'm looping around now. Oh, uh, yeah, this loops around like the lower area. I've got one flask left. Hmm. I think I'll keep exploring them. Yeah, Dark Souls, Endur or Dark Souls 3 Endurance doesn't give you more equip load. It's like a certain. It's like his vitality. There's like a unique stat that does equip load. I always want to like be wearing cool armor and still like light rolling around. Maybe I'll find Havel and I can borrow his ring. I am not going to firebomb this guy. Kind of silly. I think this guy's less here than the pot guy go though. The saw guy. Wonky camera. Yeah, he smacks around a lot. I really like this sword. Sweet. I'm a happy boy. Yeah, just play nice and safe. He staggers on, like, running strong attack. I can just kind of stagger him to death. It's a strength weapon, but if I find a dex weapon, I'll probably switch to that. Sweet. Titanite shard. Maybe I will upgrade this sword. I have enough Titanite shards to be able to do it. 
and still have enough to like upgrade a different weapon if I want to switch to it. It's a very cute shirt. It's like a boss weapon. Yeah, unique bosses? Oh man. I can't believe I tried to play Dark Souls 2 instead of playing like a Dark Souls 3 mod. Like, what the hell's wrong with me? I don't know. <laughs> I don't freaking know. Uh, leave me alone, scary guy. Um, can I kill that guy? I don't know really where that guy came from. I don't think I can drop down here. Yeah, this is like a remix Dark Souls 3 area. The other area I went off stream was a remix Dark Souls 3 area as well. But that sand area? Oh my god. Complete custom. Okay, one dog, one cage guy. Yeah, I deal with this guy first though. He's just a reskinned cage guy. Oh wait, no, he's not a cage guy. He's from the DLCs. Yeah. Except he's got like a different body. Can't backstab him. Yeah, I think next time I go to the Nexus, I'll upgrade this sword. I do recognize this guy's attacks though. It's not a cage guy. It's like a faceless, like round circle guy, ball guy. Actually, that might be shortcut over there. In base game, it is. <laughs> what? <laughs> Little Shylet. Little Shylet when hopefully streaming. Oh, I didn't mean to do that attack. It's Dark Souls 2. Oh my god. It's gonna happen, Silent. I'm going to play Dark Souls 2 on stream in its completion. I just gotta be like drunk or high or sleep deprived. One of those three has to happen for me to play Dark Souls 3 to its completion. Or Dark Souls 2 to its completion. Drunk, high, or very much sleep deprived. Ooh. Great shield. I this might be shortcut. Kick down a ladder. Yeah, kick ladder, sweet. Shortcut unlocked. <laughs> it's Dark Souls 2. <laughs> I mean the game looks good, you know. I got nice textures, nice lighting, engine, dead zone fix so it controls better. You actually have like 360 control on your character. Not all the mods in the world will save you, Dark Souls 2. Oh man. Yeah, it's very weird. There is actually people that think like Dark Souls 2 is a good game, which is weird. It's just like, oh, they might not be wrong, it might be a good game, but it's not like, it's not a great game. It's painfully mid, it's so mid. It's so mid it hurts. Like damn, this game is mid. I don't think a spear is, I mean, this resource, I'm really liking this sword, I don't know. If I find a spear, I'll try it out, but I don't know if I'll actually use it. Just I like this sword so much. Yeah, it's a Souls like more than it is like a actual from software game, right? So there's two cage guys. That's not what I wanted to do. There we go. Okay. I go book the doggies. The me oh, the doggy teleported on top of me. That's not what I wanted to happen. Hmm. I'm gonna try to get to the ladder, I think. I'll try that. Maybe? I don't know if the dogs will follow me. Looks like they're not following me. Hmm. I mean, I got the shortcut. I guess I go back to the bonfire. Refill my Estus. Where exactly am I, though? How do I get back to the bonfire from here? I gotta fight this guy with, like, no health. Ooh, I miss. Run away. Uh, oh, hello, doggy. Hit the bonfire. I'm not near the bonfire, am I? I'm not going to the bonfire. Ah! <laughs> Let me know, doggy. I don't think I'll get one shot from the dog. Let's see, let's see. Up here, maybe. Yeah, here we go, bonfire. Cool. Humanity, sweet. Why is there like a green aura now? Is this guy gonna F off so I can use the bonfire? Let's get even more distance on him, I guess. I mean, if I die here, it's fine, because I'll just recover my soul, no problem. He's actually not aggroed on me. I can't use the bonfire. Let's run back here, I guess. I do really like this greatsword. I will upgrade it. Oh, what the? What's this? It's a plant. <laughs> I thought maybe I could interact with that. Whoa, plant. Whoa. My fire buff lasts a long time, damn. Got lucky with that spell. I can't believe I got a fucking attunement level, God damn it! Such a freaking noob. Such a newbie noob. Alright, sweet. 
Back to the Nexus. I thought I was getting endurance. Yeah, it's weird that you can't just teleport to other areas. You gotta go back to the Nexus and then teleport to like another area. Do, 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 do. Ooh. Yeah, let's upgrade this great sword. Yeah, enforce this. Do I need more souls? Yeah, cool. I'm using a lot of my upgrade materials, but that's fine. If I use this great sword the entire playthrough, whatever. I like the dex weapons, but eh, I like this great sword too. I'm gonna use like one soul item. Will this be enough? No, I need to use an actual like soul item that gives me a significant amount of souls. Oh, that's a lot of souls. Hold on, I think these are stronger too. Yeah, 3,000 souls. I'll just use them all and level up as much as I can. Probably want endurance for like a great sword. Yeah, now I need large Titanite shards. So like, I've only found like small Titanite shards. Maybe I don't want to be exploring a second area before I like do a first area, because maybe you'll find better upgrade materials or they'll scale up. I don't know exactly how this mod works. Maybe I should have read into it a little bit more, but I did not. Uh, infuse weapon. I have no gems. I am infusing shit. Transpose weapons. Oh, Andre will give me boss items or boss weapons. Okay. Although sometimes they're items too. Let me check out this guy. Check out these two dudes. See if they got anything to say. Good pupil. I suppose it will soon before you depart. Oh, thanks. Thanks for the humanities. Oh, there is actual co-op in this game. Like, it runs on its own server, which is pretty cool. Uh, actually... I mean, I can't do any of these miracles other than heal aid. Hmm. Nah, I just... I've got my one spell that I'll be using probably the entire game. My fire spell on my sword. Except the dark sigil? Oh, there's multiple endings? Sure. Young Hollow, the you are now my apprentice. You now walk. Dark sigil. Okay. I don't think I have, like, a way to cast these. Return the Dark Sigil? Okay. Might actually be... Ooh. Swag. Masochist's Mask? Yeah, all, all the armor sets are, like, unique. Fencing Saber? Oh, no. It's a dex weapon that... Actually, has e-scaling. It's barely a dex weapon. I mean, I think it's a dex weapon, but <laughs> e-scaling. Staff to... Cast some of these spells? Nah. We won't get anything from him. I'm a greatsword fire... Fire sword user. A plus one attunement ending. <laughs> oh my god. I mean, now I might. Will it tell me how many attunement slots? Maybe I want to use two spells because I mean, I got one attunement. I don't see attunement slots anywhere. Like I got one level, but I think I only have like the same like zero amount. Where that like one level of strength just gives me one more attack, but then the second level gives me three, two, four, two, four, two. Interesting. Let's get some more health, some more endurance. I'm looking for soft caps. Yeah, that's fine. I just upgraded my weapon a bunch. I probably don't need to get any damage right now. Where's my hug? Where's my hug? Where's my hug? God, I just want to be a where's my hug guy so badly. The throne is shattered with many small cricks. Alright, we'll go back. I could probably grind away at that boss. I've got an upgraded sword. i got a weapon I like. But we'll go back to this area, I think. Cathedral of the Deep. Yeah. Alright, let me hop up and stretch. I'll be right back. Stretchy tan.
<laughs> is, that, is that a smolchy emote? No. It's it's like a smolchy emote, but it's not, I don't think. The black and white. <laughs> the what face, I think is what that is. Kind of looks like that individual is experiencing some sort of orgasm, but I don't think that's the, I don't think that's what the emote is trying to convey there. I think that's, uh, some, I think that's just my dirty mind going into dirty places. Oh my god, I can't wait to play more Dark Souls 3. I'm so excited. God, I can't believe I was trying to play Dark Souls 2. What the hell is wrong with me? Oh, hello, t bubbles Hey, do we welcome to the office, right? Hope you're doing well. I mean, that's what I look like <laughs> when I'm having a good time, you know? Oh my god, they got rid of the poison in this area. Liege. Liege activity from the mod creator. Uh, let's go take the shortcut, I guess. I could explore around the castle, around, like, the moat, but I think I'll just go to, like, where I think the boss is going to be. Maybe when this mod comes out in its completion, I'll spend a little bit more, more time exploring. Like, that upgrade cave, I'm not super excited to explore. I might just skip that one. Let's get most of the exploration. Ah, oh, you scared me, Doogie. Oh, yeah, nice. I two-shot the dogs now with the upgraded sword. Ah, Tamanaki. Yeah, it's a similar sort of vibe, right? Oh, it's based off a manga panel. Oh, manga. Very cool. I guess there were a bunch of items over here. Is that big guy gonna respawn? Yeah, it's just a reskinned enemy here, the arm. From the DLC. Oh, I chonk into him, though. Schmick. I don't know, it's a slow weapon, which I'm not a huge fan of. But I like it a lot more than the club. Okay, come fight me, doggies. Oh, cool, I aggroed the dogs and not the... Oh, I think they're weak to fire. Maybe? Not those guys. Yeah. Thanks for stopping by saying hi, t -bamos. Did I get a spell from that doggy? I'm not sure what that was. That might have been a weapon. Have a good uh, sippy sippy time, and thank you for the hug, that's very very sweet of you! Uh, t -bubu, such a sweetheart. What a sweetie! I can't do a self-hug though, because the webcam's not on, but... But I'll do one anyway, uh, such a sweet, uh, Such a sweetie! Oh, uh, come here, cage dudes, fight me. Bored or about to sneeze? Yeah, I'm not sure the exact emotion it's supposed to convey, but it's a good emote. Nevertheless, for sure. Oh my god! I'm pretty pathetic though. That's a real emo right there. Schmick. Oh. They do not stagger from a uh, running heavy attack. Top off my health here. Pathetic. Oh! Oh my god! Flipman's overcoat! I can cosplay as one of these dudes! Oh my god, I'm so cute! Yeah, a bunch of cool custom armor in this game. This mod, you know? Oh my god. This shit is crazy. There's like a little mini bill. I think this is the last guy. Does he stagger off a charge? He does. This should be pretty easy. As long as I play patient. Ooh, I could do a cosplay. That'd be fun. For Halloween, I always dress up as like generic World War II soldier guy. But it kind of doubles as like a soldier TF2 kind of cosplay. Not really. It's just the helmet that you wear, like, above your eyeballs. It was actual Soldier TF2 cosplay, it would. I'd have, like, a red coat or a blue coat on. And white branch. Ooh, that's not the special one, is it? That prevents, you know, Archer dude from doing something to me. Yeah, oh, Essence Shard, that's good. Level up my Essence Flask. I think it'll give me more uses. Yeah, the hover renames don't do anything. <laughs> They're just scams. They're just scams. Yes, I greedy, greedy. Very, very greedy streamer. I want all the coins. Give me all the coins. Give me the coins. You used to do something, but that was a long, long time ago. That was a long, long time ago. I mean, I kind of did something when, when the Yeet Redeem. Ooh. Moon. It's just like Bloodborne. The moon's in that game, too. Uh-oh. Skilly enemy. I've only got one flask left. I don't know what this guy does. He's a ranged user. This game is copying Bloodborne. There's a moon. Yeah, I look forward to fighting that unique boss in the sand level. Oh my god, I'm having so much fun, actually. I don't know. 
it might not be obvious like when the demo is over looks like it's the very first area to each of like the main areas it seems maybe there's five bosses five like areas don't think i want to top off my health there's the whole like area around the castle to explore i mean i found a weapon that i could use this whole playthrough or this whole like demo ouchie oh my ss does not heal very much it's undead bone shard that gives it more power but the ss shard gives it more uses i think kind of low health running through here this is just a Dark Souls 3 area with different enemies though, so I'm not super impressed. The sand area was super cool. No, I don't think so, Silent. I think it's just a demo. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, if it is five areas with five bosses, I mean, that seems pretty complete to me. I don't know, I haven't read enough about the demo, to be honest. Uh, I don't like this guy coming in here. I'm out of heals. Yeah, I probably should have done more reading before I decided to play this demo, to be honest. Can I open this gate? I can. There's a lot of enemies on me right now. I'll be spam rolling away. Roll, roll, roll. Like, I haven't gotten a shortcut. There's a big enemy over there. I will run away. Which enemy? Come on, give me a bonfire. <laughs> Get my mouth. Yeah, did you see the eyeballs? I saw those too, Silent. When I was opening up the gate. Oh. That's a unique enemy. Or at least a reskin of one. Yeah, this is Bloodborne area for sure. No. I'm super dead, right? Nope, I'm good. Yeah, that's a Bloodborne enemy. Oh, fuck. I really want a bonfire. Shit. <laughs> oh, this guy's cool. I mean, he's just a reskin guy, but he had a different attack. Yeah, that's a bloodborne enemy. The like, the like, I think they're face suckers. I think they they suck out your brains. That's what they do. All right, all right. Uh, maybe I'll go to another area. Actually, uh, I, I'm losing some souls if I do, but that's fine now. I think. Yeah, I don't like having to go back to the nexus whenever I want to go to a different area. I don't know how much of this demo I'll play, cause yeah, I should have read more about the demo and like what makes it a demo and. Not sure. Like, maybe I'll, maybe I'll attempt that boss. Let me do some boss attempts. Because I'm guessing after that boss, it'll say end of, you know, demo area. End of area for the demo, you know. There's more to this area, but... But for the demo, it's just this. It's just like the first boss of the of the sand area, and then you go deeper into the sand area. Oh, was Obi Dyer pleased? Ritual bells? I already mm -hmm. rang them on. Bell. Oh, no. Farewell. Yeah, let me do some boss attempts. I might still be kind of low level though. Oh, I can upgrade my SS flask. I'll remember to do that after this boss attempt. Ooh, he's got a kick attack. This guy might be a little too tough for me. My damage isn't... As bad as it was before, though. AoE, yeah. Schmick. Is this an AoE? Yeah. <laughs> I thought maybe I'd get behind him and get some damage in, but that's just the AoE. I mean, that's decent amount of health bar to got gone. I want to, yeah, I want to fight. I want to kill this guy and then. I wanted to say, okay, this is the end of the demo for this area, for the sand area. Let me go upgrade my SS flask, which I probably have to do. Oh no, wait, a two? No. Probably have to do that at the embers. Yeah, this guy's very, very fit. Back handspring, very cute. Is it here that I do it? Do I do it with the fire maiden? I have it. Oh, yeah, increase my Estus usage. Thanks. I uh, already upgraded my sword. Yeah, just get me back in there. Oh, I keep thinking I need a teleport here. 
Can't do anything with these statues. Yeah. Why? Why is the? It's so funny. The storage box is a character now. That's kind of funny. It's kind of funny. Yeah, I really want to get past this boss. Have it say, you know, end of demo area, and then go to the next area. Ideally. I wonder if the mod creator will let you, like, carry over your save from demo to, like, floral release. I should have read about the demo more. <laughs> I don't know exactly what to do. Oh, it's the storage box character in Demon Souls again. Yeah, because they're doing the same, like, um, exploration from Demon Souls where, like, you go to any area you want. In any order. Yeah, there's two, like, black flame ranged attacks. One's, like, a fireball and one goes in the ground. So two different timings for that. Anyway. Ooh, I miss. Ooh, I miss again. He's got some really fa fast, like, stab attacks with his sword. That was a really bad attack. Oh, cheap. Yep. I know, I've never played Demon Souls, I'm a fake from software fan. I'm but a faker daker, I'm not a real fan like the guylet. Like the little guylet, I love Humphrey Pathetic. I mentioned it before, but yeah, it's it's kind of hard to tell what kind of emotion it's supposed to be, but because I know it's really, really good. It's really, really good. I'll probably go back and touch it up a bit. The eyes probably could be outlined, and maybe even the hair. But I'll do that myself, little guylet. That's no problem. Yeah, you get like 40 emotes on Twitch. If you have like a really high subscriber count. Yeah, my Estus barely heals me at all. Oh, I forgive you, Sal. You didn't, you didn't need to give me an apology gift. I wasn't actually upset. I wasn't actually upset. I was just teasing you. Hopefully this guy doesn't have a phase two. Yeah, I need better heals. I need an undead bone shard. Yeah, maybe I'll fuck off and go to another area. <laughs> Smack. Yeah, I mean, I could get him if I kept at it. No stamina to roll. The kick is real hard to dodge. The kick gets me a lot. Yeah, maybe I'll go to the other areas. There was, a, there was, there was that like Dark Souls 2 area. <laughs> kind of funny to remake one of the Dark Souls 2 areas into Dark Souls 3. Let me get another shot. Let me give it another shot. Give me some fire. Fire probably isn't very effective against this guy, being the desert and all. But it's what I got, so it's what I'm using. Don't need to recover any souls. Yeah, there's the kick. Oh, this is a new attack. I haven't seen that one before. Yeah, I can tell he's putting it in the ground. In what context, Silent? Who would win? What's, what are all these like new attacks I've never seen before? What the heck are you? <laughs> what are all these new attacks? Alright, I might fuck off, go somewhere else. Oh, who's Sekiro though, Silent? You mean Wolf? I think Wolf is like the main character in Sekiro. Why is Sekiro called Sekiro? Wait, who's Sekiro, Silent? Is your name Sekiro? Am I dumb? I thought your name was like Wolf. I thought, does, does a little king guy call you Wolf? <laughs> the main character from Sekiro or Liza P, the Pinocchio guy? Um, I don't know, Silent. I mean, I, 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 I don't know. <laughs> It's gonna tell you. Gonna tell you that one, King. Not too sure about that one. Alright, we'll go to this area then, I guess. The one at the very top was just a remix Dark Souls 3 area. The one right there, remix Dark Souls 3 area. Wait, is this a Dark Souls 2 area? No, this has gotta be the Dark Souls 2 area. It's got the Dark Souls 2, like, giant. Alright, we'll find. I think this is the final area to go to. Oh, wait, no, it's not. This is the Dark Souls 2 area. Okay, so this is the area I haven't been. Oh, Sekiro in Japanese mean one-armed wolf. I didn't know that. Oh, that's cute. That's a cute. When I played through Sekiro, I played with 
the Japanese um, voice actors. Oh, it's a Dark Souls 2 area. Dude. This guy actually made Dark Souls 2 good. What the heck, dick? <laughs> dick, dick. He just ported it to Dark Souls 3. Easy. Wait a minute. Or is this a Dark Souls 3 area? I think it's a Dark Souls 2 area, but like this bridge reminds me of the Dark Souls 3 snowy bridge. Step no further into Elaim Lois. A sickness burns within and will surely bring ruin. I don't know, this seems like final area maybe. Why is this guy ignoring me? That's weird. Let me hit him once and then just ignore me. Yeah, I'm going to say this area is a little too high level for me. <laughs> I'm going to leave now. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Wait, this is an Elden Ring area. This is like Dark Souls 2 DLC, I think. Yeah, this is, it even had like the Dark Souls 2 giant, right? It's like the little throne thing. So I think the very top is kind of low level as well. You lost me at Dark Souls 2. <laughs> yeah, this I, this is what I played off stream. I just kind of ran through this area and made sure the game was working. Let's try out this area. Ooh, that's a good shorty pap. Mm, delicious. No illusory walls I've found yet. Yeah, I'm guessing... I'm not gonna be able to beat very many bosses. I really need a undead bone shard. My heals are really weak. I need a lot of levels. So what do you pop up my crowns? Oh, um... I'm not too worried about a solid. It's like a zero sugar kind of sodi pup. But yeah, it's probably a bad idea, so <laughs> I'm gonna, I brush my teeth real good, though. I brush my teeth out real good. I still have it. I put it in like a bag. <laughs> um, yeah, what happened is I went into like the back room and I was snacking on some snacks, you know? We had like some, some Swedish fish, which are like, you know, gummies. Ooh, Dark Souls 3 area. And, you know, they're like... They're soft, like, chewy, gummy snacks. And my crown popped out. So, like, I spit all of them out into my hand and, like, recovered my crown. Harvest ingredient? Oh, yeah. I don't know how to craft. Is that a... That's a lizard. I want that lizard to die. Yeah, those guys are gonna fight each other. Okay, lightning glitches. Could turn shadows off for this area, probably. Looks like Wayne Guardian beats normal soldier dude. Yeah, let me turn the shadows off for this area, I guess. <laughs> Run away real quick. Shadows off. Yeah, whatever. It's fine. Don't look that bad. Yeah, the Swedish fish will do you in for sure. Yeah, I spit it all out into my hand. Somebody was like back there with me and like <laughs> talking to me. She was like, I can't believe I just witnessed that. And I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I'm glad she wasn't grossed out. She thought it was kind of, I don't know, not cool, but she, she definitely wasn't grossed out by me spitting my crown out into my hand and fucking like recovering it. I put it in like a little plastic bag. <laughs> Gross. Well, these guys transform. They're like angels though. In Dark Souls 3, they're like scary. Smack. Oh, scythe. I need 14 decks. Hmm, seems a little slower than the scythe that I was using in Dark Souls 3. I upgraded this greatsword so much, though. Um, I don't think I have enough upgrade materials to really upgrade the scythe. Where's my upgrade materials? Yeah, I only have one <laughs> Titanite's shard. Yeah, we'll switch. We'll stick with the greatsword for now. Oh, there's a bow. I can go back to the desert and get like two items that were just like floating on corpses humanity that gives me my half my health back i guess i could use that during a boss fight let me get that on the hot bar actually but i think it's used for pvp or co-op yeah co-op i think because there are co-op servers i'm playing in offline mode because i'm not gonna i'm not gonna co-op at all but i guess this game runs on its own server, which is cute. 
Oh yeah, I think that's a pretty common nightmare of like having your teeth fall off. I think it means something. I always have nightmares about like driving around with no brakes on my car or my wheels are falling off my car. Those are the kind of nightmares I have. I'm not like anxious about driving, so I don't really know what they mean, but it's a recurring dream for me is any kind of like car problem. Do you have that one too? Yeah. Driving around with no brakes or something like that, yeah. Animal <laughs> streamer. Yeah, have a good sheepy time, sheepy shit. Oh my god, I'm so happy I decided to stream. God, I love playing video games so much. I love not working. I got a cool sword. I'd like to see all the areas. I'm guessing it's just five areas. You know, they're all kind of small areas where there's only like one or two like smaller areas. And then boss for each area and then end of demo. You have a good sheepy time, Shadow. Thanks for hanging out with me. Oh, they're shooting at me. I'm gonna try running past them, I guess. I ran through this area before, and I know that that's a one-way door. You can't go past that, so... Go over here instead, I guess. I really want to find an undead bone shard. Increase my healing. Oh, the... Ballista shot that guy. These two guys are gonna fight each other. Might be able to get some easy souls from them if I... Circle back. The crossbow. How healthy is this guy? Eh, kinda healthy. Oh, I could've gone for a backstab there. Somebody's throwing firebombs at me. That's very rude. I'll run away. Reposition myself here on the bridge. Is somebody from underneath me? It might be. Ember Blossom. Yeah, somebody up there, actually. That guy gave me a sh an SS back. That was nice of him. How do I get up? This ladder is broken. There's gotta be a way up there. Oh, here we go. Oh, this guy's alive. Is he moving around? He is. In the actual game, there's a item there. Yeah, this is like a remix area. It's not super remix, but, you know, different enemies, different items. The lighting is different. And you're also, like, going through it backwards, so it feels quite a bit different. Fucking dude up there. I don't know how to get to him. Let me tough off my health. Yeah, that's fine, I think. I guess I'll just run past him. Give me another firebomb guy. Yeah, I ran through this area before off stream. So there's two remix areas from Dark Souls 3. There's two Dark Souls 2 areas, and there's one completely new area sand area, which was pretty cute. Oh. One fire. Don't mind if I do. I mean, I guess I rest. Ooh, longsword? Eh. Just keep using this greatsword. I use all my ochre materials on this greatsword. Probably use it the entire demo. Unique bosses, though? That's probably what I'm most excited about. Unique bosses. The only area I was super impressed with was the desert area. Oh, hey, guy. Bye-bye, oh, guy. But maybe this loops around a firebomb thrower. I'm getting these twinkling titanites, but I'm not using any boss uh, weapon. Blessed gem. Ooh, I miss. Schmick. Trying to think of the music that was playing during the like desert guy boss fight. I can't really remember it. I don't know if it's unique or maybe just reused music from Dark Souls 3. These guys aren't like guarding an item, but it's a pretty nice plunging attack. Can I actually get to that area? Is that playable area? I'm tempted to try to jump over there. If I can jump from there from on top of the rooftop, it probably is playable area. It's like obvious I can go over there. I'm trying to think of where I am right now. It's like, I know this area from Dark Souls 3. Yeah, I can definitely go over there. Usually there's like a cage guy that'll take you to like a unique covenant. Looks like this goes to the bridge. That's probably where boss is. Windmill area. Looks like I can kick down that ladder, so you can probably get on top of that windmill. Kinda love exploring. Uh let me top off my health before dropping down. I didn't even top off my health. I needed on that bone shot real badly. Okay, I meant a plunging attack there, but I did not.
Yeah, this just loops around to these guys. I don't think they're defending an item, so I don't really care too much. Maybe it's just how I circle back. Maybe this dead ends. Which are these guys? Oh, one of those guys on the bridge. There's like a bell girl. Let me fire up my sword. These guys are weak to fire. I'm really happy to have the fire spell right now. Do I need to kill this bell girl? It'd be kind of hard with this guy here. <laughs> well, he smacked her. Alright, he got her. Sweet. Yeah, fire fucks him up big time. This guy transforms. I'd like him not to do that. I'm gonna refresh my fire before fighting the other guy. Technician. Oh, wait. Wasn't there a big guy on the bridge? Wolf's blood sword grass? I think this is a coveted item. Just it wasn't Dark Souls 3. Maybe it's changed in this mod. I thought there was a big guy on the bridge. So this is completely different. Usually there's not a bridge here. That's cool. That's where I spawned in from. Yeah. Uh, let's stop off my health. I keep thinking my heals are going to do more, but they're all pretty weak, so... I don't think I waste very much Estus value there. This is a boss arena. Where's Zigward of Katarina? This is not a mimic, but let's check anyway. Okay. Yeah, charcoal. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Makes sense to give you that there, because those guys are weak to... Fire. I have a fire spell. The fire spell lasts a long time. The mod creator might have buffed that, which I like. I can even refresh it here. I think this is boss arena. Okay, fight me, boss. Oh, it's a uh, cleric beast from Bloodborne. It's pus ridden beast. Schmick. It actually is Cleric Beast, what the hell? What the heck are you? Hmm, I'm all out of heals. I also can't really leave. How many Homer Bones do I have, actually? Humanity will heal me. Let's try using the Humanity. It takes much longer to do than an Estus, but... Still heals. As long as I'm behind him, I'm pretty safe. Okay, he's pushing me around with his big arm. Yeah, it's definitely a uh, smack him in the butt kind of boss. Just stay behind him all the whole time. Oh, is he phase 2-ing? Oh, cheat. I can get him. This guy seems like an optional boss. That's cool. I guess, you know, the sand... There might be, like, an optional boss in each area. As well as, like, the main boss. Because, like, the sandworm in the desert area was, was optional. This guy seems optional, too. I'm not really sure what he'll drop that I want, but... Uh, I'll go back and fight him again. I don't remember how to do that, though. How many guys do I gotta run through? Just this way, right? Yeah. Just do it this way. Do a whole lot of running past enemies, probably. Full on flasks. It's probably weak to fire. Yeah, I mean, the game just give me fire resin as soon as I got there. Uh, I really, really want to untet bone shard. Get better flasks. My flasks are so weak right now. Did any of those little guys follow me up here? No. Okay, I kind of get a plunging attack, not enough like distance. Run past this guy. Yeah, I think I will. Oh, the... Okay, no, she's still there. I kind of swore there was like a big guy on the bridge. I guess not, though. Yeah, he's going to kill all those people. That's fine. I think I'm good to go. I don't think... I, eh, I could use a humanity just to top my health off. Yeah, sure. Oh, it doesn't reverse my hollowing. I have to do that with the Firekeeper. I could Ember, too. I guess I didn't need to... How much more HP is that give me? Quite a decent amount. Ooh, Black Fireballs might come in handy. I'll use those. Fire up my sword. Might get me in there. Definitely want to recover my souls. Like, what if I just throw one Firebomb at him? Okay, it doesn't stagger him, so it's not that helpful. Cool arena. Okay, 
Okay, I got the timing down for like his coming down attack. I got him with that, just barely. Ooh, I miss. <laughs> My freaking stab attack goes through his legs. Is that a visceral opportunity? Ooh, it is. I didn't hear an obvious sound cue for it, but it definitely was. I need to spam roll away and heal. Probably like three S's. Yeah, <laughs> freaking three S's there is so funny. Ooh, I waited too long to roll him. Oh, I can keep um, targeting him when he jumps up. I think I gotta be kind of farther away from him so the camera just doesn't lose him automatically when he jumps up. Damn, I really want this guy to die. <laughs> I do have boss soul upgrade, so if I find a boss soul that I want to use for a weapon, I can easily do that. Eh, do I want to keep running in there? Hmm. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I mean, I want my souls back. That wasn't bad. I really, really need an undead bone shard. My my heal is so weak, I was able to use three essences without being full health. No, I can't see shit because of the trees in my way. The foliage, no. The foliage! Okay, I might have not gone to the way I need to go. That loops around a bonfire. Somebody jumped off the map. You see souls? I don't know where the other one went. I could get some more armor on. I like light rolling around, but... That probably only does physical damage. As long as I'm below 60, I think. Let's see, is this slow roll? Hard to tell. No, oh, I forgot. I'm being attacked. Um, I think that guy who climbs ladders. Let's get all the armor on. Okay, that's definitely a heavy roll, so I think it's 66. This is the threshold. I'd rather wear pants than... gloves. For the swag. I don't think I have a... Yeah, I gotta... I gotta wear no pants. Somebody on the rooftop with me? No, he's below. Super tryhard. Don't even care about my... Fast roll anymore. Oh, I got boys now too. That might be helpful against the boss. Just in general. I get used to this roll speed. It's probably fine. Probably pretty good. Just run past all these guys. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, that's a very loud sound effect. Like, I can S this here. Let me humanity instead, I guess. No, I could Ember. Yeah, I'll Ember. This Estus is so weak. <laughs> I really need a Bone Shard. Alright, I think I'm just... Yeah, get in there. Fire up my sword. I didn't start one-handed, did I? No, I didn't. Schmeck. Mm, maybe get him away from this wall. Get to the center of the arena so I can get behind him, yeah. Oh, he grabbed me. Yeah. Put me down. Achy. Yeah, like, what did the I think I would only need one S to sit there, but two, because my S is so weak. Another double sip. He's gonna come back up with his hand? No. And I'm behind him, that's where I wanna be. I can't see shit. That's a stagger though. Can I get a visceral off? Alright, sweet. I have no stamina. Huh, my visceral doesn't recover my stamina. I had zero stamina coming out of that visceral.
Almost too early with that roll. That was a visceral opportunity. Schmick. Nice. I'm tempted to refresh my... Oh, phase two. Refresh my fire. Okay, I got to see phase two. Let's see what we got. He has the spit attack. He's spitting on me. Ouch. Ouch. The tutorial boss is phase two. He, like, loses his legs and does this as well. Ugh. Got, like, no heals. How much distance can I get on him? How many humanities can I use? He's coming towards me. My humanity healed through it, though. Okay, his backside has, like, the poison on it. Fuck. I'm so low. I know. I'm gonna try to have Homeward Bone out. I'm not Homeward Bone out, though. Fuck. <laughs> oh, I'm cursed? Uh-oh. That cursed me through, like, my corpse. His backside's got, like, the curse effect. I can't, like, get behind him phase two. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. I'm not cursed right now, though. I think the curse might just be an insta-kill. I got 30 souls. Enemy died. I do miss my fast roll. Hmm. I might just go into the arena and homeward bone out. Just to get my souls back and then maybe come back later. Hmm. It's a really weird system. I guess Demon Souls does it, but... It's like I don't know what area is, like, beginner-friendly kind of area. My heals are so... Ooh, I don't want to ember. Or er, homeward bone. I think I take two sips of Estus here to get a full. Heals are really weak. I only have five of them, too. Here's a little area of the map I've never been to before. Quick. He does have a phase, too, which is really cool. All the bosses are really cool. Oh, my God. I should read about this mod, actually, to see exactly, like, I don't know, the description on all the areas. Seems like there's optional boss, main boss in each area. Demo is very sizable, from what I've seen. I'm just gonna run in there and homeward out. Hopefully I get my souls real quick. Yeah, phase one's not that bad, but phase two seems not so great. I can't seem to get behind him at all. Yeah. Let me go to the Nexus page. I should have read. Although, I don't know how much detail is actually there. Arc Thrones. Nexus 3. Nexus. Let me read about those features. Non-linear progression. Yeah, it's it's tough, but I don't know. I think they pulled it off. New weapons, new armor, new bosses. Mod ban me. FAQ. Yeah, it doesn't really give you much about, like, you know... The demo size, like, oh, five areas, five optional bosses, and five, like, main bosses. How to install. Game crashes. Yeah, I'm, I got lucky my game's not crashing on my current version, but you can downgrade, I guess, if you're getting crashes. Do I lose controller's part? No. Whatever I like mouse, it like doubles the sensitivity of the camera, but I think it goes back to the normal. I could just grind out this boss. I might. Yeah, let's grind out. Sand boss guy. And then I'll, I might stop playing the mod, wait for final release, maybe. Really impressive stuff, though. Oh, <laughs> no shadows look so garbo like indoor. Turn on the shadows, I guess. Hopefully that's like a... Where's Shadows? Like a, a mod glitch, not like a Dark Souls 3 glitch. Oh, I have levels. Here you go. I really need a Bone Shard, man. Undead Bone Shard to increase my SS team. It's real, real weak. I might just want damage, honestly, from... Eh, maybe Endurance. Endurance is kind of like damage. Because my heals are so weak, I don't know how much... Health is really giving me. Yeah, endurance sounds fine. Alright, grind out boss attempts. 
And I'm guessing it'll tell me, hey, that's the end of the demo. You went, you saw the optional boss, which was the worm. You saw the main boss, which was this guy. Did the area, and now it's time for the end of the demo. That's what I'm guessing. It's, it's, ah, I don't know. I don't know about, like, the non-linear progression system. It seems weird to me. But I want an ember. Eh. Once I learned the fight a little bit more. He started doing attacks that, like, I'd never seen before. I was like, what the heck, yeah. Cool that you can, seems like you can get different ember effects, too. Just like Odin Ring. Oh, that came out real quick. Oh, that's AoE, yep. I guess I'll heal. Oh man, I was very greedy with a fully charged there. Schmack. I didn't recognize that as an AoE as fast as I should have. Ooh, the kick attack. That's AoE, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Accurate hitboxes, that's for sure. Godskin Noble, fire attacks. That's AoE, yeah. I got stuck on the stairs, I think. Okay, this is a new attack. What's going on here? Just grab, okay. Oh, skeletons! Uh-oh. That's a not good. Oh, he is a necromancer. <laughs> uh, that's a not good. Maybe a little necromancer guy. Is he just kind of chilling, though? He might just do ranged attacks during, like, this skeleton phase. He also hits his own skeletons. Yeah, it's a good, like, um... Yeah, it seems like he's only doing ranged attacks. That's a good AI fix or AI switch up. For this, like, skeleton phase. Just have him do raise attacks. If he was doing, like, melee attacks and getting on top of me, I'd be super fucked. Oh my god, super cool. Boink. Um. Skeletons don't do too much damage. I could Ember to get my health to fall, but I think I'm just... Giving up this attempt. Oh, he's getting on top of me now. Maybe once a certain amount of skeletons die, he'll go back to melee. That didn't seem like phase two, though. That seemed like phase one and a half. Like, maybe he has three phases? I hope he doesn't summon skeletons again. <laughs> oh, no. This boss was good until he started summoning skeletons. Now I think the boss is bad. Oh, I should have fired up my weapon. Oh, wait. I keep getting stuck when he AoEs. I'm playing on like no stamina. <laughs> I need a uh, chill. Well, that doesn't actually do that much damage. It's not like Black Flame from Elden Ring where it does like damage over time either. Oh, I'm dead. Fuck. <laughs> Shit. Just let me see the end of demo screen. <laughs> end of area. Coming soon in development. <laughs> yeah, keep me back in there. Keep me back in there. I could Ember. Yeah, I only have five. I mean, yeah, let's fire up. I don't know about the skeletons. I don't have a good way to deal with them. I don't think I have any souls there. Yeah, the melee attacks do a lot more than the ranged. Yeah, we... I need to chill for more stamina, yeah. Ooh, a little triple. Yeah, he does like the single swipe, which is pretty easy to avoid. 
This is a triple, no double. So he's got he's got mix-ups. Is he gonna summon skeletons? No. I don't remember exactly what he did when he summoned the skeletons. But I wouldn't be surprised if it is the AoE. Oh, the kick. Still no skeletons. I got two heals left. This is skeleton summon? No. Oh, grab? Yes. So the grab gets the skeletons. Run from one side of the arena to the other. Yeah, he's all the way back there. He's running on top of me, though. <laughs> he got one. I think once, like, half of them are dead, he's going to start getting on top of me with range attacks. So heavy one-shots. One skeleton left. I can deal with that. All right, not so bad. Oh, okay. That AoE is problematic. That's <laughs> uh hey when like that downward thrust is pretty big. I don't think I'm really getting out of the way of that. Damn. He's half health! <laughs> the skeletons aren't that bad if I one shot them with the with the running heavy. My heals are just so garbo. Uh, I could hold on to the Ember. Ember, like, mid-boss fight. Get more value from that. It's kind of wonky, but I think it's okay to do. Uh, don't care about those souls. There's nothing there. Okay, that's a new attack. The, like, run away? He's doing, like, ton of combos now. <laughs> what the hell? Do like your single sword swipe, that's super easy to punish. Yeah, there it is. Do that one. Check. I can't tell the difference between his range attacks, which are nice. I guess I'll heal. Nope, that was a mistake. Yeah, the combos are fucking me up. I'm just not used to seeing them. Okay, that's all my heals. Oh, I'm already gone. That should not be good. Yeah, when he does the grab, it's the summon the skeletons. Maybe we... Oh, that comes out real quick. Let's do a ton of damage, though. I'm embering, I guess. The skeletons. Jump me, hopefully. Oh. Okay, no heavy attack for me. Where is he? Right there. I used an ember. I kind of want to homeward out. Hmm. I don't think these skeletons will let me homeward out. I'll go for it, though. We got two homeward bones. Oh, I actually did it. Um, yeah, like I'm embered up now. I think I need to explore some more. Oh, I got him like half health. I really need to know like where a bone where a bone bone shard is undead bone shard that I can burn to make my heals better. They are real real garbo right now. I got real bad heals. There's some other areas I can go to. Yeah, let me I don't know, level up some more. I, I just don't know where like one of those would be. Like all the bosses are too hard for me still. Um, I'm trying to think where I was before here, and I won't go to cleric beast. I'll just go somewhere else. I think that's okay. Damn, now I kind of... I don't know. I was I was saying like... Oh, I'll just beat this... This desert guy boss. Find the end of demo screen and quit playing this down. But now I kind of want to do everything. I don't know why. I don't know what switched me up. Just thinking about... Cleric Beast? Maybe? No, that was my plan. Give me your spear, spear guy. No, don't just make me with your shield. Alright, I'll take that train. 
I'm embered up, which is nice for exploration. I'd rather be embered for exploration than for bosses. Is there like a crossbow dude over here? There is. Heck heck. So there's red guys fighting blue guys. That's a classic Team Forces 2. Team Cup. Did I turn shadows off? I don't think so. What's this guy doing? I don't know. Low dart dude. Pitchfork dude. Yeah, these enemies are weak. This guy's getting on top of me. Check. Human pine resin? I guess that's good against human enemies. <gasps> Great scythe! That's what I used! My Dark Souls 3 playthrough. Yeah, I don't think I'll use it again though. That'd be kind of silly to <laughs> use it for the mod as well. That's a good nice weapon though. I'm a big fan. I found like a slower, bigger scythe, but I'd probably prefer the faster one. Can I get that item? Can I just walk across here? Hmm. Not sure. This is where you would originally be, like, starting this area. Where you kind of go through this area backwards. Two Dark Souls 2 areas, two Dark Souls 3 areas, and... One completely unique sand area, which is very cute. Oh, this guy is leveled up. What's he doing now? Exploding? Oh, yeah, it's one of these guys. It's a... Bloodborne enemy! <laughs> What the heck, idiot? Can I backstab this guy? Yeah, sweet. Weird timing on him losing health there, like... <laughs> he lost health before I actually backstabbed him. Firebomb? Yeah, that makes sense. Give me my SS back, very cute. Thank you, game. I think how to get over there. I see, like, a board right there. Seems like I just fall off, though. Hmm. Here's a ladder on, like, the other side. I think, oh, bonfire. I'll touch it, I won't. Oh, NPC. <laughs> Salutations. Hello, Flynn. <laughs> Your audio is a little quiet, Brother Lancel. Can you speak up, please? I. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> in the capital yesterday. Voice acting's good. good I haven't really felt like super out of place. They went on ahead whilst I just Ooh, giant guardian? Maybe it's boss over here. I figured boss would be like in the big area. Is that boss arena right there? I don't see any like annoying runbacks, which is nice. Oh, there's a chest right here I didn't even notice. Is it the chest I can open though? It is. Mimic new. No. I guess still just chilling. Human pine resin? I guess it's a human boss probably. Yeah, it's definitely a boss, cool. Huh. It was more to explore, though. I'm kind of... Did I rest at the bonfire? I did. Uh, okay, I guess I'll go level up then. I think I'll go, like, one level. I hate having to go back to Firelink Shrine to level up. Especially with, like... This teleport system, where I gotta, like... Run around Firelink just to teleport to whatever each area I want to go to. Uh, probably Endurance. That's probably what I want. Oh, I don't even get any level up. I'm too much of a newbie noob. I have probably a level item though. Yeah, let's just take them all. Haven't found any like upgraded materials past those just very basic ones, which might be by design. Like you might not be able to find better upgrade materials past the demo. Yeah, endurance sounds good. My heals are just so garbage. I really need to find a undead bone shard. Yeah, I keep thinking I'd teleport here, but I don't. <laughs> I gotta go up here. I want to go... Yeah, I remember. I know where... Which uh, little teleport place I want to go to. This actually makes me so excited for, like, the full release, actually. I'm really, really impressed with this demo. Like, even though it's just, like, remixed Dark Souls 3 areas for the majority, like, the unique bosses are super cool. Yeah, remixed Dark Souls... Or it might just be, like, remade Dark Souls 2 areas, but... Probably some remixing in there as well. I will do this. I'm getting free souls. Nice. Ooh, 
Ooh, I get a backstab. Yeah, like, he lives with the hell before I actually backstab him. It's kind of funny. Ooh, I miss. Smack. He did drop a firebomb at first. Okay, that was probably a random drop, then. Oh, I actually didn't know there was an enemy there. I just wanted to hit the corpse that was, like, hanging from the ceiling. Oh! I can just go up here. What the heck? <laughs> In Dark Souls 3, I think, like, you can't destroy that barricade. That's fun. Well, not a super exciting item, unfortunately, but I'll take it. I'm getting some frame drops. It's getting a little framey up in here. There's a lot of enemies on the screen. Nanny. So that's probably main boss. I doubt that there's two optional bosses in the same area. Because Cleric Beast is definitely an optional boss. Okay, that guy doesn't want anything to do with me. Ooh, this might be Undead Bone Shard. This is what it is in the normal Dark Souls. Oh, it is. Sweet. Nice. That's big. That's really, really big. I probably get Cleric Beast down now. That's me out a ton. Makes my heals not so pathetic. Is there a real Garbo right now? Like, I want to keep exploring this area. Yeah, three SS flasks to give me the full health. I want to keep getting items. Nine -nine shard. Yeah, you might not be able to find any... That's just... Yeah, I don't care about crafting at all. I don't even know how to craft yet. That guy's just chilling next to an item. Kind of want that item, but not with that guy chilling there. Play more. Back a step? Nope. Back a step for me. Little shield bash instead. Yeah, Dark Souls 3 is like the perfect game to mod, I feel. Because just the combat is so good, the movement's so good. I mean, you could, you know, mod any of the Dark Souls. But like Dark Souls 1, the combat's kind of wonky. But these guys have Lothric great swords. It's like the best sword in the game. Can I get a visceral off? No, a visceral for me. There we go, visceral nail sweet. There's a big halberd dude walking over here. There's like some audio thingies. Like the audio for them dying like comes up before they actually die. The backstab. Hops before they actually take damage. This guy was in a fight because he's like half health. So he decides to walk over here. Ember Blossom? No. Oh, this guy dropped an Ember Blossom? Oh, I thought maybe he dropped like his armor or something. That undead bone shard is, is so big, actually. That's such a huge upgrade. Let's fight this guy. Fight me, guy. Oh, he just wants to fight me. Come back here. Come back here and fight me. Let's put my rubbing up against. Okay, there we go. <laughs> a little rubby rub on that barricade. This pathfinding is kind of long game. Again, souls to level up. I think the scaling on my weapon's real garbo. Oh, that's far as I could open that actually. No fun. That's me, Humphrey. Angel Feather? Oh, three of those. What do those do? I see it in usables. Oh, it's upgrade? Gradually restores HP when mixed in flask? What? Oh, wait, this is something I got too. Reduces FP consumption? Okay, that's magic. Reduces fire attack? I can mix into flasks? I gotta talk to some people at Firelink. Who's damage against Abyssal Flow? Uh, these, I have three of these though. So it must be like crafting, huh? So I can't just like put this in a flask. I would want this increased fire attack. This seems really good. I don't even remember where I got these fire crystals. Probably the desert, I think, randomly picked them up. I think I got them around the oasis of the desert. But, you know, I have fire on my swords. That'd be nice. Increase my fire attack. Sure, I'll drop down here. No fear. Estus? Nee -nee -nee -nee. Nee -nee -nee -nee. Tilly, that's a very kind of you. Very generous to raid the Humphrey stream. Hope you had a good day and a good stream. I guess I'll drink this. Let's see. Yeah, it just heals me though. Oh, oh Skelly! I'm glad to see you safe. Did you teleport in when I drank the soup? What the heck, dick? Tilly, are you a fan of the Dark Souls games? Humphrey's a big fan. Big from software fan. I'm a big fanboy. Ooh, hydrate for me. Thank you, Tilly. That's very kind of you. 
Delicious water, water de sunflower. What a model pupil you are. Ooh, that's delicious. How goes the search? I happened upon an entourage of clarity. Ooh, you are Tilly King, King Behavior. Being a Soulsborn fan, King King King. Trace of my sister on that young cleric. Lance, I've never wielded a sword. It would be I Ooh, bastard sword. I mean, I guess I'll give it a shot. Yeah, I don't care about miracles at all. He doesn't really strike me as, like, the priest kind of character, but I guess he is. Check out some of these swords. Claymore, longsword. What did he give me? Bastard sword. Need 16 strength. I don't think I can two-hand it either. Yeah. This might be kind of weak. It looks kind of like a... Like a rusty greatsword, but I'm using it. It's alright. Oh, that'd be cool, though, Tilly. You can do lore videos. You could find, like, a small thing to talk about, like a small character or a small storyline from Dark Souls or any of the games. Talk about That'd be so cool, Tilly. I get that, though. I've, I've wanted to make a Morrowind architecture video for years and years now, but I just can't bring myself to do it. I'd have to, like, read off a script, which isn't really my style. I guess writing a script isn't really my style either. I tried to write a script for a Morrowind architecture YouTube video. I just kind of do it, though. Only YouTube videos I've ever made are just me kind of like talking offhand off a of script, just talking about things that I'm knowledgeable about, about Morwin and stuff. <laughs> um, yeah, because Morwin has different factions and all of the architecture for all the different factions reflects the culture of the factions. Where's the big guy? Hey, big guy. I have an undead bone shard. My heals are too good. There we go, sweet. Damn, did I miss Noxy Bloodborne playthrough? Damn, that must have been before I knew, Nock. Damn, I love Bloodborne. Bloodborne's my second favorite from software game. Dark Souls is my absolute favorite, just because exploration is my favorite thing in video games. And I think Dark Souls, the original, has... Or just, you know, Dark Souls 1 has the best exploration. I have not played Demon Souls, though. I'm a fake fan. It's okay, though. I can be a little fakey fan. Oh, really? Tilly? Nah. That's something I would want to do. That's something I would want to do myself, you know? I just can't bring myself to do it. It feels too much like homework, I guess. I don't know. I don't really enjoy school that much. It's too much like I'm writing, like, an essay or something. It's like, can I drop down here? I think I can. I think I will. It's a bonfire. Or at least there is in this regular game. Well, uh, I guess I'll top off my health. Sure. Give me bolts. Oh, yeah, you enjoy writing Tilly, yeah? Interesting, interesting. I, I mean, I just have to be, like, in the right mood or something. I don't know. So I don't really bring myself to, like, read from a script. I feel like that's kind of... It feels unnatural to me. It's not something I'm super comfortable doing. There's some ranged users around here. Where's the bonfire at? I think this is a shortcut, though. Don't want to spend the time picking this up. I think I will. <laughs> nerd, nerd, nerd. Nerdy nerd. I could humanity to get my health up. Yeah, I did just pick one up. Let me humanity. That's a unique enemy. Cool. No, it's it's just like a remix enemy, like a reskinned enemy. What if I firebomb him? Oh, uh, plenty attacks, but oh, he actually got me. How dare he? I think that's a shortcut to, like, the very beginning. There's another one down there. This is not kick ladder. Hmm. Yeah, maybe one day, maybe one day I'll make a Mormon architecture video. I'd really have to, like, buckle up, or, you know, really, like, kind of sit down and force myself to do it, for lack of a better word. Not that anybody's, you know, forcing me to do it, and it's something that I would enjoy doing, but I'd have to really commit. Alright, not so mad. I think shortcut's up here. That guy did not give me a flask charge. Human pus? Okay. I guess I can mix things into flasks. But they're like usage, though. There's usage there. Hmm. Yeah, shortcut. Heck yeah. Thank you very much for that shortcut. Very much appreciated. Thank you, Dark Souls 3 mod. Very cute. 
You have a YouTube channel? Tell shit, I gotta check out your YouTube channel. I had no idea. Oh, very cool. The only YouTube videos ever really made was a Morrowind's tier list for cities and skills. But they're just like fun kind of videos that I can do. No problem. I don't think about them at all. Back when I was playing Morrowind on stream. Alright, let me hit up this bonfire hopefully. Yeah, sweet. I can upgrade my flask. I can upgrade my character. I need to find like, I don't know, whoever like mixes into flask. Maybe I haven't unlocked that yet. But I have a bunch of like mixing ingredients. Yeah, burn undead bone shard, definitely. Yeah, my heals won't be as pathetic. Sweet. Yeah, the mod page wasn't super like um descriptive of like, you know, what makes up the mod. It's just kind of figuring it out. This guy doesn't mix things in flash, does he? Welcome. I don't think so. No. Goodbye. Hollow sorcery teacher. I'm super impressed with this mod though. This is super cool. All the unique bosses are really cool too. I think that's the what I'm most impressed with. Because there's only really one like unique area, the the sand area. Um do you mix flasks, perhaps? No, you just level up. Storage box game. Yeah, I'm not gonna use storage box game at all. Sculptor dude from Sekiro. Huh. I mean, unless he sells, like, an item that I need to mix things. Ooh. Yeah, let's get this key. I like exploring. Give me that. Okay, I might not be able to level up anymore. Yeah, I can't because I bought the key. I guess I'll use the key, though. Huh. Uh, no way Andre mixes flasks. Infuse weapons. So he'll give me boss souls. Transpose weapons, yeah. Or boss weapons, rather. Thanks, Andre. Hmm. Oh, wait. Wrong area. I want to use my key. I'm embered up, which is nice. There's deeper into that area I can go. There's two bosses I go to, Cleric. I've got upgraded heals now. I think I'm in a good spot to actually defeat a boss, whether that be um desert boss or Cleric Beast boss or boss that's like right next to that dying guy. Yeah, they got Andre in here. The voice acting's good, but oh, it's a dude. Dude. <laughs> the custom NPCs are really cool too. Bunch of custom armors that look cool. This guy might mix flasks. He looks like an herbalist dude. He's got a bunch of plants around. Hey, guy. Oh, I should turn up voice volume. I think everything's on three. Oh, he doesn't want me here. Got a medicine. Yeah, cool. Okay, hold on. Let me turn up voice volume. I should have thought about that a long time ago. Yeah, everything's on three, so I'll put voice on four, I guess. A little higher than everything else. Mm. There we go. That sounds much Still better. Here. You know Ebrius? Yeah, the sculptor dude from he's Sekiro. He's here. He is to the oh no, the poison. If thy interest can be peace, he may enjoy yeah, the voice acting is good. None of it sounds like out of place. Sometimes you play like these mods or, I don't know, Skyrim mod or... Mormon mod and the voice acting just sounds kind of out of place and it's like obviously amateur. As long as the voice acting isn't obviously amateur, I think it's, it's super good. Uh, TF2 has like a a map where there's like a seal that pops out and, it's, and there's, there's like a pirate voice and it doesn't sound out of place. So whoever the voice actor for that did a really good job. Prepare new items? Oh, I, I want that. Yeah, I'm guessing this guy mixes flasks. Forgiveness is not Craft new items. Can I do anything with this statue? No. Okay. He'll craft new items, huh? Doesn't really sound like he'll... Give me, like, fla flask mixing. Let me check these out again. The key items... Upgrade okay, down. Prevent staggering for certain attacks when mix and flask... Yeah. I just think that there's, like, a certain amount. In Elden Ring, you just get, like, one of these. Like, I have three angel feathers, so I'm guessing they just use them once? Hmm. I like a bunch of these, like, raw fire crystals to boost my fire damage because I have a fire spell on my sword. How many, like, titanite shards do I have? Four? Can I buy them? If I can buy them, then that'd be kind of nice so I could experiment with more weapons. 
No, he doesn't sell anything. Pretty be careful. This guy sells stuff. He might sell the basic upgrade item. Oh, he doesn't. He sells a bunch of basic items or basic we basic weapons, though. Halberd. Oh, I find that surprising. I mean, I guess there's probably some enemies I can farm for basic upgrade material. Let's go. I mean, there's 10,000 souls I need to get the laboratory guy. I mean, I'd, I'd like to do that. Up and running. Let's go back to this area. I unlocked a shortcut. There is boss here. Two bosses I could go to, but I think I'll just keep exploring the area. Maybe there's more bosses than I thought. I was expecting one optional boss and one main boss in each area, but seems like there might be three bosses in this, this area that I'm going to. There's Cleric Beast, there's... I don't know, boss next to that dying guy, and then there's also this area that I keep exploring. My heal is upgraded now, which is super helpful. My heal was so weak without any undead bone shard. When I play this full mod, which I probably will because I'm super impressed with the demo, I'm gonna beeline to the undead bone shard now that I know where it is. It's the same place it was in Dark Souls 3. Yeah, these guys don't stagger at all. Yeah, the audio mixing seems kind of wonky, or like the audio timing sometimes. It doesn't line up with actual attacks. Maybe I'll use a boss item too, boss weapon if I find one. Because I have Titanite. Twinkling Titanite will upgrade boss items. Actually, doesn't Dark Souls 3 have like three upgrade systems? For boss items, special items, and normal items. Purging stone. Okay, get sort of curses. Oh. Okay, because my sword went through there, I thought maybe it was a illusory wall. Like, it didn't bounce off? Hmm. Did the mod creator get rid of bouncing off weapons? <laughs> Hold on. Use another weapon here. Oh, no, he didn't. I guess my great sword just doesn't bounce. That's kind of funny. It'd be kind of funny if the mod creator was like, yeah, no more bouncing off weapons. Time to upgrade my... Or, Drink a flask. I want the parrying dagger. I don't really play a parrying place now. Only in Sekiro. Maybe Bloodborne a little bit. Human pus, yeah. So I guess those are usable items. Knight armor. Could start upgrading my equip load. I think I'm gonna save up 10,000 souls to get the laboratory go up and running. That'd be super funny if he did, or they did, the mod author, get rid of, like, the bouncing weapon of talk. I'm not sure if it's a one-man team. I mean, obviously, there's, like, voice actors and probably artists and stuff that help him out. Red-hilted halberd. Ooh, I like halberds. Red-hilted? Hmm. From the red faction, which, of course, is the natural enemy of the blue faction. Okay, an actual enemy back there. Check out this halberd. Oh, it just has, like, a red handle. Ooh, a stab. Let's stick with the great sword. Oh, emissary's blade. No, here we go. Not a ton of unique weapons I've found. All the boss weapons will probably be unique though. These guys are respawning. That's annoying. So I think I'll pop out. Like the big open area at the bottom. Yeah. Oh, what? <laughs> I smacked into him. Smack, smack. Oh, uh, okay, yeah. Yeah, the scales, yeah. Tilly knows what's up. I think most of the Dark Souls only has two different, like, upgrade systems for the weapons. There's just special weapons and normal weapons, but yeah, Dark Souls 3 has three different upgrade materials. Is this boss arena? Oh my god, I love this mod so much. That might be boss arena. I'll hold off on healing for now. There's a summoner girl, though. She might be a friendly NPC. Yeah, Dark Souls 3 R1 spam is as strong as ever. I like the death sound was like premature. Nobody's gonna jump down from above, hopefully not. This guy does a buff, maybe? No. Oh, he's a spear, not a halberd. I think the halberd guys do buffs. Hope.
There's no like input delay or anything, it's just the audio is kind of wonky sometimes. I'll check out that girl that's just standing there. Hold on. This is a uh, kick down. Whoa. Skelly. Skelly enemy. I've got enough magic for more fire when I go fight that guy again. Do I want to fire up for this girl though? She's definitely going to summon like a big guy. Unless she's a friendly NPC. I hear somebody walking around. I think it's somebody above me. Let's fire up. I got lucky finding that fire spell in the desert area. It's very useful. All these guys gonna stand up. Somebody's gonna turn into a big guy. Uh, my controls feel kind of wonky. In this like swamp area, maybe. Guess not. It was just my imagination. This guy's respawning. Uh oh. A big guy, but he's very weak to fire. Yeah, we got him. Fire bomb. Y'all yeah, rush. Undead bone shard and fire spell. Huh? No like unique item here though. Interesting. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, unique weapons are the same as boss weapons, but. Dark Souls 3 has unique upgrade materials for boss weapons and special weapons and normal weapons. It might be the only From Software game that has three upgrade. I think most of them only have like two different kind of upgrades. Oh my god, I missed the plunging attack. How cringe. Oh, these guys really don't like fire. Sweet. I'll top off my health here. That's my last flask going in. I think the sunflower covers it up. No rats? I think in Dark Souls 3, this is like the rat area, a bunch of rats crawl out of those little tunnels. Doink, doink, doink. Yeah, I haven't beaten any bosses yet. <laughs> but with that undead bone shard, I'm probably good to go. I can probably beat some bosses now. My heals were just so pathetic. Is this where that girl usually is? Yeah, I think so. Cool. Yeah, Remix like Dark Souls 3 area. Yeah, nice. So I pop out here. Wait, this is... Oh. It just loops around. Okay. So I, I think there is only two bosses. Optional Cleric Beast boss. Weird that it like loops around though. Wait a minute. Yeah, I didn't really get in. Oh, there's the... I forgot about the other tunnel. Okay. Wait a minute. Do I spawn in here? Yeah, this is where I spawn in from. Okay, cool. God, so cool. Even though it's just like a Dark Souls 3 area, it's remixed in such a way that makes it feel like a completely new area. I hate having to go back to Fire Link to... Up to level up, but I should. Tempted to try out a new weapon, but I don't really have the upgrade material for it, so I'm probably just gonna keep using this great sword. Uh, why is it dark and scary, and there's no NPCs around? And I'm a security kit. Invaded by Dark Spirit Apothecary Bennett Koo. Fight to me, coward. I don't know where they are. Are they in the laboratory? I hear him. It's just an NPC. What? Wait, isn't this guy? When I met this guy, I don't think he uses a big sword though. Maybe he's a different guy. Okay, that's not what I wanted to do. I don't know what he's doing. He's like upgrading his sword. He's sharpening it. Not sure what that buff was. Ooh, I miss. Oh my god, my heal is much less pathetic now. Yeah, weird. He's Liza P sharpening it. <laughs> he does it at such wonky times. Well, R1 spam. No problem. No. No heal for you. Alright, we got him. Reflex on him. Flex, flex, flex. Get flexed on. Apothecary Bennett. Maybe he's like Apothecary's flask? Hmm. Maybe I can mix things now? I still need 10,000 souls to give it to that guy, but maybe I don't. Maybe I just needed that flask. And now he'll mix flasks. Because that, like, item from him had him sell things. Nobody said anything about spooky, scary Firelink Shrine. Let's talk to this guy. Maybe I can mix my flasks now to upgrade it. What is that? Yeah, cool, I got it. I probably just needed to unlock the laboratory, leave the area, come back, and then that guy invades me and I get his apothecary flask. This is a penguin. It seems my pupils have very well. I won't enjoy 
Sweet. Yeah, upgrade my flesk. To me with I will I can make one with two ingredients for a mixed response. A single ingredient or two of the same. Ingredients. Yeah, Dark Souls <laughs> I hate the uh the boss weapon system in Dark Souls. I hate it so much. It's so garbo. As much as I love Dark Souls, it's got the worst boss weapon mechanic. Like you have to take a normal weapon that's like a you know, in the same category as the boss weapon. Upgrade that normal weapon to, like, max, and then turn it into a boss weapon. It's like, yeah, Tilly knows what's up. It's so garbo. I don't think I've ever used a boss weapon in Dark Souls 1. Ever. I've only, only used, like, normal weapons. Yeah, you should... Yeah, Dark Souls 3 knows what's up. You just... I, I can't remember what Dark Souls 2 boss weapons work, but yeah, just, like, get the boss and turn that boss into a boss weapon. Or a boss item. If new ingredients require appraisal, make a loif. Should know how, how to best utilize them. Show new ingredient? I guess I'll show them all of them. Does he have unique di unique dialogue for all of them? Let me just show them all of them, I guess. Whatever. Here you go. Here's some items. Sorry, voice actor, but your dialogue's getting skipped. Purchase item? How does brewing work? I can probably figure it out, but I'll ask him anyway. Uh, purchase item? Possible to brew elixirs at bonfires? Oh, okay. That's probably not- I mean... Just a convenient cost, convenience cost. Let me see. Choose a combination of the two ingredients. But they use the ingredients, right? Or maybe I need to... Hold on. I mean, use both of them. Gradually restoring me. I mean, I definitely want the fire damage. Boost the effects of kindling when mixed in flask. Kindling? Can I kindle bonfires? I don't, I don't think I have that yet. Give me the fire damage. And... Absorption. What kind of absorption? Damage absorption? Increases absorption. I don't know what kind of absorption that is. This is HP recovery. Abyssal foes. Don't care about that. Prevent staggering. Eh. I guess I'll get the HP recovery. Combine ingredients. Yeah. Let me see. Hold on. Is that just for all flasks though? Oh no, I have a special flask. I got three of them? Do they stack? Can I test that out? Test out that theory. Take some damage. See if I get like super high HP recovery. Maybe... Yeah, really? It is, like, JRPG complicated. It's, like, yeah, like, if you didn't go online, you wouldn't know that. You're like, how the hell do I get a boss item? Like, you wouldn't know to upgrade a normal weapon to, like, plus 10 and then turn that into a boss item. It feels so wonky. So I'm guessing this doesn't stack. Yeah, it doesn't. It replaces. Okay. I get three of them, though, and they probably... Refill at a bonfire. Okay, they don't refill at a bonfire. Oopsies, I wasted all my apothecary flasks. I'd like some more, please. But I wasted all of them. Okay, I need to- I, I need to go get more. Yeah, that's why there's like a certain amount, I guess. Um, oopsies. Oopsies. Yeah, that makes sense why the- the upgrade is- is like a usable item. Um, I guess I'll make another one. Yeah, I used my raw fire crystals, which were- I was really excited to use. Uh, I guess I'll get- I could just get double HP recovery, sure. Gradually restore large amount of HP. So yeah, th those effects stat. Okay, cool. I mean, three is probably fine for a while. Sweet. I'm really impressed with this mod. Oh my god. This is so cute. The, like, you know, different areas is kind of wonky at first, but... I've been to each area. Let's go back here. I guess I'll go down that tunnel. I think that's a boss. I think there's three bosses in this area. At least three. So, very first bonfire. Down the tunnel. Down into the skilly cave. And then... I could... Oh, did my game crash? It did. My game did crash. That is unfortunate. Well, relaunch probably fixes that no problem. <laughs> Shit. Hopefully. Hopefully my game didn't file didn't get corrupted, but, you know, it happens. Um... There's the Cleric Beast, which I'll probably go back to. The Phase 2 seems real real annoying, but I've got better heals, better damage, probably use. Yeah, sorry that I quit before letting you save Dark Souls. I didn't do it on purpose. Please don't Mr. Resetting me. That's what Dark Souls need, a Mr. Resetty character. That'd be kind of cool. Whenever you, like, you know, exit the game without saving properly, Mr. Resetty pops up and talks to you for, like, 10 minutes. That'd be cool. Yeah. I'm it actually put me in the right spot, I think. Do I have my elixirs? Yeah, I do. Cool. Let me get these elixirs in a better spot, though. 
put those in the second slot. Ember, humanity, yeah, it seems all good. Got a bunch of like usable items I probably won't be using. Oh really? Yeah, you can hard lock yourself out of a boss weapon. Yeah, it's like um, like the Black Knight weapons aren't farmable until like the actual very very end of the game, where there's respawning Black Knights. Yeah, no shit. Oh, I don't like this guy here. Oh, I gotta run through a decent amount of enemies before I get to boss. Assuming this is boss. I'm surprised the lady behind me didn't give me anything special. Are they leaving me alone? Okay, they are. Cool. I go to the boss arena in peace. Ooh, is it slide down to Lost Isolith? To Bed of Chaos, my favorite boss. Oh, it is slide down. Uh, bed of Chaos time. Oh my god, I can't wait. God, Bed of Chaos is definitely the best weapon, or the best boss in all of Dark Souls. I heard we got fight me, you coward. No. Oh, okay, a fog wall. Okay, we have a fog wall for a boss. Omen of the Eclipse. Uh, Shokum. Super Soldier game. An Elden Ring boss has like the throw halberd attack. I feel. Oh, he staggers on R one. What the heck, Nick? He's a weakling. Oh, I miss. Maybe he's weak to fire. Yeah, he's got the like black tentacle on his back, so I think he's weak to fire. I think that's why he's staggering. Damn, I wanted to fight Bed of Chaos, but I'm fighting a real boss. This is so sad. I want to heal. Okay, I rolled into that, though. Yeah, he's definitely weak to fire. <laughs> That's why he's staggering. Ah, oh, sweet, sweet, sweet. Ooh, I like this sword. I'll upgrade this sword, and then you can't, because it's, yep, hard capped. You got a new game plus it or whatever. When I first played Dark Souls, I wasn't paying any attention to the story. And, like, you get to the final boss, and it's obvious it's the final boss. But I didn't know it was the final boss. So I was like, ooh, I'll, I'll just uh, walk out of the arena and play some more Dark Souls, and... Try to find some areas where we explore some more or whatever. And I got the bad ending or like the evil ending or whatever. Damn, yeah, I'm not embered up, so my health isn't all that great, but get me back in there. Get me the heckity heck up back into that bus arena. Yeah, I'm surprised that lady over there didn't give me any special item. Just the enemies feel. Uh, I could ember up again. Maybe mid boss fight I'll do that because it does give me full health and heals me. Could elixir? I think I'll hold off on the elixir though. I don't know the boss fight very well much. He probably has a phase too. I think. I don't know. The necromancer guy kind of has a phase too, where he summons skeletons. The cleric beast has a phase too. The tutorial boss had a phase too. This guy I'm guessing has a phase too. Trying to remember where I found that. Estus shard. I don't remember. I definitely remember where I found the bone shard. Also, I didn't level up. If cheese. Ooh, I miss. I'm guessing the 10,000 souls that will let me buy ingredients from that guy will be a bunch of ingredients that I can find anyway for, like, the elixir. Maybe all of them? Maybe some of them? I'm getting no hits off. Frame rate issue. Little double sip. Yeah, I need more stamina, especially with this great sword. It takes up a lot of stamina. It takes like three times for him completely out of stamina. Now there's the stagger, which is helpful. Don't really have stamina. Keep attacking. I'm playing super greedy, going for attacks with no stamina. <laughs> I'm the greed master. I could Ember here. I don't know how much distance I can get against him, though. Bait out an attack, get some distance. Ember, maybe? Maybe, maybe? That's sweet. Mm. 
the fire lasts a long time. It just expired. All right, phase two time. This looks like phase two. Here comes that big guy now. Oh, he's just a super huge one of these guys. Sagger off fire attack. Nope, no Sagger. Oh, he's the he's an Elden Ring guy. He's an Elden Ring worm guy. I'm probably gonna die here. I could homeward bone out. Nope, I'm dead. Damn, I don't know. All, all these bosses, I'm just like. I feel like I can't beat. I need better equipment. I need better stats. I don't really have a lot of endurance to fight this guy. He's got uh, souls in his arena that I'd like to recover. I forgot to level up when I was in Firelink. Yeah, let's go get those souls. How many homeward bones do I have? Oh, they're not on my hotbar. I think I might only have like one left. Yeah, I only have one. <laughs> uh. Uh, do I want to use my final homeward bone on recovering this? I think it's like 4,000. I mean, it gives me a level... It's like a level and a half. I could just grind away until I beat him. Hmm. He's weak to fire. I could start using this elixir. He's definitely like an optional boss, probably. I explored this area completely. It's just three bosses. Three bosses, though. Damn. I was expecting only two, an optional and a main. Looks like we've got two optionals and... And a main in this arena, though. In this area, rather. When do I want an elixir? I don't know how long it lasts. I'm pretty sure my fire duration is buffed, so this elixir might be buffed, too, compared to, like, Elden Ring. I think I'll elixir right away. I'm getting my souls back. Try another attempt. Ooh, I miss. Ooh, I miss again. Yeah, I'm not super impressed with this HP recovery. Unfortunately, I s wasted all of the fire damage ones, which are probably pretty good. Ooh, I panic rolled out of there. <laughs> it's a panic roll. Yeah, okay, so that's one elixir down. This I did an ember. <laughs> Shit. Fuck. This is the first run back to a boss, which is kind of annoying. Uh, I guess the cleric beast run back was kind of annoying too. But the the main bosses to each area, I'm pretty sure there's just a bonfire right there. Bonfire right there for necromancer desert guy. Yeah, with like the areas like this, it makes me just like want to avoid bosses and just keep going to area to area to get as leveled up as possible, as geared up as possible. Which feels like a weird way to play the game. Like, I want to fight bosses, because bosses are oftentimes the highlight. Especially these unique bosses are super cool. But, like, I don't feel super strong fighting a boss. I could Ember. Ember. Elixir. Yeah, I guess I'll, I'll give it all I got. Could put on more armor, but I really like my light rolling. Alright, cool. Get my flask back. Cover my souls. I mean, yeah, there's got some music, I think. This is not a track that I remember. Man, I barely miss him, fuck. Yeah, I feel like I don't have enough endurance to get damage in. Yeah, I didn't level up last time I was at Firelink. I don't see my health going up. Pretty sure I elixir. Oh, my buff isn't there anymore. How long does the elixir last? Did it really expire already? Ooh, I miss... I roll into that follow-up attack quite a bit. It's delayed. I still got my elixir buff. No, oh, that's a different attack. Phase two, yeah. Get some distance. I've got a good amount of heals left. I got three left.
My HP recovery expired them. Yeah, I really wish I had like fire damage instead of the HP recovery, but I wasted my elixirs. Okay, ranged attack. I'm not running. That sounds real quiet to me, but hopefully it sounds okay to the stream, the little raid song. Okay, good. That's a uh, very kind of you. Very generous to rate the halfway stream. You had a good day. You had a good stream. I think I've asked you this before, Kega, but I don't think you are a huge fan of these from software games, but hopefully you're a big, big fan. Big, big fanboy. That's the last flask going in. He's pretty low, though. He is not weak to fire like he is phase one. Tail swipe. I can't ember because I already am. Ooh, I'm Shit. <laughs> I mean, I can get him. I'll probably ember again. She was real low health. That's very kind of you, Kager, to wait to have a stream. Hope you had a good day. Had a good stream. There you go, sweet. We get there, we get there. TF2, hell yeah, I fucking love TF2. I'll be playing TF2 till I die, no doubt. There's just so many games to play, though. I like playing TF2. Okay, you even said this, you're like, Humphrey, I think you only play, play TF2 around certain times, and that is so true. I really do only play TF2 around certain times. It's like, I live on the East Coast, so it's around like 4 o'clock to 9 o'clock is when I want to be playing TF2. But I woke up real late today. There's no chance that I'd be playing TF2 at, you know, like my normal time. My camera sensitivity is all fucked up whenever I use my mouse, but... I think just pressing start fixes it. Yeah, there we go. Back to normal. Yeah, this is like a mod. I'm super impressed with this mod. This mod is very impressive. All the all the bosses are unique. But all the enemies are unique, but that's fine. Hmm. Yeah, this apothecary flask I'm not super impressed with. I need better ingredients. The HP recovery I wasn't impressed with. Also, let me check this out. Is it an upgrade material? Yeah. Abyssal foes? What's an abyssal foe? Are those like big guys? Abyssal? I'm not sure. Oh, boosts the effects of kindling? I don't know what kindling is. I mean, you can kindle bonfires in Dark Souls 1. There's Titanite, yeah. So this is for boss items, this is for special items, this is normal items, yeah, Titanite shard. Surprised you can't buy Titanite shards, maybe you can later on. So you can use different kind of weapons. Let's... Eh, let's Ember immediately, I guess. You can Ember mid-boss fight for a little more value for the heal and the max HP. Fire up. Oh yeah, when the third party competitive scene is popping, yeah. Certain time of night or day. Yeah, I've got no stamina. One little schmecky schmeck. Ooh, I miss. My stab attack missed. He's missing too, though. We're both missers. Yeah, the stagger on fire is super helpful. I got real lucky finding this fire spell. Not phase two yet. Yeah, he misses his halberd swings a lot. Schmeck. All right, now it's phase two time. How greedy do I want to get? Oh, that doesn't even do any damage. Oh, when he pushes me away, it does no damage. It's nice. Top of my health. Get in there. Oh yeah, you're warming up, then Uncle Topia. Okay, that's a new attack. I've not seen that AOE before. I don't know if I want to refresh my fire or not. I'm kind of just trading hits. It's hard for me to dodge this guy's attacks because I can't really tell what's going on. <laughs> he's, he's like too big, really. Yeah, I'm just like looking at his massive body. I want to heal. If I get a stagger, he's probably done, though, but I don't know if I can do that, really. 
He might not stagger at all. Oh, hey, we attack shit. Okay, there goes all my health. Mm, can't see shit. Come here. I'm going to give you a little schmecky schmeck. He's almost dead. One more schmeck. Alright, we got him. I think we went for an AoE. Sweet. Alright, good deal. I used a lot of resources, but alright. First boss soul, soul of Commander Esmond. Ember. Homeward Bone is interesting. So I think I'm below... Yeah, the way this is remixed is really well, this whole area. This is where I would normally fight Tree Ballsack guy. Super cool. Ooh, heavy for Highlander? Kega Gaming God? Plays Highlander and Sixes? Yeah, you fucked me up on Scout and Uncle Topia. You love to see it. You love to see it, because I'm a Scout main, so... Any Scout that's better than me, or... Good enough to fuck me up? Sometimes it's always a beautiful thing to see. Alright, sweet. Oh, wait. I expected to light that bonfire. Am I going to a different area? What the heck? heck? Where am I going? I'm gonna go back to the Nexus. I've got a bunch of souls. So it puts me back here. But if I just go straight back... Kind of weird it doesn't give you a bonfire. Um... I have a homeward bone, so if I'm... Locked out of progressing. I'm guessing I'll just go back to that bonfire and it'll teleport me back there. Weird. Interesting. Yeah, I don't see any secret here. Oh my god. I love this mod so much. This is so cool. I've never played an overhaul mod before. I haven't played like... Yeah, I guess I just teleport back. I haven't played any Dark Souls overhaul mod that like, you know, changes the game, changes the areas, changes the enemies. Dark Souls 3 is the game to do it, honestly. Just because the movement and combat and everything is so good. I guess I'll just roll through here. I'd like not to lose my Ember. I could Homeward Bone if I'm really worried about losing it. I've got no heals. Um, can I make it to the ladder? And climb up, maybe? Alright, sweet. Yeah, warm it up on scout. Six is scrim. Yeah, Uncle Toby is the place to do it. It's full of tryhards. I'm definitely a tryhard. I definitely try to win the game. Definitely. Uncle Toby is my home. I love Uncle Toby so much. I haven't played casual in years. I think Uncle Toby probably came out like two years ago. I wonder if after you like complete the area, if it like marks as complete or I'll get a developer like note saying, you know, end of demo for area. How much souls do I have? I always get mixed up with digits. I don't really I don't really care about upgrading this apothecary's flask, I don't think. I could give my 10,000 souls to this guy to be able to buy items from him. Ebrius will prepare new items. I'm guessing that means I can like buy the elixir mixes. I guess I should get more elixirs. Let me Boost the effects of kindling. I, I don't know what kindling is. Sure, why not? I've got seven of these. Boost the effects of kindling by a large amount. I can kindle bonfires, but like, why would I use that? I don't understand. I don't understand. I do not understand. I haven't found any rings that I really like. Just the one dexterity boosting ring. Let me check out all my weapons. Is there a weapon I want to use other than this great sword? I use the scythe for my Dark Souls 3 playthrough. Apostle scythe, great scythe. Or how many levels can I get? Fuck to be fire maiden. Probably want endurance. Yeah. Yeah, give me the 20 endurance. That sounds good. My health pool is not great without ember. That's something I'll have to deal with now. My heals are better. I got undead bone shard. I think I explored this area completely. It's just the two bosses. Cleric beast and whatever the boss is back past that one guy. So this will just go to that boss. I guess we'll go to the the main boss before the cleric beast op optional boss. Yeah, I haven't played in Oprah's in a while. I really like Oprah's. I used to play in Oprah's a decent amount, but uh, I'm not a huge fan of all talk. Feels more like a chat room. It's a different kind of vibe. It's a vibe I vibe with, but I'm not vibing with it all the time. 
Um, boost the effects of kindling? I don't know what that is. I guess I'll do it though. Sure. Oh, kindling my ember. I got a little bit more max health from that. Fight me, guy. Oh, I probably should have put fire on my blade. Ooh, it's a big guy. I can target his legs, target his crotch, target his eyeball. Oh, I get some frame drops here. Might put everything on low if it's an issue. Schmeck, I miss. Schmeck, I miss again. Oh, I didn't actually miss that time. Yeah, get his knee. Hit him in the kneecaps. Yeah, yeah, it's more of like a community vibe sort of deal. Maybe I will play an Oprah's at one point. Just for funsies, it's been a long, long time. It's still popping though. Props to her for running such a great community server. Is that an attack? I'm not sure. Not sure what the boss is doing. Oh, it's a ranged attack, okay. Not that much damage, honestly. Yeah, there's a huge variety. Skilled players. Is that a stagger? Is he falling? He is. He actually does damage when he staggers up. Can I get a visceral here or do I just smack him? I think I just smack him. Like maybe if I got to his head I could have visceral him. I still feel like I need more stamina. Yeah, the AoE attacks hard to dodge, but not that much damage. I got one flask left. Ooh, I miss. Ooh, I miss again. Oh, there's an item over here. I didn't even like realize where I was, but yeah, I'm on the bridge where there's usually like those. Pilgrim guys. Yeah, Oprah's has like a certain time where people are gaming on it and it's not like all night long. There's definitely like a time for the Oprah game in. Probably gonna die here, that's okay. Schmeck. Yeah, I'm all out of heals. I'm not sure if I should be like attacking the magic foot. Oh, he's, he's leaving. He says bye bye. My planet needs me. I guess I'll pick up this item since he's all the way on the other side of the arena. Ha! <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. So that's phase two. He leaves the arena or goes to one side. I wonder, I wonder if it's always the same side or based on which side I'm on, he goes to the opposite side. Yeah, it's it's a it's an interesting path to exploration where like I still feel like I need to be running around upgrading. Is there like another undead bone shard I can get? I'll just go in there without any items. I won't use a I won't use an ember, I won't use a alchemy pot or whatever that is. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of like the super big enemies. They look cool. But it's hard to tell what they're doing. Like I'm just looking at his feet. As much as I love looking at feet. I'd rather look at his attacks. Smack. He did stagger. Maybe I can get a visceral. If I look out for that stagger and try to find his head like weak point maybe. I should grab this. Ain't no way this is like a gimmick boss fight. <laughs> this is gonna give me like the storm storm ruler. Oh, Havel's ring's nice. Okay, heck yeah. I mean, I could equip that now. I'll wait for the end of the boss fight though. I'll wait to die. And yeah, no, I'm just staring at his crutch. Found that way of fighting like the worm last boss, second phase of that guy. Where, like I can't really see what the boss is doing, so I just kind of hug him and wail on him. Okay, what was that? Magic attack. Ooh, I'm tanking that. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. 12 hour stream? Damn, Kagan. Streamer good. I've only done one 12 hour stream ever. It was for Uncle Topia's Bad Water Beatdown. Some like special event. 12 hour like bad water like competition to see who can get the most points. I should turn my graphics to low for this boss fight. <laughs> Honestly, I probably won't even notice like the improved graphics of fire or whatever. Not that like the reduced frames are probably like getting me hit or anything, but just kind of annoying. Schmeck. Oh, hello Sandwa. Hello, welcome to the stream. 
that you are doing, Wim. The cleric beast is probably easier than this guy. Maybe I'll go over there after this. Although the run back is much more annoying. Uh, that was a bad attack. I'm gonna die to magic here. Maybe? Nope. Yeah, I still need more stamina. <laughs> I think I got three levels of stamina last level up. Is there a way to, like, grab my souls past the fog gate? That's not happening, though. Yeah, I woke up late today. I, I don't know. I've Maybe I should try to, like, get a super consistent sleep schedule. It's like after my work week, I'm so tired, I usually, like, sleep in. Woke up at, like, 11 o'clock. I made Mickey cheese for breakfast. Chilled for, like, 20 minutes and decided to stream. Um, do I want to get back in there? I'm trying to think of the path to Cleric Beast. I guess this is fine. There's no drop down area, is there? I think the other bonfire is better. I still need more stamina to use this, like, green sword. Not sure if, like, the tentacles coming out is an attack or not. I avoided it anyway, though. Ooh, worker hat. Oh, I've got Havel's ring. Definitely put that on. What kind of armor can I wear? Ooh, swag helmet. Can I wear swag armor, too? I mean, I can, but I get rid of my light roll by quite a bit. I mean, definitely give me the swag helmet, I think. Need to be below 30%. Oh, I can't wear anything. I could just be naked. That's fine, too. Wait, does Havel Ring not increase my... Okay, it definitely does. <laughs> Feels like it wanted, though. 29? Hold on. I mean, I guess I'm just wearing this helmet. Eh, whatever. Sure. Oh, uh, he left! Oh, that's funny. Yeah, I'm not really into Team Fortress 2 competitive. I think it's cool, but I would never want to play it, honestly. Yeah, I went to the wrong bonfire for the boss that I want to go to. That's okay, then. Wait, did I explore down here? Uh, yeah, I guess I did. I guess there's two different ways to that bridge. There was, like, the door over there. It said does not open from this side, but I don't see any way to get past that door. This is the way to Cleric Beast. This... Oh, I'm thinking of the other Cleric Beast. There's, like, the second Cleric Beast in the Bloodborne DLC that... Loses his legs and crawls around on the ground for second phase. This is what this cleric beast does. Except that cleric beast is like on fire and this guy's not. Hello, game. Yeah, let me take a look over towards that building. I don't see a way to get behind. Usually you go like far left. Wait a minute. I think there is a way to get behind. I think I ended up going into the sewers and av avoiding that like far left area. But I think if I go to that far left area, I can actually get behind that building. Okay, let's go fight Cleric Beast, though, because that's what I said I was going to do. I've got... Better heals. Uh, a little more stamina, but not a ton. Do I want to Ember up? I've got three. I guess I could. When he's taking phases, it, like... There's, like, death effect behind him, so getting behind him is kind of hard. Taunting, BMing, yeah. Oh, that's nice that it wasn't mad at you, I guess. That's kind of nice, but yeah, I don't know. I could never really get into the competitive TF2. When I play TF2, I play to win, but that's just how I how I enjoy playing the game. I don't get upset if I lose, or I don't know. People don't really BM in Uncle Topia. It's like pubs. Hello, Siron. Hello, welcome to the Lumpy Stream. Hope you're doing well. Oh, that's right, kind of you saying it. Thank you very, very much. That's very sweet. Yeah, I'll Ember up, I guess. And... Fire up my sword. Yeah, I feel like I just need to be like running around avoiding bosses to level up, get better equipment. But I just want to fight Boshies. Camera definitely does wonky things sometimes fighting a boss. That's probably true for just normal Dark Souls 3 though. Smack. I'm gonna smack, smack. He might stagger soon. That might have been a stagger, no? No, it wasn't. I'm not sure what that was. It's like a pain state. Ooh, I miss. <laughs> no stamina. Alright, top off my health. Ugh. 
This is not going very well. It was going well, but not anymore. Oh, that's a stagger for sure. I'm stuck inside of his crotch though. Oh! <laughs> okay, I'll teleport to his head right there. Yeah, I don't get stamina back when I visceral. I feel like that's a new mechanic. Is he phase 2-ing? He's almost a phase 2. I'm a little smacky smack. Phase 2 now. Yeah, phase 2 now. Still got fire on my sword. That's nice. One flask left. Will he give me time to fire up my sword? Yep. What's he doing? Yeah, there's like death behind him I gotta avoid. Range attack? Oh. That's a lot of curse. Let me think about this arena. I've got no heals left. Oh, I could humanity. Yeah, I would gladly humanity here. Now, I need to be in front of him if I'm attacking him. Schmeck. He's pretty low. Range attack? Yeah, just get distance here. I'll humanity again. Fuck it. <laughs> it's all off my health completely. I fucking missed. <laughs> Oh, I'm stuck inside the wall. Can I get out here? I'd like to leave now. Shit. <laughs> I really, really want more stamina. I can get him, though. I think I'll have a full humanity. I'll get back in there. Yeah, this is a weird, like, kind of... Exploration system. Where I feel- I mean, I wanna- I wanna fight bosses, cause that's honestly the highlight. Especially custom bosses, especially like unique bosses. This is the wrong buy founder, be it. But I feel like I just need to like, explore each of the areas, avoid the bosses, and... I get better gear, get better levels, get better equipment. I just want to fight bushes, you know? I'm not a huge fan of this weapon either, but I did use all my upgrade materials on it. Uh, I- oh, I got a boss soul, I forgot. I should check out that boss soul with Andre. I really want Cleric Beast to die though, so get me back in there. So I only have four humanity, I guess. What's my elixir do again? I don't remember. Oh, it increases my ember. Hmm. I guess I could do that. I don't know if max HP is really the issue though. I like fighting these little guys. Ouchie. I mean, I guess I ember up before the boss fight for max HP. Please don't smack me. Ouchie. I don't want to ember up now. I want to avoid everybody. Yeah, sweet. We should be able to get through this area, no problem. I think enemies even de-aggro once you get past the bridge. I guess I'll elixir, I guess. That increases my ember. Cool that you can change the ember. I didn't get another ember, did I know? So now I have like a little bit more max HP, I guess. Elixir. Not sure if they're gonna last the whole boss fight though. Fire up. Alright, Cleric Beast, round two. Uh, where's my souls? I guess I won't get them. I get stuck in his legs a lot. That's a stagger. I'm just- oh. <laughs> I thought I'd just get stuck in his legs, but I kind of teleport to his head there. Yeah, I don't get stamina back like while I'm visceraling. I think that's not how it works in the main game or actual Dark Souls thing. A little ship for my flesh again. I don't think that's a stagger. That's like a pain state, I think. Yeah. That was a grab. Okay, I barely hit that. Is it a grab again? Yeah. 
He's gonna phase two soon, if that immediately. Okay, there's phase two. Get distance. Heal up. I can heal again. Range attack. Okay. I got hit by the Inquisitor's deck. Um, I'm in the death. I'm in like the curse. I need to get out of there. I'm not fired up on my sword. Um, <laughs> Wonky Arena. Yeah, he's gonna catch up to me. This range attack is wonky. Yeah, I don't know how to dodge it. <laughs> Hard to see the projectiles. I'm cursed. I have a purging stone. Is that gonna cut my HP in half? Ooh, I'm burning through embers every single boss attempt to. I really don't want to go like explore, but I just want to fight the bashes. That range attack, I don't know about that one. Like, it's so hard to see. I don't think I'm cursed though. It's so hard to see and like, I don't really know how to dodge it. I can't just get distance. Maybe I need to get behind him when he goes for a ranged attack. Alright, getting back in there. How many embers do I have left? One? Uh, I'll save it. It's my last one. So I'd like not to take any damage before the boss fight, but let's see if that happens. Climb, climb, climb. Probably take damage here. Nope. I'm good. Yeah, I wouldn't use an ember for this boss fight. I think I was embered up when I fought that guy. I'm guessing the boss weapon is just that halberd. That guy was using some kind of special halberd. Alright. Yeah, I'm not using my ember. Flame up. I'll try getting behind him when he range attacks. Where are my souls? I'm not sure. Over here. Oh, I thought that was a grab. <laughs> it was a roll, though. I don't really want to heal. That's a stagger. I'm just like, yeah, I just teleport to his head. Honestly, that's fine, though. Like, It's kind of wonky, but it's okay to have like a big magnet size visceral zone. That's a grab. Okay, he's got a follow-up. Maybe that wasn't a grab then. Maybe it was just a little schmicky schmick. Ouch. I thought I was playing Bloodborne for a second. Thought I could get some damage back <laughs> after getting hit. Or some health back, rather. Oh, I miss. That's a very unfortunate miss. There's a grab attack. I'm just like stuck in his legs though. Schmick. I could refresh my, uh, yeah. So he's gonna phase two. He's not that low health. Alright, what's he doing? What's he doing? Range attack? Nope. Range attack now. Get him behind. Get behind him. Nope. <laughs> oh, come on. I only know the, like, smack attack and the range attack. And getting behind him, I can't really do because of the... Like, death around him or whatever that effect is. I'm not sure what that was actually. Yeah, I don't think distance is what I want. I don't think I have enough endurance to dodge all those attacks. Oh my god, do I ember? That's not what I wanted to happen. What was that back dodge? That was longing. I think I just like get him in like this circle. He's real low. Smack him. Nice. Alright, good deal. Give him a little shield. Spamming. Solo pus ridden beast. Come on. 
This could be like a homeward bone. I think there's like a bonfire that just teleports me out of this arena. I don't see anything past this arena. Is there not a bonfire? Hmm. Last boss gave me a bonfire I just interacted with and it like teleported me out. Didn't give me as much souls as the guy in the like cave area. Wait a minute. I can go further? No. This has got to be blocked off, right? Huh, no bonfire? Weird. Oh, I guess the other arena, like, you can't... Because I, like, slid down a hill, I can't slide back up the hill. Um, do I need a homeward bone here? I have three. I could save them. See, so I've got two boss souls. I can see what kind of boss weapons I can get. Let me... Just return to the bonfire? And we'll teleport out, I guess. So there is actually more to this area that I forgot about. I think if I go far left here and get into the cathedral area where I would normally fight boss act tree guy, I think. All right, let's check out what kind of boss weapons we can get. Ah, tis good, tis what needs. Transpose. Oh, I have two boss souls. Is one maybe like a boss souls I need though? That was definitely like a. Optional boss, though, the Cleric Beast. Is it usable item? Yeah, because I can use it to get souls, right? It is a demo, so maybe it's like they don't have the weapon for it yet. Uh, I'm seeing it anyway. Where are my boss souls? That's humanity. Help me. Hmm. Oh, there they are. I'm dumb. Are they the same? No, they just have the same, like, icon. Used to acquire many souls or transpose. Used to acquire numerous souls. Okay, so this one doesn't have a transpose, the pus ridden beast. That probably will change by the time the full release comes out. I mean, I guess I'll use it. When this mod gets fully released, I'll probably play it again in... Soul of a lone abyss watcher stationed in Lothric Kingdom. It was corrupted by the abyssal pus that plagues the capital. It was this darkness that triggered the curse of his wolf's blood. Turn the man to the beast. Yeah, that's what I can get a weapon. Let's use this. How much is it going to give me? There's no use for it otherwise. Yeah, okay, cool. This guy's got a halberd. Oh, great axe. It's not a halberd. Oh, 42 strength. Yeah, we're not using that. Okay. <laughs> we ain't using that anytime soon. Just give me a bunch of endurance, I think. I don't have great health without, um, Ember. I'm not getting any damage. Let me check out what kind of weapons I have. I'm trying to maybe use a different one. I don't see any, like, obvious really good weapon. Claymore, Bastard Sword. I actually do have the perfect amount of decks for this weapon. I could slightly get... Yeah, I might like this Claymore more. It is... A great sword. This is a this is a great sword too. They have the same move set. This great sword seems better than like the rusty one too. Just get a little bit more strength. I don't think I need full 16 too because I two handed. And the dexterity ring gives me the perfect amount of dexterity to use it. Uh, 138. Yeah, it does more damage even at level zero or whatever. Yeah, cool. We'll use this claymore instead. Bastard sword. What kind of sword is this? It tells me right. Oh, it's great sword too. I think Claymore is bigger though, has better range. And it's a little fancier. Yeah, we'll use this Claymore, I think. Well, so give me a little bit of strength. I think I need 13. Might have only needed 12. No. That's okay though, maybe a little overkill. A little damage doesn't hurt. And upgrade as much as I can, maybe two times. So as I can't buy upgrade materials. Yeah, I need two more Titanite shards. I suppose I can't buy that from anybody. This is for now, though. Um, so there's still areas to explore here. Yeah, we'll keep going back to this area, I think. Do I have any soul items? I could use this boss soul. Yeah, let's do it. I'm not gonna get that axe. When I play the full release, I'll save all my boss souls for all the cool items. I'm not sure if I want stamina or health, though. I want to upgrade my thing. I want Titanite Shards. This is so weird. Does this guy sell anything? I don't think so. 
Oh, undead bone shard. What the heck? That's huge. Is that from... I don't know what that's from. Killing cleric beast? <laughs> uh, yeah, undead bone shards are really, really helpful. I'm going to burn that right away. I'm going to put that in my bonfire and smoke it. Hell yeah. Alright. Um, yeah, I really want upgrade materials. I guess those are just found in the world, though. There's no NPC that sells them, which I kind of find surprising. Let me get... How's the scale? Descaling. Probably just more stamina. Yeah, sure. 22 stamina. And I'm gonna go to this area. Oh, I want I want to wear cool armor too, but I think endurance is more important right now. So, what bonfire do I want to go to? I think this main bonfire. The very first one, I can go through the tunnels again and pop out on the left side and hug the left side and go around and then get into the like cathedral big building, like the main building. Yeah, I want to wear cool armor, but. My fast roll is more important to me. Oh, do I need this? I think I do, actually. Actually, has no equip load, so I will definitely equip it. Actually, take the ladder. How come my... I felt like my health bar was bigger in the bonfire, or in Firelink Shrine for some reason. Ouch. Ouch. Yeah, it's gotten a really stagger on R1. It's lower than the other sword. There's no way it is. I just feel like it is for some reason. Guess I'll top off my health. It's plus two now, sweet. Remember where I got that Estus shard? I don't remember though, but... Undead bone shard is real good. I don't know why that guy gave me it, but thanks, guy. Okay. Anything different on the left side here? No. I was surprised I didn't get it, like a unique item. Going that left side, fighting those guys. Fighting like the summoner girl. The big scary tentacle thing. Schmeck. Yeah, two more Titanite shards. I can upgrade my Claymore again. Wait a minute. Oh, I kind of avoided the whole lower area by just going here through the shortcut. Okay, I'll that for next time if I need to run through this area again. This kind of turned into a Bloodborne guy. Yeah, they are. They have ranged attacks. Yeah, there's a ranged attack. Oh. This guy's throwing firebombs at me very rude. Okay. There's a lot. I mean, I kind of want to grab items now that I want to find like Titan Shards upgrade this. I'm not getting that boss item. Yeah, I use the boss hole anyway. Need more stamina. Stamina recovery would be really nice. <laughs> the grass crest shield or calanthropy ring would be nice to find. I got Apple's ring, which is nice. This dexterity ring is like perfect too, because I didn't have to level up dexterity at all to use this weapon. Um, uh, what was I gonna do? I can't remember. I thought I was going to look at my inventory for some reason, but I don't remember why. Look at rings? No? no not sure. I'm just talking about rings. I was like, it would be nice to find the Calanthropy ring, but... Uh, I did not, so I can't actually equip it. Yeah, let me go back up through this area. I kind of skipped it. I went, like, right side, fell through. Find some items. Some Titanite shards, maybe. I thought I saw an item. When I was on that bridge. Maybe it's another level above me. I like how long the flame lasts on the sword. I feel like that's buffed. Which is nice. I'll even refresh it. I'll use it one more time. Broad sword. I can't believe I got an attunement. <laughs> I thought I thought I was leveling up endurance, but I got an attunement level. This is the only spell I've found, like, I want to use. So I feel like a ranged user around here. I go up here. There was the other, like, windmill that had, like, a... 
Knockdown ladder, I'm pretty sure, which I didn't know how to use. Can I get past this ballista? Doesn't seem like I'm doing any damage to it. Okay, so that's a dead end. I'm too lazy to take the ladder. Okay, no. Fall damage for me, which is nice. This is a Bloodborne enemy. I can get one more smack on him. Yeah, sweet. Double kill. Okay, maybe there isn't actually that much more to explore in this area. I thought I skipped a lot, but I think I only skipped a little bit. Some more items for me to grab. Did I miss an item? Like, I thought I saw one, like, on the second level. Worker gloves, just armor. Hmm, okay. Yeah, I want to find Titanite shards, but... See any. Oh. I can trap down if I want to. I can't, like, continue on these roofs. I don't think there's anything up here, really. Oh, hey, guy. Actually, there is something over here. Curse bite ring? I think that just helps me against curses. There's like a blood bite ring that helps me against bleed. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I'm like, oh no, I'm cursed. But it's just like the resistance coming up. I think that's it, huh? Could have swore I was missing an item like on the ledge somewhere. I'd like to get cooler armor, but endurance is better right now. It's more important. But anything to conserve the like light roll. That was ring is nice to find. I really like maxing out my equip load, having like really cool armor on, and still like light rolling around. I think I will upgrade material. I got a Twilight Branch. I don't think it's the special one though. I got two of them. Yeah, certainly not the special one. If it was the special one, it'd be on a separate stack. Um, is the archer dude around? Am I gonna get attacked by archer dude? Going through this area. This is an interesting item. Let's try to get that. Hello. Winged guardian? Winged angel? I can't remember exactly the name of these guys. Oh, titanite shards. Nice. Sweet. I get one more and I can upgrade my sword. The crow dudes over there. I think usually there's like an Estus shard or an or a undead bone shard like on the little islands. I don't see an item over there though. One of these guys has got to like, turn into a scary guy. Maybe not. And you kill them before they transform. They won't transform. Those birdie guys doing anything? They're just chilling. Blue tearstone ring. I mean, may as well. It's not super effective, but may as well. No, girl, the girl. Do not use your bow. Her dodge is like actually has invincibility frames. I could buff my sword. I don't think I really need to, though. I'm guessing there's a boss past um where there'd usually be the great. Wood guy, cursed great wood. I think is the actual name of the boss. I call it Ballsack Tree. Yep, give me no guy. Quick. Yeah, I still think I need endurance. I'm used to dex weapons. Dex weapons are my favorite. This is definitely a slower like strength weapon though. Um, I want to see my endurance stat. I think it maxes out at 40. I'm like halfway there. Flameberg. Is it like? It looks like Zweihander. Oh, it bleeds? What do I need to equip it? I need one more point of dex. Hmm, interesting. Seems very comparable to the claymore. It does bleed though, huh? I kinda want this. Also, am I not light rolling anymore? Is it 33% or 30%? Actually, not sure. I wish it told me. Like, light load, medium load, heavy load. Huh. I want to use it. it bleeds and it has, like, the same amount of damage. And it's not upgraded. I want to use this. Get one more point of dexterity. I guess. I probably over-leveled strength, though. You could probably respec in this mod, but maybe not in the demo. What can I wear? 29.9? I guess I'll wear that. 
Um, I feel like my roll is the same, making me think that the load threshold is 33% and not 30%. I think bleeds as well, though it's a slow weapon, so you're probably not proccing the bleed all too often. It's pretty good bosses, though. Anything else in these, like, grave area? I'll top off my health. I've got plenty of heals. Yeah, I can make it to that island. I don't see a point of fighting those guys, though, but maybe they'll drop something cool. I'll go over there, Shane. Oh, they have mask on. Uh, yeah, they don't drop anything for me. Although... Oh, I thought I saw an item, like, on the rocks there. Okay, moving on. How do I get the item that was over here, though? Oh, here we go. This is an open gate. Ember, not bad. I'll take it. My precious flame sword duration. So, looks like that was a dead-end boss, so this might be like, main boss of this area, because the, like, magic armor dude looked like his arena didn't have a way out. How do I get over there? Do I just walk across here, maybe? Yeah. Actually. Uh, uh, get on top of the roof somehow? Do I just jump over there? No. <laughs> uh, oh, there's a little ledge that I can jump to. Okay, I see now. What do we have here? Small leather shield. Yeah, I can use that. Now I can open up this door for the shortcut. There's still like a ballista in front of me, which is annoying if I'm if this is like a boss run back area, which it probably is. Angel feather. Yeah, you can use the elixir. Oh, I can summon a flan. No summons. Thank you. Can I do some of the statue? No. Open up shortcut door. Ooh, chest. Sweet shortcut door. So there's four bosses in this area. Pretty sure this is main boss. And then there was... Cleric Beast. I did not check if this was a mimic. Look at the evil eye. I mean, that's just good. Probably better than curse resistance. Oh, that's pretty nice. I mean, that's not gonna help against a boss at all, but that's nice. Wait, did that fuck up my weight ratio? It did. You'll go back to this ring, I guess. I mean, I could take off this one and probably put on this one. Yeah, that's fine. Maybe there'll be summons in this boss fight. Annoying runbacks, honestly. I don't like running back to a boss, like, ever. It's like... Oh, there's an item there. So I'll just kill this guy. Maybe I'll grab that item. Like, sometimes it's nice to, like, think about the boss fight and maybe change up your strategy and maybe reflect on what you did wrong for the boss fight. Or, like, learn attacks or something. But, I don't know. I just never really want to be running back to the boss fight. If this is the main boss, the that makes gonna be annoying. Especially with like the ballista shooting you. Yeah, the boss in the desert area didn't have a run back. The like optional boss. Guy on the bridge with the armor and the magic attacks. Didn't really have a run back. This seems to have a run back though. I got a decent amount of flash though. I can't fire up my sword at all. So I'm guessing this arena won't collapse because I've already been below it. Man, what a cool area. Like it's the same, but it's remix and very, very different. These statues aren't usually here. This building isn't usually here like that. I'm super impressed with this mod. This is super cool. I will not summon anybody in the links. I've got two embers. I'm already embered up though. Alright, what do we have here? Item for me, Angel Feather. Okay, Bush, show yourself. I don't think there's any cutscenes. I haven't seen a cutscene for a boss yet. But if there were to be a cutscene, I'm guessing it'd be now. Nope, no cutscene. Angel of Gertrude. No backstab, probably, yeah. I doubt this guy would be weak to fire anyway. He holds that. Nope. Oh, holds that too. Double sip. Mm, let's go for one for now, I guess. Come back. 
punch me. His shield doesn't seem to do anything, which is nice. Okay, I need a double sip now. Still need a double sip. Yeah, I'm definitely running back to this boss, but... <laughs> first attempt, probably not gonna happen. This step attack isn't too dangerous. Where he smacks the ground with his foot. And the follow-up is easy to dodge. All right, this roll for me. <clears throat> Yeah, the damage doesn't... Yeah, it's weird. I don't get endurance back from this roll either. Alright, AoE? What's he doing? Oh my god. Fucking gank the boss fight. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Well... <laughs> so I'm dead. I could try to homer bone out. Nope. I inventory managed when I should have been... Dodge spamming. Oh man, don't... <laughs> Two bosses? Don't, don't, don't be putting two bosses in your game. Come on. Come on, mod developer. You're better than that. You're better than that, king, queen, or leash. Come on now. <laughs> You're better than that. So I could go fight the guy on the bridge. How many homer bones do I have? Two? I guess I'll run back and get my souls and get out of there, probably. Or at least try to. Right, this area is completely explored, which is cool. Yeah, give me like one level of dexterity. Maybe I'll start using that other sword, maybe. No, give me a no flame guy. Yeah, the ballista's shooting me on my way back to the boss. <laughs> Annoying ass run back. It's not as long as I thought it'd be, at least. Like, I just need a time out. Time out the ballista dodges. Yeah, cake of consume, cake of shower. Yeah, enjoy your food, Kega. Thanks for the raid again. That's a very kind of you. Alright, let's go get my souls back. And just get that along out of here. Hopefully. Uh, I guess I need to use these pillars when the second guy comes in to separate them. Yeah, I didn't see these pillars at first, or yeah, these two statues on each side. This will actually be super helpful for the boss fight. Separate the two bosses. Yeah, thanks for the kind words, Kanga. Thanks for hanging out here down halfway swing. Good rest of whatever you got going on. I want to use this flame burger, I think. What's the weight on it? Slightly. Let's wait. Yeah, 36 bleed. It does more physical damage. It could be one dexterity from the Shrine Maiden. And I'll probably just level it up once. Let these souls withdrawn from their vessels manifest farewell and Yeah, I can equip it. Yeah, yeah I like it better, I think. I think I only got one level on it. Yeah. Used my boss soul on that game. So, I could fight the guy on the bridge. I could fight final boss. I could go to the sand boss. I could find that Dark Souls 2, like, remix arena. There's two Dark Souls 2 remixes, I think, on that side. Dark Souls 3 remix at the top, and second from the bottom, and then sand area, which is completely new, which is the coolest in my opinion. Yeah, but I need more levels. More endurance, probably. This guy gave me an undead bone shard. A fui, so that was nice of him. Not sure why. Maybe it was defeating the cleric beast? Quick load. Those all seem good. My sword is slightly lighter, so I can put on another ring, I guess. Where do I want to go? Could try finding the. Sand guy some more. Yeah, see that I think. I don't really feel like I need to use any items for him because I'm pretty familiar with his boss fight. Let me help use the bathroom though. I gotta stretch, get some more water.
Hello. Well, go on then. Hmm. Interesting she sells yellow bug pellets. Yes, yeah, that's for the sandworm. I go try finding the sandworm. Not really looking forward to that though. Um, I only have a plus one weapon. I might want to just explore some more and actually get this a plus three. I use a lot of upgrade materials on that like super basic green sword. More heals. Yeah, I don't really need to use one right now. Oh, this has a different roll attack, which I like better. It's like a downward swipe instead of a poke. Yeah, I like this one better. Almost died to the kick there. AoE, yep. This is like a combo. I've got a lot more endurance than when I was playing this guy before. Put like a debuff on me? No, that's a blue tear stone ring buff. Okay. I'm not sure what that was. Yeah, we. Yeah. I wasn't able to punish them. The kick is annoying. I have one homeward bone. I'm probably just saying goodbye to these souls. That's okay. Yeah, this would be way easier. I wonder if uh, uh, the worm... The worm has a health bar, like a boss health bar. I wonder if they give a boss a soul. Yeah, these combo attacks is what fucks me up. Sometimes he just does like the... Single attack and it's no problem to dodge. Yeah, we. I'm not gonna be able to punish. I don't have endurance to run in there. I can't roll into him when he does the range attack that goes on the ground. I have like a sliver of health left. She. Give me that. I'm super dead. Yeah, he's gonna kick me. <laughs> yep. Oh man, do I just explore and level up my weapons some more? I think I got the. I think I explored the, the desert pretty much to its completion. I could try fighting the sandworm. Yeah, let's go say hi to the sandworm. I guess. Maybe yeah, I will get one shot as soon as I enter the arena. Would be funny if a sandworm had a boss soul, but I'm guessing that it will. Cause it does have like a a boss health bar. Really surprised I haven't found a merchant that sells Titanite nice shirts. Oh, there's the mine. I should go to the mine. I forgot about the mine in this area. This is my first time finding one of these spear guys. I've avoided every single one of them. Yeah, I'll go to the mine and get upgrade materials for my sword, I think. Seems like a good idea. Would we'll do that. Would we'll I do that? I forgot about the mine, yeah. It reminds me of an Elden Ring mine. I wonder if there's like cleric beasts from Bloodborne too. There's like Bloodborne enemies. That's something I wasn't expecting. Let's see. Yeah, that was a bleed proc. Cool. So the bleed does work. Good enough. Oh, I almost fell into a hole. That'd be dead. I think the Elder Ring, I'm like pressing my jump button, expecting to jump. Yeah, the Oasis is super cool. Uh, yeah, I guess I may as well put fire on this thing. So I'll do bleed and fire damage, I think. Okay, rude. <laughs> rude just dodged my opening attack like that. I didn't even trade there. Yeah, he held that one. The stamina to roll. I guess I still need more stamina. Most of the soul games, you like, endurance gives you more equip load as well, but this one there's like a unique stack for equip load. One more schmecky schmeck. 
hooked. Sword girl's coming over here. Yeah, just leave her alone. Two undead bone shards, one SS shard, I think is what it's called. I think these miners are upgraded too. I could probably just R1 spam them to death though. Got one shard. We'll need to refresh my fire soon if I feel the need to do that. Let's see what we got here. Oh, raw fire, hell yeah. That's really helpful, because I have this fire spell. So I'll do more fire damage. I should get my... There's Titanite Shard, sweet. Get my, like, um, perfume bottle. I forget what it's called, but get that to be fire damage. And I think I can stack them, too, for even more fire damage. What a cool system. Oh, 15 Prism Stones. That guy gave me an SS Shard. Yeah, sweet. I'll try to explore here. I'll probably try a sandworm and just do some more bosses. Alright, let's tippy toe over here. Dun, dun, dun. Wouldn't be cool to wear cool armor, but I need more stamina still. <laughs> I still need more stamina. I'm going to tonight. Yeah, most of the time it's just like more endurance, more equip load as well. But this game, they do it a little differently. I'm scared to fall off, but I'll be alright. See. What do we got here? Cool item? Oh, just a song. Can I jump across? No, I don't think so. I haven't found any illusory walls yet. I think we only found one Titanite Shine. But all these, like, flame things are nice. I'll just do all flame. I don't really care too much about any of the other effects. Like, there's some that I don't even know what they do, like abyssal, en abyssal enemies? I don't know what that is. The HP recovery, I wasn't super impressed with, even with like doubling up, stacking the effects. But the fire damage is, you know, damage is damage. Damage is always good. Yeah. This is like straight out Elden Ring. I mean, that's not a complaint. It's just like, uh. I don't know. There was like some other Elden Ring like enemies. Like, I don't know if you can like port an Elden Ring enemy to Dark Souls 3. I don't know anything about modding. There's a crystal lizard over there. That was super greedy to go for an attack there. I got an SS shot from one of these guys though. Yeah, they hit really hard. Oh, there's a bonfire over there. Unless that's a fake bonfire. I'd very much like to touch you, bonfire. Please don't be fake. Oh, we're Gitchy. Alright, I rest this I rest up. Huh, this might be deeper then. So that other area, there was three optional bosses and looks like a main boss, so four bosses total. This area, I've only found two bosses so far. But there might be a third one at the end of this, like, mine. I didn't expect this mine to be, like, a big area. There's a bonfire down here? I expect it to be just, like, a little spot to grab some tight night shards. Fog door over there. No, Fogdor doesn't necessarily mean boss. But I'd be surprised if it didn't. Can I get a plunging attack on this guy? I don't think so. Oh, I actually got it. Took some falling damage, too. What's this miner doing? Oh, I tried to backstab and failed. Is he gonna die to the lizard? Am I gonna die to the lizard? Who's gonna die to the lizard? I go for another plunging attack? I think the miner guy died. Ah, okay, they're up here now. Nope. Hunter guy did not die. I need stamina. Oh, he's almost dead. Finite skill. I'm trying to, like, fire things behind him. I could go to the alchemist and get some fire damage. I wanted more Titanite shards. I didn't find a ton. How many do I have? Two, yeah. I think I need four to upgrade my sword again. Hmm. I think the miner has a chance to drop one. I think I really only found one. Eh. Yeah, I guess I'll go to the elixir. I got a ton of these like fire things. We'll go to the laboratory. Alchemy guy. Ooh, that's good water. Ooh, that's a crisp. You're not gonna give me a bone shard for no reason, are you? Nope. <laughs> nope. 
Uh, I don't think I have enough souls to level up. I could check though, just double check. Yeah, no. Not even close, okay. Give me fire damage. Yeah, two, sure. Combine, increase fire attack by large, yes please. That's probably the only thing I'm ever going to use, because I have this fire spell. I don't think I have any new ingredients, nope. Don't Prepare new items? I don't know, that probably just means I can buy like alchemy ingredients. That probably doesn't mean that I can make like more powerful, what are they called? Elixirs? Yeah. Oh, I keep thinking I need to teleport through the bonfire, but that's not how it works. Really? No, like, Titanite Shard? Salesman? Hmm. Interesting. Triple check here. He sells homeward bones. That's kind of nice, actually. Ooh, cool armor. Swag, swag, swag. How's that compare to my armor, though? 4.8 on, like, the helmet? If it's much lighter, maybe I'll buy it. It's a little lighter. I won't buy it, though. Yeah, this reminds me of Elden Ring's round table hold. That's where I spawned in from. I think the miners have a chance to drop Titanite shards. Even with this unupgraded weapon, I think it's better than the one I was using that was upgraded. Let's go back to the mine. Yeah. Where's the fog gate? I don't know how the uh, fighting the sandworm's gonna go. I can buy lightning. I don't think, yeah, the lizard doesn't respawn. I can buy lightning resistance from that girl next to the bonfire. I could rusted coin, fire gem. Ooh, interesting. Probably not gonna use that. Don't I have like a rusty coin for drop rate chance? Yeah, boost item discovery. Sure, let's do it. Why not? Farm some miners for a little bit. Maybe find some shards. These guys drop those. They're easy to farm too. Just R1 spam. What's going on down here? This guy's mad at those boxes? And now he's mad at me. Wait, is he a different miner? I think he is. I think R1 spam takes care of him. Okay, two of those. And nothing here. So I don't think those will get rid of my buff going back to the bonfire. My item discovery buff. Pretty sure these guys can drop tiny shards. This one isn't different. I'm sure. Nothing. Yeah, I still got my item discovery buff. Okay, that aggroed that guy. Yeah, like the guy below was aggroed too, kind of weirdly enough. This guy's hauling ass down those stairs. Need stamina. Yeah, still no Titan shard. My buff wore off. Okay, never mind. I no longer want to farm for Titan shards. I now want to go fight the boss. I used one flask. Eh, whatever. Just let me see the boss, I guess. <laughs> Ooh. No Titan shards around here. Yeah, surprised you can't buy one from a vendor. Maybe you can. Maybe I just need to find, like, the bell bearing. I mean, I guess the bell bearing would probably be here. Hello, Chaos Amalgamite. This is a Bloodborne boss from the Chalice Dungeons. Weird. Can you just, like... I guess you just, like, ste not steal, but, you know, you take the... The moveset from, like, a Bloodborne enemy or boss. I don't think you can, like, import it. Especially with, like, Bloodborne not ha being on PC. I should have fired up before this boss fight. Maybe it's not the exact same as a Bloodborne boss, maybe it just has a similar design. I haven't played the Bloodborne Chalice Dungeons in forever, so... Can't say for sure, this is an AoE that I'm just gonna stand in, you. Yeah. Ooh, and now I'm in the, a fire area. Okay, cool. Yeah, I think Bloodborne has a boss similar to this, but it might not just be like a straight port, it might not be like a straight, like... one-to-one -one copy. Okay, okay, I see you. Arc Thrones, Dark Souls 3 demo. I've warmed up to the exploration. I was playing Deprived though, so like... 
That's raw fire crystal. I don't like that. So I was definitely weaker than all the other starting characters. I guess I got would have given me a flask. No secrets around here, no. Okay. So I want two elixir for more fire damage. And buff up my fire. There you go, sweet. Okay, round two. I guess these souls are pretty important. Dang it. That's two flash down already. I don't like this arena. I'm a huge fan. Yeah, he's like slightly too tall where I can't see the top of him. Makes him hard to see what he's doing. He's a good size, but oh, the camera seems. Could be worked on. I'm trying to think of original Dark Souls 3 and if there's any enemies where like the camera really annoys me. I'm sure there are. I'm just farming miners still on my way to the bus. Could use my coins here. This guy is dropping maybe a different kind of miner. Yeah, because he's dropping raw fire crystals and not Titanite shards. Maybe I don't do my item discovery farm boost against these guys. I don't really care about the fire crystals. I've got tons. I could ember. Hmm. Nah, I don't think so. How much do I care about the souls? Because, like, going to get the souls there, I took, like, some free hits of damage. Yeah, they're in the back of the arena, too. I need, I'm going to recover them and then run to the front of the arena. So I'm likely to die over there instead. Ugh. Yeah, I still get two shot. He might have had like a weak spot on his knee. Do a little sippy sip. That's a stagger, I think. Oh, maybe not. Schmick. Okay, now he's gonna AoE. Whoops. I didn't recognize that as an AoE. I thought maybe that was just putting like fire over the arena. It's a little bit of both, though. That's like phase one and a half, though. That doesn't seem like a phase two. At least where his health bar's at. Blue tear stone ring. Hey, we there. Oh, I'm alive! What the heck the heck? I cut Ember! <laughs> uh, I'll go for it, fuck. I got it off. Oh my god, that's a lot of damage. That would have one-shot me if I wasn't Embered. Hey, we again? I got distance, though. Two humanities. Oh, he's much lower than I thought he was. This is where I choke. <laughs> Fuck. Alright, get me back in there, though. Alright. I recognize the AoEs. Right around the area. This is definitely like optional boss though. I don't think there's anything past him. Damn, I Ember during that? Mm. I don't like having to go back to alchemy, dude. I guess I want to buy like the... It's so funny. You can buy like the alchemy at bonfire buff. Oh, you don't have to keep going back to fire link. It's bad enough I got to level up at fire link. Just let me level up at the bonfire. Come on now. Fire gem. I don't think I Ember before the boss fight. My soul's right there, that's nice. I just gotta play better. Just got to get good. Five Estus. Too early on that roll. Yeah, I've got a good amount of stamina now where, like, I can attack and dodge. Effectively. Little stagger. I think he's gonna AoE now. Just give me distance here. 
I guess I'll top off my health. Like, I have the opportunity to heal. Whether I need to heal or not, I take the opportunity to do so. I'm in the fire. Ouch. I used my last, like, alchemy thing. I'm too lazy to go back to Fire Link and, and re-up, though. These guys aren't dropping Titanite Shards. So we're gonna run past them. I got one Ember left. Not Apothecary. Like, bonus fire damage probably doesn't do anything. It's kind of a nice, like, little invisible wall against those guys so they don't fuck with you when you're in this, like, little area. Buffing up and doing whatever. Very cool. How much do I care about my souls? Not as much as maybe I should. Yeah, I really like the rolling attack on this weapon better than my other one. Need stamina. Okay, phase two already? I guess I could go get my souls while he's covering the arena in fire. I think he still has like the same basic attacks other than the AoE attack. Okay, that's a double, triple even shit. Stand in the fire. Oh, the fire hurts. Oh my god. I need to get out of the fire. <laughs> yeah, fire does a, a big chunk of damage. I think I get like four shot by the fire. I'm getting back in there though. I get the hecky heck back in, in there. Do I have souls? I think I do. I think I think I still have souls in there that I should recover, or at least try to. I mean, it's not gonna progress anyway. It's just gonna, you know, leave me there. I just want Titanite Shards, huh? I do like this sword a lot, though. I like the move set. Little kick attack. I think I'm good not healing for now. I might not need endurance as much anymore. I might. Be able to go for health. Should go for health. Let's go spinny around. AoE. Um, I'm stuck against the wall. I'll get out anyway. I'll double sip. Yeah, the flames right now are not a problem. The arena's big enough I can get away from them. Okay, he's putting more on the ground. I want to get to the other side of the arena, away from the flames. Oh, hello, Sartoni. Hello, I thought we I thought you were doing well. No, that's a course, no. That's a course. No, it's a dirty, how could you? Here we. Like, back here. That's my final flask going in. Seems like he doesn't. Oh, AoE again, fuck. That actually hit me, fuck. <laughs> well, that's all my heals. Not really sure what hit me there, but something did. Did I walk on fire? <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> oh, fucking... This fucking boss. Oh, man. Alright, get back in there. I get back in there, though. He got real low one time. I think I used my ember. Just ignore these miners. If they were dropping Titanite Shards, I'd farm them. There might be different kind of miners that don't drop the Titanite Shards. Well, I could buy embers. There's only three from that guy, though. Just like in Dark Souls 3. I could put on, like, full pyromancy gear. That probably would give me fire resistance. But I like my quick roll. Barely got him. He might AoE soon. No. All of his attacks are just like ones until. There we go. AoE time. Okay, come at me. Dun, 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 dun. 
I think I've gotten hit yet. Okay, there we go. I'm living. That's just a one. I can't see much. There we go. I think the fire is about to expire, yeah. That's three. Uh oh! I did like a lot of damage there. I think I'm like breaking his armor, like the rocks around him, maybe. Oh, he's AoEing. Fuck, I'm dead. Or at least getting hit there. Damn it. <laughs> the like slam the ground move, huh? Alright, getting back in there though. That was real close. <laughs> that was real close. There's enough room in the arena. I don't hate the arena as much as I once did, but there's enough room in the arena to get from one side completely away from the fire back to the other side. Oh my! I don't think there's any souls there actually. <laughs> I would be souls would be there. Yeah, I did like a large amount of damage to him at one time. I think once I do a large amount of damage to him, he's gonna do like the slam the ground attack, which I have a really hard time dodging. Oh, I actually do have souls. Okay. I have a ring that's kind of useless right now, but I don't think I have any other options. Check. Okay, AoE. Run away. Alright, there's no fire around here. Not so bad. Yeah, I can't tell if he hits a certain health threshold and then he AoEs. Kind of time in the fight. There's three. There he specks the ground. He'll do that one more time. I think when I break another like one of his shards, he's gonna keep smacking. Hey, we. Like I can hit by the fire though. I gotta heal off the fire off the ground. It doesn't feel great. I've still got two flasks. Not so bad. Can't see anything. I'm stuck inside of him. Give me some stamina back. I don't really care about rebuffing my flame sword. I'm healthy, boy. One more hit. All right, sweet. All right, we got him. I got my souls back too. Ember soul, homeward bone. Yeah, cool. Oh, there was a text below that. I didn't even read the like big text, but you shall obtain something, something. Ooh, things you pick up. Uh, no bonfire. Oh, no, yeah, no bonfire. I mean, I'm not gonna use a homeward bone because there's a bonfire real close, but. I guess it was just the one boss that, like, you know, I slid down like a slide and there's no way I could make my way back. I really want Titanite Shards, fuck. I could go to the Cathedral of the Deep. Look for Titanite Shards there. Oh, I don't have stamina to R1 spam this guy to death. Alright, there we go. So I got a boss, so I'll look at the boss weapon, but I'll probably just end up popping it for... I don't know, I want Titanite Shards more than anything, but I guess I'll use it on like Endurance or maybe some more health. This guy's down here. Could I make my way up the mine? I did I think I got at least one Titanite Shard drop. I should go spend these souls though. I can spend 10,000 to like get the Alchemy guy, but who cares. I guess whenever I go back to level up, I'll get the Alchemy guy's flame. Alchemy booster thing buff. Let's go do that right now, actually. So I beat another mini boss. Hello again. Yeah, you don't have any free undead bone shards for me. I haven't found any like items to give to this guy to like increase his wares. Everything. 
Give me Titanite shards, my guy. Ooh, he does have swag armor. That's kind of a... It's not a waste of souls. I mean, it is swag. Talisman. Yeah, no upgrade materials, huh? Andre doesn't sell any... Weapons and Look at the alchemy guy. Get some more of those. Fire booster things. They're basically free. I've got so many. I don't know how effective they really are. Yeah, give me that. Wait, did I do that? I think I said no by accident. Yeah. Increase fire attacks by large amounts, please. I go fight the worm, I guess. Yeah, I go fight the worm. Check out this boss zone. I don't have mixed feelings about, like, coming back to Firelink Shrine. It's nice to, like, get some respite from exploring and boss fighting and all that stuff, but, I don't know, sometimes I just want to, like, level up at the bonfire and do everything at the bonfire. Oh, he doesn't have a special weapon. Okay, we'll just use the boss hole then. Probably in the final release of the level boss weapon. Used to acquire numerous souls. Yep, yeah, okay. Soul created from fire gems and necromancer Obidiah. Study the life-bearing properties of the Twisted Chaos Flame. With his forbidden art, he created abominations that would do his every bidding. Cool. I guess some decent amount of levels. Do I just want to pump health, though? I think I do need to pump health. I'm very low health without, um... Without embering. Yeah, sure. We'll go all into health. I really want Titanite Shards, him. I don't think I'll go to Desert... Eh. Yeah, let me not go to a boss fight right away. Let me go... This area next, yeah. They're really deep. I could explore around the castle. I wasn't really... Didn't really feel like exploring around the castle because it's just like a Dark Souls 3 area, but I just do, like, you know, the unique... Desert area. So I don't mind doing a little remix Dark Souls area. Let me explore around the castle, see what we got. I find some good stuff. Why isn't my health full? That's weird. It's like almost full? Weird. I can't seem to like target enemies that are sleeping, which is actually a good change probably. Like the target range is slightly lower. I did make it like all the way around the castle and then end up dying in the castle. I need to go slower. Yeah, I've got better heals now, better weapon, better stats. Alright, what do we got around the castle? I want to upgrade my... Armor, because I'm not very swag right now, but... Yeah, I'll worry about being swagged out for the actual game release. Oh, don't smack me with your book. How rude. The crystal lizard got away, but I don't think I really care about that, because I'm not... Oh, Titanite Shard, nice. I'm not really using any weapon that would care about that. How many Titanite Shards do I have? Three? I need one more to upgrade to level two, and then six to upgrade to level three, which is max for the Titanite Shards. Crystal Lizard. He's just a little baby guy, though. Usually there's a big one here. Oh, this guy. Yeah, I can just ignore the Crystal Lizard, honestly. Okay. I'm stuck up against the wall. I don't know if the blue tear stone ring like activates after I go low health or like before I go low health, like the final attack that would get me to low health. Alright, we got him. 550 souls. That gave me an SS as well. So there's like an animation for getting souls and an animation for getting SS. They look kind of similar, but. I recognize the difference now. Oh, it's a nice shard. Nice. I can upgrade this sword. Which I probably will. Oh, fuck. Now I feel like I shouldn't, because... It's such a pain in the ass to upgrade. I didn't spend a bunch on, like, that not-so-great sword. Cage guy. Just you, cage guy. You're not too scary. Yeah, so I think I explored the entire... outer area of the castle. Do 
we have here? Saint Tree Belmont? I think that's a... It's like a talisman to cast spells. Okay, another witch. I'll top off my health for going in here. Might be more than just her. Oh, she smacked me with her book again. No. Nice, nice, nice shard. Damn, do I- I'm trying- I'm cautious on committing to this weapon. Like, I like it, but it's not like crazy nice. Hmm. It's a toughie. I might end up just like going to a boss weapon, too. I mean, I think I've killed three or four bosses and only one has given me an actual boss weapon or a boss item in general. They're not always weapons. There's some items up there that I did not get. Oh, doggy. No, give me no doggy. I can upgrade this weapon, fuck. I don't know if I want to or not, though. No, I can't use this bonfire. Well, let me run all the way away. Let me check out all my weapons. Yeah, there's not like a dex weapon I want to use. I use the Great Scythe for my Dark Souls 3 playthrough. This one does 30 bleed. This one does 36 bleed. Hmm. Yeah, that seems pretty good. Yeah, we'll upgrade it. Yeah, we'll upgrade it. Sure. Maybe I'll switch to a boss soul weapon, that, which takes different upgrade materials. So it's not like I'm losing out upgrading this weapon if I choose to use a boss weapon. Nexus for me. Now I need to go into the castle. I explored around the castle. I got some tiny shards here. Sure. I'll take it. Upgrade my weapon. Although I can like infuse it with fire damage. So it will no longer... I don't think... Then I can't like put fire on it though and I'm already putting fire on it so I think that's just a bad idea. Scale with faith, no thanks. Yeah, I'll just keep it standard. Uh, reinforce it one more time. Alright, Flameberg plus two. Need five more Titanite Shards. Get that maxed out with, with Titanite Shards at least. Uh, probably use a soul item here and get a level. Uh, what do I want to level up them? Health? Mm, give me endurance. I haven't gotten like any strength or any endurance or any dexterity rather to upgrade my damage. Oh, I, didn't, I didn't mean to do that. I always think I'm uh, teleporting with that. You get anything free for me? Nope. Without free. Okay, back to the Cathedral of the Deep. So this is pretty like this is like a dead end in Dark Souls. So you go down here, kill the Arc Deacons, the Deacons of the Deep. Yeah, you kill the Deacons of the Deep, and then you just. Go to another area. You can probably get a shortcut through that door next to the bone farm. I am full health now, which I wasn't first time coming in. Yeah, there's some items over there. Whatever, though. There's some items, there's some areas. I still got sandworm. I still got desert boss. I've got night that summons another night and night on bridge. Probably fight Night on Bridge again. A better weapon, better stats, better heals. Much better heals. I think I was at plus zero on my flask, but now I'm on plus two. Oh, Dougie. Ah, give me no Dougie. Uh, attempted to heal, but I guess I won't. Yeah, this is even a shortcut, I think, at least in Dark Souls 3, but it's kind of not a very necessary shortcut. That big door right at the beginning. This guy just dies after he shoots me with his big attack. Yeah, that's fine. Are you okay with me? Maybe because they're like ghost enemies, the audio seems weird to me. Like it doesn't quite line up with when I actually attack them. Hmm, kind of getting overwhelmed here. Maybe I'll just get down a line out. Don't you mind me. What a wee huffy lid. Can I jump over here? I can. Does this give me anything special? This is just the normal way to go. Oh, I think it does give me somewhere, somewhere special. There's another item. It 
Just a weak song. Oh, this is where I respec this area. Much later on, but maybe I'll respec here as well. Where's the item I missed there? And then... I can just get back there? Yeah, we'll grab this item, because I can get back there easily. Oh, I could have gotten that other item too. Dual charm, I don't care about that. For PvP or offline invasions. Ouch. Alright, not so bad. I can just walk there? Hold on, now I'm confused. There was an area I had to like jump to. Yeah, that's not going to get me where I want to go. It's, it's, it's down here. I need to jump to this. Support beam? Architecture support beam? What's that green glow? That's not my souls. There's a green glow down there, though. Huh. Uh-oh. Scary noises? Behind? Below me? My flame sword makes me feel safe. It's kind of like a lantern. It's kind of like a torch. Ding. Ding. F fucking hitting my sword on the wall. For a split second, I thought maybe the dev got rid of that feature, but no. <laughs> Somebody gonna pop out of here? I think I poked my head in here. There's like a green glow down here. Yeah, right there. Check for illusory walls, maybe. But I kind of doubt it. Maybe the next area, that big, like, square area, I can get down. I think I've been in here. Does somebody drop down from the ceiling? No? Guess I'll check for illusory walls, then. Yeah, there's not going to be an illusory wall here, I don't think. Oh, I thought that item was, like, right there. Where is that item, then? Up here, to the left? Oh, yeah, you go deeper. Oh, there's a big scary enemy. And my fire just... Oh, these are little scary enemies. The little baby guy. The little baby spider guys. Oh, so cute. There's a big version of these guys. Rusted gold coin. That's for better item discovery than the... Rusty copper coin, I think. Okay, cool. I mean, I guess if I find an enemy I want to farm, I can use those. Yeah, weird. Let me check out this... Green aura again. Yeah, there it is. It's like... Oh, it's a torch. I think it's a torch on the side of the castle. Yeah, that's what I see. Although, there's a... There might be a body down there, huh? Okay. Interesting. I think it's just a torch on the side of the castle, though. Oh, I took fall damage from that. Oh, unlucky. Okay, let's flame up. There's a big enemy here, I think. I got another flame, too. We'll pop out of the sand. Yeah. Oh, it's just one of these guys. It's actually not that scary. Yeah, we got him. Sweet. That'd be kind of scarier than that. Um... Yeah, no, like, ledge for me to go around. Physics on that thing. I guess some people get crashes on, like, the current version of Dark Souls 3, but I haven't experienced that. I mean, I got one crash, but... I don't think that's a huge deal. Happened, like, in a loading screen, too, so I didn't lose any progress. Some behind me here? Oh, I can't go this way. You can usually in the... Oh, I'm good. Alright, let's fight the witch. Does rolling take more stamina? Hmm, it might. It's a weird thing to like have the visceral. Just gonna do a grab attack. That's fine. I think normally when you're visceral ring, you get your stamina back. This time it's just like you're always attacking. You're constantly like stamina drain. One over here. Okay. Humanity. All right. Get me in the castle. There's some scary enemies in there. I think it's just a torch. I don't think I can get to that, like, green spot. I've still got fire, so let's kill this Bloodborne enemy real quick. Okay, they grabbed me. 
They're gonna suck me. No, please don't suck me. They do like a ranged attack that like assails me too and they try to run over and get me. Yeah, they're straight out of Bloodborne. Super cool. This is like the Bloodborne area, I'm guessing. Yeah. Well, I didn't realize. I think I was like spam dodging through here. I didn't get a chance to appreciate the beautiful architecture. Oh my god. That's getting screenshotted, except not really because I don't want to fuck up the game by pressing my keyboard at all. Uh, let's play up again. There's like a night guy in this next room. I really want to get a shortcut. I've got three flasks. Here's some sloppy slimy guy. Backstab, backstab, give me the backstab. No backstab. We got him on me. It's gonna blow up. Yeah, this place is so cool. Uh, I can flash now. He just gave me one. I got three heals left. A dead hunter charm. Probably gonna get invaded here. There's no like giant, which is nice. I'm running through this area. Oh, there's. Oh my. <laughs> there's the fucking little guys. They're a little different though than like the alien guys. There's like the enemy that just looks at you and kills you. I'm not sure if it's gonna work the same way in this game. We'll see though. They're just standing there menacingly. No, okay. There's no like look at me. Oh, there is. Hmm. No, there's not curse build up from just looking at me, but they do curse build up on hits. I'm not really scared of this game. Kind of really just want to run away and heal. Oh, is this shortcut? Uh oh. I did, would not have noticed this door here. That's a real nice shortcut to get. Please don't grab me, Gertie Girl. Down the elevator I go. I don't know if they'll follow me though. They seem like they wouldn't. I think I, I think there's more I need to unlock from that shortcut too. Go to the little chapel. Alright, sweet. Oh, it's this guy. It's the Bloodborne guy! Oh wait, is it? I think it is. I mean, he doesn't look exactly like the Bloodborne guy. Where's the mommy spider? To fight the mommy spider. So I can't kill him if I want to. I mean, fuck it, this is the demo. Need whatever you have, guy. Hopefully he doesn't fight back, because... I don't want to die. Does he actually die, though? Gonna blow up. Gives me a spell, okay. That's a mist from that guy. Do I have permanent mist now? No, it evaporated eventually. Ooh, it's a tiny nice shirt, nice. Probably will upgrade this thing all the way. Just, I don't know, look for like a boss soul to use, I guess. There were like two lizards that I didn't get around the castle if I want to find upgrade materials. I think I go level up. I've got full elixirs. I'm not gonna get more. Wait a minute, this isn't bonfire. Not quite yet, at least. And yeah, this is one way, right? One over from this side, yep. Bonfire over here. Ooh, whip. Normally you'd find a whip here. Crescent axe, huh? I don't really like axes, but that one looks pretty cute. Cool. Don't think I'll be using that. Yeah, bonfire right here, cool. Shortcut for me. Uh, yep, yeah, I gotta go back to the Nexus to level up. I wanna look at my ring situation too. Like, the heal on kill is useless for boss fights. But I don't think I have any better options. Yeah, not really. Unless the enemy is cursing me, I don't care. Um, what do I want for level? Stamina, probably? Yeah. Give me stamina. Give me back in the castle. Anything free for me? Nope. Nope. Uh, no, that's desert. Here's castle. Cathedral. I haven't gone to the Dark Souls 2 areas and all. But I was doing, like, no damage to that big guy. And it was, like, the frosty area. Maybe you're supposed to go... Mm. I don't know. I think... If, it seems to me that the very tippy top, the one in the very middle, is the lowest level area. It's not obvious where you're supposed to go, which is kind of cool. I've warmed up to the exploration, like, uh, 
way of this game, the non-linearity, how they deal with it. I guess I'm just running around as deprived and I'm like, what the fuck do I do? I'm so weak. Alright. Up the elevator I go. I can't even look like a Bloodborne guy. <laughs> God, Bloodborne is so cool. I don't know, it's close. My favorite from software game is either Bloodborne or Dark Souls. It's real close though. In my heels. Play up. Wait, is there a guy behind me? No. Nah, nah, nah. Yeah, they're like the alien guys, but they look different. They have different heads. This is kind of weird to fight. Yeah, that's a really weird attack to dodge, but um, we, we dodged it. <laughs> We're living. They're doing curse to me. We got them, though. They're in curse and bleed. I already used two flasks for that, which is a little bit more than I like. Oh, Lloyd's Sword Ring. I mean, I guess I'll get that. And eh, probably better than Blue Tearstone. Not my favorite ring, but it's pretty good. It's in the exact same spot as it usually was. Could put on, like, the curse resistance. Oh, I'm like, why am I killing these guys in one, one, one shot now? It's because of the... Lloyd's ring, Lloyd's tearstone, or attack ring, or whatever it's called. What do we have here? Okay, spooky, scary spiders. They're like little baby spiders, though. They're so cute. Another one over here. Yeah, I can't target it at this range. This is probably a good change, honestly. Okay, there goes my ring buff. Talisman, don't care about that. Is there a mini boss in this area? Might be a big mommy spider. Oh yeah, there's there's a little spider. There's a little spiders. I have a bow now, I need to remember. I mean, I could go back through the desert. There was like two hanging bodies I had. Items on them. I'm not uh, probably not super concerned about those though. I mean, I guess I could while I'm going to fight them. Sandworm. Not really on the way, but I still could. Okay, one of those guys. I really don't like those guys. I could flame up again, sure. Yeah, they look even cooler than, like, the actual Bloodborne enemies, I think, with, like, the glowing eyeballs. Huh. Is there really just that guy up here? Not all exploration is to be rewarded, but... I do love when my exploration is rewarded. Yeah, this is a pretty big area. Oh shit. Well, taking some fall damage here. Oh, that was a lot of fall damage. I'm gonna amber up, fuck it. I wanna save my flasks. Give me a full heal, sure. So I can just walk down. Yeah, there's nothing really going on over there. Probably big mommy spider fights over here. I can flame up one more time, I've got enough magic for it. These guys. Usually there's a mimic here, I think. No mimic this time, though. I mean, to call these things spiders is probably a little inaccurate. Close enough, though. Oh! You scared me! There goes my flame buff. Top off my health. Yeah, now I want, like, HP regen to be top health more often for the Lloyd sword ring. Fall on top of me, spider. What do you fight you? There you go. So this- oh! Hello. Hey! Hey, you don't sound amateur at all with your voice acting. Very cool. Wait, is the crown guy a girl? I mean, that's a feminine voice. I expected mommy spider fight here. Hold on. In Dark Souls 1, having that guy escape is bad. Let's talk to her instead. Please hurry. Mm, Alright, fine. We'll save you. It's locked. Oh, I don't have the key. 
Please hurry. Okay. Not sure if I trust you. Xanthus crown individual. Ooh. Path over here. Unless never mind. It just goes to the main area. Okay. Ooh, secret path. Wow. Okay. Oh man. I really don't like that skull enemy in the middle. I have fire bombs. How many do I have though? Four? A bunch of normal fire bombs. I don't even know if like I can kind of choose it. Oh, it is just like Bloodborne. This is just like the bridge from Bloodborne. To get to like drop the horn. Oh. That's a new attack. Let me do a little spam roll away. Yeah. I don't know if they're weak to fire. Grab a heal. Uh, they're glitched. Nice, cheese them. Yeah, get them. Yeah, take that. <laughs> yeah, take my fire bombs. Yeah. Uh oh. Staggering her. Reset her AI. Alright, we got her though. So she has a bleed on look effect. In Bloodborne, it's like insta death on look. If that like meter charges up completely. Whatever, I'll spend 14 fire bombs or whatever and use them all up. Whatever. Oh, this is weird. Okay. Can I get to those other like bridges? No. Okay, that's kind of nice then. Although I probably can eventually, huh? This seems kind of like a high level area too, honestly. I'm gonna get poisoned. Toxic? Do I have any kills for that? Um... It's not taking away my health. I don't know what Toxic's doing. No, I don't have Toxic heals, I don't think. No moss clumps. Uh, I don't really know what they're doing though. I seem to be okay. Oh. Um, harvestable item. Now, shortcut might be around here somewhere, like on the other side. Take a left here, maybe. I got one flask left. Yeah, I think this is the other shortcut, maybe. The like purple mist makes me think that it's like poison, but it's just like atmosphere. Yeah, here. Sweet. This is the other shortcut. I think I need to keep going to unlock it at the like chapel. Oh, this goes to like yeah. This will get me to like the upper area. And I can drop down to maybe get to that covenant. Oh, I don't think there's any covenant in this game, but maybe to the respec area. Not that I would like need a respec. Respec usually takes covenant item. I don't know what it takes in this game, in this mod. If there is the respec area. If there wasn't last game, cool. Refill my heals. I'm not close to a level up, so I won't be doing that. I need help use the bathroom though. I drink a lot of water when I stream, so I always have to pee a lot. Out of water. <laughs> I'm like, I don't want to like use the bathroom and refill my water. That's too much time away from my video game. I gotta play my video game. I take a left here. I guess I'll go up that tower now. Maybe I'll go to the, like the respec area. I'm trying to remember where I found. Oh wait. Oh here we go. Like where's the elevator? I'm trying to remember where I found that Estus shard. I don't remember, but I do remember where I found the two homeward bones or not homeward bones, the uh, undead bone shards. One where it like normally is in like the burning village and one that dude just gave me. I guess he gave it to me after I killed a cleric beast, but I don't know exactly how that happens. 
or why he gave me that undead bone shard. Let's randomly talk to him. So then I'll loop around. Oh, I want to go up. Hold on. Oh, ladder around here, I think. Yeah, ladder. Cool. There's spooky, scary noises, dude. Yeah, so there's desert level, bloodborne area. Remix of, like, the burning area. And two Dark Souls 2 areas. Smack. Yeah, I feel like rolling takes more stamina. I'm sure that's in my head or not. Maybe even, the, like, the visceral thing where visceraling an enemy doesn't regain your stamina. Is in my head as well. Okay, I can't interact with this bell. Just dropping down. That's all there's to do, yeah? Wee. How many spooky, scary enemies up here? Sounds like all the spooky, scary enemies are below me. No illusory wall. I haven't found one yet. Hmm. Check. I think that was like a critical. Like they opened themselves up to like a more powerful attack. I don't think usually I'd be one-shotting these guys, especially because I don't have Lloyd's ring on. Yeah. I'm not usually one-shotting these guys. Okay, this will go in. Let me explore. Right here completely. Yeah, that was a critical or whatever. Ooh, I can go down here. What's over here? Anything? Nothing? Okay. That was the only uh, pillar. Oh, there's a... Is that an item? That was weird. Unlike the big roof, there was like a little flicker of light. It, it went away though. Not sure what that was. There's no like weather effects that are like flickers of light. I don't really mind these little baby spiders, honestly. They're really not that bad. Just two shot them, no problem. They stagger on light attack too. Okay. Uh, in the base game, there's like knights on these pathways, which are real dangerous. Because rolling's an issue on pathways. Oh, item here. Okay, cool. Let's see if there's knights on those. Look, there's just spiders. Oh, arbalist. Okay. I think that's a crossbow. I have a bow, though. So, if I need to shoot something out of a tree or whatever, I'm probably using that. Yeah, those, like... I guess there's, like, flashing light weather effects. Which I saw on... I don't like where I'm positioned. Yeah, there we go. I'm gonna flame up again. I almost feel like coming up here, I'd be like taking damage. Okay, I don't see any knights. It's so much darker. Oh, this is so cool. Yeah, Dark Souls 3 is probably like the perfect Dark Souls to mod, honestly. This is the combat and movement is so good. Okay, there's two of those real scary guys. Uh, I don't see an item over there. They're looking at me. Menacingly. <laughs> oh, they're coming over here. Fuck. I can bait them out here, though, at least. I think that doesn't do that much damage. Um, how important is the fire? Oh, I'm one-handing my weapon. I was wondering what was going on with my attacks. Uh, leave me down, please. I'm still one-handing it. Yeah, I wasn't doing any damage. I don't have the strength to one-hand it. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Alright, there's one more. I'll put on curse resistance ring. Probably not. Just don't get cursed, Humphrey. I've got one more flame from my sword, although I might not need it. I don't really want to fight them on the pillars. Okay. Wrong location. What the hecky dick? Where's my pillar that I'm trying to go to? It's over here. Yeah. I don't want to fight them on the pillar. So I guess I fight them over here. I'd be surprised that there's not a reward over here. Okay, ouch. I don't really recognize that attack. Need stamina. They're just looking at me, making me bleed. Can't really do much about that other than to kill them, maybe? If their attack went off, like, through their death animation, I might have died there. So weird, there's no reward over here, huh? For fighting those two enemies. 
There's no like drop down, no. I could look really hard for an illusory wall, but it's not in the center, I doubt it's anywhere else. Oh, this kind of looks like an illusory wall. No, no. Schmeck. Oh, okay. Um, I'll hold off on flaming up my sword. So you would usually drop down. Yeah, there's like the drop down platform. Honestly, I'm glad there's no knights up here. That's where they are in Dark Souls 3, but... Those guys are rough on the pillars. I like these pillars, but I guess they're like walkways. There's Patches Bridge. I don't see anything else up here. We'll double check over here, but I think I'm just dropping down to... Respec area from Dark Souls 3. Yeah, cool. Alright, good deal, good deal. Exploration complete. I think I'll take a little bit of fall damage. Oh, one of those guys. Yeah, I take a lot of fall damage. I can't ember, because I'm already embered. That's all my heals going in. Well, maybe I need to go this way, actually. No, this guy's definitely not friendly. guy isn't either. Now there's Patch's bridge. I don't think Patch's will show up and make it go down. It looks pretty sturdy. This might be the way I have to go. I'm trying to think of the other way. Like, I'd be, like, down there. I don't know how I'd get up. Come on, bonfire up here. There's a bunch of these, like, squirmy guys, probably. Yeah. Can I get in here? I can. I'm hoping for a bonfire. I'm all out of heals. Oh my god, it's a fog gate. No, it's a boss. No. Ooh, Saint Biden's. I think it's a faith weapon, though. It's a fucking boss. That's so funny. I'm like, come on, bonfire. It's not a bad fame. Oh, Pale Tongue, yeah. I mean, you can't go through fog gates and have them not be bosses. I have yet to see that happen in this mod, though. It's a fucking boss, isn't it? So the Pale Tongue's usually a covenant item. Is it... an elixir item? No. Champions kindling. Oh, yeah, kindling. So kindling is that. Okay. Yeah, no, because there's something that boosts my kindling. Where'd the pale tongue go? Hmm, it's not here. I don't see my usable items either. Can I use this bident? No, it's just faith weapon. I really like, you know, bidents, because they're like spears, but... I'm not going to use a faith weapon. Weird, I don't see the pale tongue at all. Huh. Oh, it's down here. Proof of invaders victory. What's some embers? Uh, if it's a boss, I'm just going to homeward bone out. Yeah, it is. I see the fucking boss health bar. Alright, see ya. <laughs> that's so cool, there's a boss there. Oh shit, that's funny. Uh, do I have a level? I don't... Not sure. I have one level. Give me the health, I guess. How many upgrade materials do I have? Two? Yeah. Yeah, the one boss item I saw, I needed like 46 strength or something crazy. Um, where am I going here? Yeah. So, I could... I guess I'll explore the, the lower area again. But it seems like, to progress, I need to go, like, all the way up there once again. At least I know I can, like, avoid those two, like, really strong enemies. Now let me explore the lower area. I need more Estus. Let's call this elevator, but not take it, just so it's down there. Yeah, there was a green lantern, like, on the side of the castle. Which I thought maybe it was, like, my souls or something was going on. So I can drop down and go there if I want, but I don't want to...
Yeah, here we go, so... I'm just gonna fight this Nick guy. Um, I'm standing in poison. Let's stop doing that. There's Mommy Spider. Oh, he actually got me shit. I thought I dodged that. Not that powerful of a grab, though. Yeah, the other, like, Bloodborne bosses do, like, their attacks from their face, too, just like this guy does. God, I hate shield bashes. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait. I don't want to do that. Yeah. So, I think that's probably dead ends. Yeah, dead end. It's on, like, the left side, though. Oh, this guy dropped something. That's probably a really nice great shield if I was going to use a shield. Please don't aggro onto me. Scary enemy in the middle. Sweet. Bunch of little guys. Oh no, he got me. He's going to suck me. Nope. Oh, he didn't suck me. No, he's going to suck me. Yeah. <laughs> My brain. I think I'm good just to smack him. Let's heal up though, I guess, to be super safe. Okay. Yeah, the audio syncing seems a little off sometimes. Where's this poison coming from? The people on the bridge, maybe? We're doing poison around here. I really just want to R1 spam this guy. There you go, sweet. This goes... I don't think this progresses, but I'd like to explore over here first before I decide to progress. Night guy on bridge. Yeah. Although that might, like, shortcut as well, but I don't think it's a very useful shortcut. Okay, fight me, night guy. That guy's not so scary. Looks like he's almost stuck. Oh, the parry! Okay. <laughs> We're okay, though. I got two heals left. Item for me, dual charm. He refilled one of my essences. Thank you, night guy. Is it just a bunch of these little dudes? I see nothing above to drop down. This kind of looks like a mini boss arena, but I don't think it is. I think it's just a little dudes. I did one shot them with Lloyd's ring. Oop, I don't have stamina to do anything, so I'll run away. <laughs> yeah, they're like the little alien guys. I like the alien guys more. They have, like, glowing eyeballs. These like, little crab guys. Little Cthulhu's. Little Tilly's running around. Oh, so cute. This is normally where I would get the... Bident. Oh, this guy did not die. Oh, this guy's the scary guy. Okay. Well, I guess I didn't roll away from that grab. <laughs> Spam roll away. So a bunch of little guys and one scary dude, it seems like. Maybe another scary dude on the other side, maybe. God, this area is so cool. Like, it's just a remix Dark Souls 3 area, but I don't know. Did not expect to see a Bloodborne area. I've got two attacks. Oh, no stagger. At least his, like, brain sucking doesn't, like, do any status effects, just damage. So him. There he is. is there another blood sucker over here? This is just a normal alien dude. There might be a boss behind that door. If the boss counts from like the other areas are the same for all areas. There was four in that one area. Three so far in the desert area. Might be one more after that one boss. Maybe they're not all the same though. Oh. Item over here. Alright, please don't put me into a boss fight immediately. I think this just shortcuts to the very... 
beginning of the castle, but I don't think it's a very useful shortcut. Okay, it definitely doesn't. It definitely goes deeper. Okay, well... Oh, wait, no. And then there's, like, another big door, right? Okay, there's an elevator instead. Down the elevator I go. Give me a bonfire. <laughs> I, there's only one bonfire in this area, and there's just a bunch of shortcuts. Oh my god, it's a fucking fog gate. I've got one heal. Any elevator secrets? Nope. It's another fucking boss. Uh, I've got two homeward bones. I want to just leave. The run back is so annoying, though. I've got one flame. What's this elixir do? Great flame? Yeah. Cool that it tells me. Alright, let's great flame it up. Let's try first trying this boss with one heal. It looks like a Bloodborne guy, but I don't think it actually is. I don't like targeting his head. I like to target his body. Okay, lunge attack. I hate lunge attacks. That was a stagger. I might like teleport to his yeah. <laughs> kind of just teleport to his visceral zone. Yeah, I don't get stamina back. Yeah, there we go. I can target his body. Just had to switch up the target like region. Am I grabbed? What the hell was that grab? What the heck? Ouchie, my head. Hmm. I have no heals. I have, like a tentacle. Yeah, the camera does really wonky stuff, but might be normal for the course of Dark Souls 3. I just want to teleport out, honestly. Yep, nope. I think he phases two, though. His head changed. Cool arena. Is that the fog gate I came in on? Probably just dead ends. Oh, man. <laughs> it's like... Yeah, the explanation's weird where, like, hmm. I just keep, like, finding bosses I feel like I can't fight. Uh, so how did I even get there? I explored the lower area. Upper area brings me to a boss, lower area brings me to a boss, and like, to go to the Deacons brings me to a boss as well, probably. Let's, let me think. I really want to find like a boss weapon that I want to use. Like out of the four bosses I've fought, only one's giving me like a weapon. I can just run past all the enemies though. Wait, wrong area. This way. Yeah, I want to ember up again. Eh, maybe I'll, I only have one ember. I'll save it. This guy's damage doesn't seem like crazy high. Can I actually avoid the blood brain sucking dudes though? Okay, I actually did. Oh, sweet. Perfect. I don't even have to... <laughs> I don't even have to target an enemy for that glitch to show up. That's annoying. Let me target somebody real quick. Yeah, okay. I guess I gotta restart the game now. Weird. Um, let me take the elevator down and then I'll reset the game. That's so funny. I thought maybe that glitch wouldn't show up again since it didn't show up at all, but I gotta relaunch the game. Okay, sweet. I'm being left alone. Yeah, sweet. Free souls for me. Oh. Okay, I don't care about that. Alright, let me reset. And hopefully I don't enter the boss room and that glitch shows up. Because <laughs> that would be annoying. For some reason, I feel like the title screen is off-center. It's, it's just because Dark Souls is, like, off to the right. Yeah, it, it looks off center to me, but I mean, it's not, but it just looks kind of weird. Quick game, relaunch. Hopefully that bug doesn't pop up. We could, yeah, I don't know. Weird. I think I can get this boss. I didn't have as much healing, like, because I was fighting all those other dudes. But I'm full on healing now. I'm going to not Ember. I will Elixir, though. For more flame damage. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. I need to refill my water bottle. Maybe I'll do that after this boss fight. But I just want to play a video game. Check out my rings. Yeah, this is not helpful for the boss fight. I guess I do blue tear stone ring for a boss fight. Wish I could wear cooler armor. I got no levels into, like, equip load. Okay. I'm gonna play this with this. 
I could ember up halfway through the boss fight if I feel like I might get it. Where are my souls? Over there. Maybe I don't target him. There's some boss fights I feel like they're actually detrimental to target. That's a visceral. Yeah, I don't get my stamina back when I visceral. But what are you gonna do? Not visceral? Probably not. Okay, I heal now. I really don't like his charge attacks. I had that glitch didn't pop back up. I think he's phase twoing. Yeah, his head's different now. Cool. Okay, blood mist like AoE. Take one more heal. I guess he more damage too, which is nice. Okay, he really holds that one. Was that a visceral? I think it was. Maybe not. I need to heal. I didn't, go, I didn't want to go for two attacks there. Ooh, I miss. Yeah, I really hate charge attacks. My flame expired. This is my last heal going in. Man, he keeps like <laughs> flying around the arena. I dodged that. Ugh. No damage return though. Ugh. I think if I just stay tight with him. Yeah, the camera is real wonky. Alright, we got him, sweet. I embered! Uh, I mean, I think I needed to to get that. This feel great, though. Okay. I got a scroll for spells. Oh, I got an ember back. So maybe I don't ember up after a boss fight. Maybe I just get an ember. I got a homeward bone. Um, Do I want to save it for some reason? Not really. Yeah. Okay, cool. Cool boss. Oh, that corpse is moving. Ew, that's gross. Ew, grossy gross. It was just the one boss fight that gave me, like, the teleporting bonfire. So I can't actually make it back. Super cool arena. Yeah, now I'm confused how, like, the game layout is, because... I mean, I guess normally I'd, like, go to the door, but instead of a door, there was an elevator. Okay, I get it now. But if there's lore for this game, I'd kind of be surprised if there was, like... <laughs> like, I see that, you know, crying woman statue, like, is that significant to the story? Maybe there's, like, some light lore, but I don't know, like, as in-depth as Dark Souls usually is. Let me hold bone down here. Okay, cool, so that's one optional boss. There's still... Uh, I guess it's probably, like, the same, like, Dark Souls 3, where you, like, you have to, they have to kill, like, the five... Um, lords or whatever, and then you can go to them. The main lord. Seems like I can't do that, though. It seems like I can kill the five main lords of each area. Let me check out this boss soul. Yeah, okay, so I just use it. There's no boss weapon. I really want to find a boss weapon. Sure. I want to get equipped load, but it might not be a bad idea. I just want to get more endurance. Let these souls withdrawn from their vessels manifest. I'll go to 25, 25. I like the number 25, sure. Farewell, Emerson. Now maybe I can start just pumping equip load to get some cool armor. This guy sells cool armor too. I think it's like 2,000 a pop. Let me buy some. I'm guessing it's pretty good. 2,000. I get both the 2,000 pieces, sure. Yo. Maybe I can get some combination here. Barely. I could take like a ring off to wear the cool helmet and be on light load. I think light load is 30. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it's 30. I don't think it's 33. I feel like my roll is slightly slower. So I just need like one level and you know, I'll be able to equip everything. Yeah, 28. Hello, is it the Kevin? 
Hello, welcome to every stream. Hope you're doing well. No, no, no. That's just silly. If it was light emanating pure souls, it'd be a game about you. Um. Okay, I need to go back to this area. I don't know. This helmet's not that swag. It'd be more swag with all the armor. We'll make our ways to that point. So this is desert area. I need to go back to castle area. Yeah, there might be only one bonfire this entire area. I guess I'll go up and fight the the Pope guy. I really want more Estus shards. I feel like my like my heels p powerful, but I don't have a lot of heels. I only have five. Oh uh, yeah, I need to go upper area. I've got one elixir left. Next time I go back to Fire Link, I need to make more elixirs for more fire damage. Up the ladder. I start every area, which is cool. I do love exploring. Yeah, I love I'm like... <laughs> oh, is it the respec area? But it's just a straight up boss. I'm like, please be bonfire. And it's just a freaking boss. I'm like, oh no. That's a nut good. So I'm gonna take damage falling here. I'll top off my health before the boss. I'm gonna take more fall damage. Uh, it's kind of impossible to dig to the boss without taking any damage. I can't ember because I'm already embered. Cool sounds these guys make. Cool sound design. I think I'm good to drop down. And not die at least. And then heal. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I probably need to do two heals. Oh, that's annoying. Now, can I drop down and not take damage? No, fuck. That's three heals I'm gonna have to use before I even get into the boss arena. Maybe even more, because I suck against these guys. Actually, I can explore more. Hold on. I don't need to go to the boss, actually. I can go across this bridge, and I don't think patches will kick me off. Will that give me... Oh, I'm bleeding. Oh, I need a torch. Do I have a torch? I don't. So, what if I flame up my sword? Will that get the leeches off me? Actually, don't know. No, it doesn't. Do I just die with these leeches on me? A torch would take them off. Um, it's not. No, take off armor doesn't work. I don't have a torch. I don't know how to get these leeches off me. Are they just gonna keep sucking me until I die? <laughs> uh. Do you need a homeward bone out of here? I might just die. This is a sus looking wall. It's not does the spam roll do anything. Is there I have like a thing that gets rid of blood buildup. Okay, that'll get rid of the leeches. God dang it. Well, I used up all my heals. I can still explore a little bit. I don't have a ton of health though. <laughs> I used all my freaking flasks before I even go to the boss, but I guess I'm not going to the boss. I'm gonna explore some more. I might get a better shortcut to the boss. Refresh this flame. It's gonna expire soon. Okay, fight me, night game. Uh oh. That's not good. He grabbed me. I don't mind his blocking, because well, it's kind of free hits. Need to get stamina back. He's so low. Right, we got him. No more area here. These messengers are kind of skilly. I'm looking for a show. Oh, I got a flashback from him. That's nice. Thank you, knight guy. Very cool. Uh, I thought about like taking off my armor. Anything below 30? No. I don't know. I think this is better than the helmet. It's cooler. I can put on a ring, I guess. I'll just get it one level into equip load and I can wear that helmet and all the rings. So is this shortcut here? Oh, I, it is. This is the very... Like front entrance of the castle? Okay. 
It's a weird shortcut. I guess it's better. It's a weird shortcut for sure. But I guess it's better if I'm trying to go to like the boss that's directly in front of me. There was a scary enemy down there. I hate those guys. Um, I think I need to go back to a bonfire. I don't really want to use a homeward bone, but I also don't want to just run back to a bonfire because I'm lazy. That's what I need to do. How many soul items? Let me get on the ladder when I'm not being chased before checking my inventory. Yeah, there's only one bonfire in this area? I guess so. Seems like there's four bosses each area. Two optional and like one main boss. Um, what was I going to check for? Soul items? Yeah, I think I've got soul items. I think I can get my one equip load. Leveled up. No respec in the normal area, so that answers that question. I'm gonna f actually. Oh, um, I didn't. I didn't mean to roll through there. I was gonna fight the dog so I can use the bonfire, but now I can't because the dog's aggroed on me, and so I gotta run over here to de-aggro the the dog. I wanted to fight the doogie, but oh, doogie, did you run around? Bad doogie. Okay, I can use the bonfire now. I get like the one level up. I use my souls on buying that armor, but I think I'm just gonna pump. Equip load now. I got Hell's Ring. Just so I can be swagged out in armor. I think reversing my hollowing would just let me like do co-op, which I don't really care about. Oh no, wait, that's Ember Ring though. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know what reversing hollowing does. Uh, I need a little more souls. Liza P has like... Your little soul counter turns blue when you can level up, which is kind of cool. This is a good idea. Be cool if this game had that. Uh, so I want vitality. Equip load goes up. Yeah, it goes to fifty-one. Yeah, vitality. So give me the helmet. Oh, weight ratio is thirty exactly. I think it has to be below thirty. Okay, well. No helmet for me. Back to the Pyromancer Gerb. Yeah, all these rings are pretty good. Good enough to want them, keep them equipped. If I had the full armor set. So, back up here. Yeah, I keep thinking I need to teleport with the bonfire, but it's a weird teleporting system. So this is, yeah. This was Desert Area. Bloodborne Area. Remix like Undead Berg, I think. This demo is very sizable. It's very big, very cool. This is an annoying bonfire to go to. But I have okay, yeah, so I don't I don't want to go up anymore. I want to go to like the main entrance area. And I guess I'll go to the optional boss before I start going to like the main boss. Was there two optional bosses? There was guy in the basement. It was like a bloodborne guy. There's guy that is where there you usually respec at. There's main boss, which I haven't really found yet, but I'm pretty sure I know where it is. Am I missing one? Hmm. I don't think I am. Maybe there's only two optional bosses in the main boss in this area? Where there's four and then one? Or I guess three and then one per four total. I'm nice and healthy. How many embers do I have? One? Okay. I can buy more if I need to, but I'd probably rather just level up. Yeah, the fire link merchant sells three embers. All right, I think I'm good to chill right here. I need to have use the bathroom and refill my water. And I think I need to put more water in the water filter.
Um, I usually have a webcam on, so, yeah, when I go, like, AFK, there's no, like, indication of it. I'm AFK, usually, you know, it's obvious, because, you know, the dude's not at his fucking desk, like, he's obviously not there, but... I guess with the sunflower. I could, like, take the sunflower off screen, but then it's just like, oh... <laughs> that's not really any better. <laughs> I, if I was a real streamer, I'd have, like, an AFK screen or something, but... Fuck that shit, that's way too much effort. I need one more level in my equip load. Yeah, the nice thing about dex weapons too is, you know, they're light as well, so I can wear really swag armor. I guess I'm going, yeah, straight to the Pope boss. I'm not taking any fall damage too on my way to him, which is nice. This is the best shortcut for sure, cool. I mean, it's just a remixed Dark Souls 3 area, but it's so cool, oh my god. I've got like no souls, I don't really care if I lose them, I don't really care about recovering them. I'm like, ooh, come on, bonfire, come on, bonfire, it's a fucking boss, that's so awesome. I guess all the elixir, yeah, um... These guys will leave me alone. Yeah, cool. Look at me in there. Saint Clint. Hello, game. Oh, he's, he's Mog from Dark Souls, oh no. I need... Maggot, like, removal on my hotbar. Cause I don't have a torch. Oh, he's the one guy from Elden Ring. <laughs> he is an Elden Ring boss. I wanted the running attack there. I didn't get it. Yeah, it's not bad. Ooh, I miss. Yeah, he's a uh, Godskin Noble. But he's the other one. He's the skinny guy. I, I don't know. Godskin Noble. Godskin Apostle. That's who he is. Yeah. Yeah, he's pretty slippery. He's hard to hit. I'm embered up. I might lose it. Okay, I've, I've got the timing down on his range attack, though. I can roll into him and get punish off. Yeah. Might have been visceral there. Yeah, he has Godstone Apostle. I can refresh my fire. I think it might be phase 2 -ing. Okay, just summons. It's actually not that scary. Okay, hold on. He did not just summon. It's like an AoE attack. And he disappeared. I scared him off. Is he in the ceiling? Uh, the camera zoomed out. Okay, he's bigger now. My frame rate. Oh, I'm standing in the blood. Let's get out of there. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, he's a big guy now. I can't get on top of him, because there's blood all over him. Okay. Interesting. I've got no heals left. He's still got most of his health. <laughs> oh, he's... Now he's, um... Like, thingy from Bloodborne. Okay, well... Okay, I actually got out. Um, he gets maggots on me phase two as well. Okay. I think I won't go to that boss. I mean, I wasn't really protecting anything by homeward boning out, honestly. I didn't have any souls anyway, I only had 177. Let's go check out the other Bosch. It's like where the Deacons of the de Deep usually would be. I could grind out, um, Necromancer attempts as well. Like, I'm probably pretty strong to fight him. Let's stick to this area for now, though. Oh, I didn't get any more elixirs. Eh, who cares? Not to me, apparently. No elixirs for me. Yeah, I'm guessing there's not a respec area, then, if it wasn't where it usually is. It's a, it's a bouche. Actually, let me put all my settings on low. I don't know if that's really going to help with the frame rate, honestly, though, because... Oh, what's this? Oh, that actually makes the game look a lot better. Like the shading. Uh, low, 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 low. And I mean, this is either off or medium, so I guess I'll put it on medium. Like, I'll probably still get frame rate issues, but eh, whatever. I don't know, it's like, mm, when I'm not exploring, I want everything on high, because I never get frame rate issues, but some of the bosses have, like, a ton of effects that make the frame rate kind of chubby, which usually doesn't fuck me over or anything, so, like, makes the game 
hard to play. It just annoys me. It's just annoying. Did I turn shadows off? I might have turned shadows off in the setting and not really thought about it. I guess it looks good then. I think I have better frame rate just walking around, although it doesn't like dip like crazy like it does during boss fights. I think it's my first time taking this elevator. Yeah, it definitely is. Check for elevator secrets. I haven't found one yet. Not one there. Okay, spooky scary. Oh, there's the Deacon of the Deep, like main boss guy just chilling there. Guess I'll run up and give him a little smicky smick. Oh, there's another guy there. Um, hello. Okay, big guys around him. Got a. I mean, let's just go to the boss. Whatever. I'm not sure if they're gonna leave me alone down here. Eee. Don't need elixirs anyway. Yeah, he's just chilling. Cool. So they do actually leave me alone. Let's go to the boss. Let's see the boss. Oh, is it just Deacon of the Deep, but blue? They seem to be healing, which is interesting. How does that work? I don't know. What's going on with their health bar? Are these, like, cultists giving the altar their power? <laughs> and this affects, like, the boss's actual health bar? Hmm. Interesting mechanic. Not exactly sure how it works yet. Is the health bar still going up? No. Yeah, I think I killed all the, like, health bar dudes. Giving the boss health, a health bar. Maybe I kill all the summons and the boss shows up. Oh, that's a lot of range attack. Oh, there's a dude over here. Maybe I can't prevent them from summoning or something. Was he really just over here the whole time? I've got the majority of the guys, like, on the other side. This doesn't actually one-shot him. Okay. Now all the little guys die. Where's the real boss? I guess I gotta bring his health bar, like, all the way up. Oh, is it Aldrich, the world eater? Except in doggy form? Oh, it is Aldrich, cool. Okay, there's a bunch of dudes around her. I instantly got cursed. <laughs> um, there goes my ember. That is unfortunate. That, that curse buildup was so fast. <laughs> I've got a ring that helps with that. Um, let's go fight the desert guy. There's two bosses here. But, uh, they seem kind of tough. Let's go fight the wizard guy. Go get some elixirs while we're at it, yeah. They're pretty much free. I got a bunch of those, like, fire ones. Wish I could make more than three. I'll double check make sure I can't, but you probably just carry three at a time. Let me... How many of these do I have? Fifteen? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So I guess I can make different ones, but I can't make any more. Okay, cool. I've got one ember left. I won't use that while fighting that guy. Fighting... Desert guy. Yeah, I keep thinking I'm teleporting. God dang it. I gotta go over here. The desert right here. So I'm guessing once, like, the final boss in the area is destroyed, they're, like, little thrones get... a little icon on them, maybe... That's how it is in, like, Dark Souls 3. Yeah, you, you fight all five, like, bosses, then you go to the final boss. That's kind of cool. Elixir. Do not. Use a flask. Fire up. Sweet. Yeah, he just summons skeletons, which actually isn't all that bad. Especially if I one-shot the skeletons. I can't get a hit after that. He's on the stairs, but it's kind of a wonky spot to fight him. Nope. 
No third. Heal, heal, heal. Chug, chug, chug. Oh, there's the third. <laughs> Didn't go for a third last time. What the heck did he heck? Okay, summon skeletons. Yeah. Oh, the freaking roll. <laughs> yeah, I one shot the skeletons, so they're not that bad. At one point, I was two shotting them, and it was a bit of an issue. He's probably going to get on top of me with his sword now. I think a bunch of enough skeletons are dead. Alright, sweet. Could refresh my fire. I don't think I'll do that quite yet, though. Yeah, the elixir expired. It doesn't last very long. There goes my fire buff. Ooh, that's a new attack. I'm just going to fight fireless. Yeah, Lloyd's Ring is not helpful during boss fights because they're very rarely full health, but the next one is pretty good. I'll see one shot enemies usually when I went. Just a tomb. Unless he doesn't summon skeletons a third time or a second time, I'd be okay. Oh, this spin attack. I get back in there, though. It's very doable. I didn't use any, like, embers or anything I really care about. If he summons skeletons, I might be able to, like, refresh my fire. I'm not sure if I really need to do that. Oh, I forgot about the sandworm, but this guy's way cooler than the sandworm. I haven't even tried to fight the sandworm, but I already know this guy's way cooler. <laughs> I'm too handy my sword, right? Yeah. Don't care my souls at all. Let's not die immediately while after entering the boss arena, I guess. <laughs> what? Do something, guy. There you go. Do a little double sip. Man, don't go on the stairs. It's wonky to fight you on the stairs. That's like all my flasks already. <laughs> well. Schmick. Schmick. Okay, he's on the stairs again. Oh, he's a little glitched out, maybe. Maybe not. I can't run in there and do damage. Too far away. I think I'm going to see the skeletons, I guess. So that'll be fun. Maybe. Yeah, like, the blue tear stone effect pops up, but it's like... Is it doing anything? Like, I guess it would, but, like, I'm already so slow health anyway. Here come skeletons. I love skeleton bros. Oh, I don't one-shot them. Because they don't have flame on, I think. <laughs> Uh-oh. That's not good. No, yeah, the skeletons are bullying me. Leave me alone. Yeah. I think I put flame back on, but like, I might just die. Yeah, I still get the buff off. Uh -huh. Even through blue tear stone ring I know. Alright, that attempt was much worse than the other one. <laughs> that was... Garbo attempt, holy crap. i get back in there though. Use my last elixir. I don't think I really care about this elixir that much. Like, when I'm at zero, I'll probably just keep boss attempting. I don't think I'm gonna go back to elixir, dude. Maybe I'll find a better effect. I kind of doubt it though. Like, extra fire damage seems really, really strong with my fire spell. Okay, that's a new attack even now, shit. Eh, maybe not, but... Like the... Fly away?
Mm, hold off on playing. I like barely hit him. I haven't seen him stagger at all. Not sure if it's possible to stagger him. Going for like roll attacks, where I usually don't. They're faster, but I don't know if they do more damage. I don't think they do. It's just safer, I guess. Ooh, I miss. Grab skeletons. Okay, fight me, skeletons. Ouch! 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 Leave me alone, skeletons. <laughs> Swinging to nobody. There goes my fire. I don't think I one shot skeletons anymore. Let's get on the other side of the arena. I do like that you like. Saw the boss arena before the boss actually spawns. Save me, skeleton, from the fire attack. Okay, two skeletons left. He's still like in just chill mode. Okay, now he's coming over here. Man, he really got to get on top of me after that last skeleton. Okay, there's my last heal. Schmeck. Oh, I can't dodge into him. With that AoE. Yeah, he's not even half health, fuck. I'm gonna go fuck off, fight the sandworm. <laughs> Yeah, let's go fight the sandworm. I got the eh, health fuck. He was real close that one time. I need to like get enough damage into him so that my flame buff is still there for when the skeleton so I can one shot them. But uh, I'm gonna go fight the sandworm. Bye bye. Bye bye. I go shoot a corpse out of a tree or something. I think there's two like floating corpses around that I can shoot with my bone and that I have a bone. Yeah, no torch against the maggot boss is gonna hurt. I mean, I have items, but can I avoid? This guy and go fight the worm. Nope. Smack. Ooh. Yeah. The Pyromancer guard probably protects me from those flame attacks pretty effectively. Stop spam dodging. <laughs> Uh, okay, his pathfinding is gonna take him around there. Interesting that I lost targeting on him. Shmack. Okay. Let's top off my health. Let's flame up. That's me, Sandworm. Hell, <laughs> that's how I enter the arena, he just one shots me. So I'll go a little bit slower this time. A little more cautious entering the Sandworm arena. Back to me, Sandworm. This is gonna be a gimmick boss. It's a normal boss. Maybe it like one shots me no matter what. Oh, oh. I don't think I go for damage while it's moving. He's gonna move again. Yeah. Oh, I do good damage though. I know sandworm. Yeah, like I guess it's trying to do like a range attack on me, but I don't even notice. Wait, its health bar disappeared. What? Did I make it leave? I mean, I got Essence Shard. That's real big. <laughs> That's a big improvement. I got like a spell too. Um. Did it go to like another area of the desert? There's not like an obvious boss arena for the sandworm to go. Interesting. 
Like every other time I've seen the sandworm, he's just like doing ranged attacks and like killing like random people and then like leaving. I think I'm not really supposed to be attacking him, like fighting him. I didn't get a soul or anything. Hmm. Do I go back to the bonfire and come back here or do I look for the sandworm in other areas of the desert? I mean, there's like those items that I'll go get, I guess. Look for sandworm in other areas. He's just not there no more. Hey, guy, give me a... Titanite Shard. No Titanite Shard for me. I mean, I have gold coins. I could check... Oh, Locust. I could check the Oasis for the Sandworm. He pops up lots of different areas. I think this guy's actually dead. Yes. I don't remember the other thing that I could shoot with a bow was at, but I know there was one over here. It's been so long since I used a bow. I'm pretty sure I can figure out how to do it though. Hopefully. I don't know, are these things friendly unless I attack them? Actually, I'm not sure. Bow. Short bow. How do I aim? That's not it. I think I two-hand it. And then... Hold on. There we go. I think it was like crossbows that don't let you like aim. Like down sights for lack of a better word. Oh, Falchion. Okay. That's a dex weapon. I mean, it scales with D, so it's kind of weird to call it a dex weapon, but it's definitely fast. Meh. Seems kind of sloppy. I'm not a huge fan of the... Move set. There's Curb Sword Girl. Okay. So these guys definitely aren't friendly if you leave them alone. <laughs> okay, that answers that question. Interesting the sandworm just fucks off. I'm gonna go over to the oasis. Oh wait a minute. Somebody on me? No. See the sandworms over there? Wait a minute. Did I see an item like in that building? I don't think so. Maybe on Scorpion. I'm looking for the sandworm. I want to ride it like Paul does in, in Dune. I want to be Paul. Or no, Peter. Yeah, Peter's his name. And she's like, put your hand in the box, Peter. And Peter's like, what's in the box? And he's, she's like, it's pain, Peter. <laughs> Pain's in the box, Peter. That's my favorite part. Okay, rude. These javelin guys killed me earlier. I'm so mad about it. Okay, I can't jump. I forgot. There's not- this is an Elder Ring. I mean, I didn't explore the Oasis completely either. Sandworm gonna pop out. God, these javelin guys are annoying. I mean, there's just the crabs. I bet if I kill the crabs, they'll give me something special. I have one homeward bone left. I mean, I have no souls, so I'll just gladly die here. It's fine, really. If I want to, like, get back. To a bonfire, I'll just die. This little, little teleport trick. I guess I'll top off my health. I'll fight the crab, sure. Yeah, I don't know what happened to the sandworm. I don't know if sandworm's gonna come back into the sandworm arena. Come here, crabby crab. I think it's like AoE, or not AoE, it's... Aggro range is kind of wonky right now. That's a visceral, but can I actually get in front to get it off? No. No visceral for me. Ooh, it's burning underground. That's a new attack, I think. Oh, did it heal? It's I, I saw a health bar that was full. Yeah, I guess it healed, huh? Can I prevent it from healing? Also, the water slows me down like a swamp. There goes my bonus damage from Lloyd's Ring. Maybe you need the Visceral for preventing it from healing? Get my endurance back. Yeah, it just leaves, what? <laughs> ah, you can't just do that. You can't just leave when we're fighting each other. I mean, if I had more damage, I could probably prevent it from doing that, but I don't have that much damage. I guess it just leaves? That's funny. That's a new attack I haven't seen. 
I guess I'll just die. I don't know. It feels weird just to die. Uh, is that an item over there? I think so. Do a little item run. See if there's any items that I missed. This guy alive? No. And there's not even an item behind him. I thought there was for some reason. Have I explored up here? I might not have. I think there's anything up here. Ooh, item! Nice. Oh, embers are nice. Cool. I'll take an ember. Funny, I'm really looking for Titanite shards. Like the lowest level upgrade material. Wish the mine gave me more. I go through the mine again with like a gold coin. Just fight all the miners. I have one flask. I guess I should go to the bonfire if I want to go to the mine again. How many do I have right now? Two, maybe? I have two. Two Titanite shards. That Estus shard is nice. Give me some more healing from Sandworm Bro. Yeah, there was definitely- oh, did I just see it? No, I thought somebody was hanging from this tree. Oh no, someone's hanging from this tree. Um, I guess I gotta fight a guy with no health, or no heals. Unless he... leave me alone? Eh, not really. I don't have my bow equipped. Oh, he is leaving me alone. Quick, get the bow! Um... <laughs> I really want to smack this thing with a bow and get whatever item that is. I got it, I got it. We get these. Wait, like this? There we go, like that. Sweet. I think that's all the items in like the desert. Green blossom? Okay, well. Probably will never use those, but... I do like getting items. Let me go through the mine again, I guess. I think I need heals before I go to the mine. I guess I go to the bonfire. Yeah, it wasn't obvious who that, like, girl was talking about, but I guess the guy, like, right in front of the, the temple was the highwayman that she needed to die before she could get there. I gold coin, I go through the mine, I guess. I don't know, maybe it's better to teleport to the mine and go, like, backwards. I'm trying to remember how I got there, though. Probably a tele- or not teleport, probably an elevator? I'll put gold coin on my, like, quick item. Actually, just using this and... Using both of these give me, like, a super buff for item discovery, maybe? I don't know. These guys never gave me Titanite shards, so let me go over here instead. Maybe they're different miners that give Titanite shards. How many miners are even here? I guess there's one there. Okay. Rested coin and then all gold coin. Probably don't stick. I, mean, I don't see two. Whether they stack or not, I'm not sure, but I don't see two icons saying that they do. Give me a Titanite shard. Okay, that's a fire gem. Not what I wanted. Yeah, I don't see any differences between these guys. And they're that guy dropped a fire gem just like the other guy was dropping a fire gem, so. There isn't a difference. Pickaxe, okay. <laughs> Don't want that. How many more miners are there? One, two, sure, we'll run across this real quick. No, don't fall off, I want your item. <laughs> Damn it. I don't think I have enough stamina for this guy. I gotta wait a little bit. One more smack. Okay, there goes my item discovery buff. And I got zero Titanite shards. How sad for me. Oh, I almost fell off there. God damn it. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, I can't upgrade my sword. I I don't, I don't want to go to those Dark Souls 2 areas. You know, Dark Souls 2 just leaves a bad taste in my mouth, even when it's in a good game, you know? I mean, these guys seem the same. Let me pop another gold coin. Maybe I'm imagining make finding the Titanite Shard. I 
Although I'm thinking about that was a wonky ass backstab. I'm thinking about the Necromancer Desert boss, and if I have like the the attack boost from from the elixir that gives me fire boost, I make it to skeleton phase faster, and maybe I have my fire buff last longer. Yeah, that's probably pretty important. I guess I go get more elixirs. Just to get more like fiery elixir items. Um, I need to check the sandworm too to see if the sandworm comes back. I didn't kill the sandworm. I need to upgrade my flask as well. Okay, that's my second Estus flask. Or Estus shard, rather. I could also elixir like mid boss fight. The. Let me... Let... The. Oh, I need to get rid of this bow. The attacks from the desert guys seem really like inconsistent, like as far as their effectiveness. Like sometimes they do like crazy combos, and sometimes it just is like a single attack and it's easy to punish. 30%, 29%. Oh, killing! Skeletons might actually work with the evil eye, okay. This is not the teleport bonfire. <laughs> Alright, well at least I didn't sit down at the bonfire before realizing I can't teleport with it. That's progress, baby. High Lord's Temple. This is the most interesting area to me. There's still... Uh, Gwendolyn... In... The Deacons of the Deep area. There's still... Maggot guy. I don't have a torch! So I have to use, like, the item to get rid of the mags, which seems weird. Elixir... Flame... Alright. This will look much cooler than the Pyromancer Garm. One more kick? No. This is like a... Attack that doesn't do any damage. But it like, sets me up for another attack. If he doesn't roll away during that AOA, I definitely get a hit in. Yeah, he rolled away again though. Kind lame. Stop rolling away, guy. That's a third. You got him, though. Okay, skeleton time. Schmeck. Mmm, schmeck. Am I getting health back from Evil Eye? I don't think I am, actually. <laughs> So they didn't hit a skeleton. Okay. Spam roll away. Sip. Alright, I'm in a good spot. No more skeletons. I could refresh my fire. I went for it. I have gotten hit for it. AoE? No, range attack. Shit. AoE? Yep. Man, the freaking roll away. That's not even a roll away, though. That's just like a dash back. Not, not bad, Oh, I really want a plus three sword, hmm. Yeah, there's no, like, boss- The only- I've- I don't know, I've killed like five or six bosses and only one has given me a boss weapon. 
I elixered halfway through that fight too, which isn't a big deal, but I only have the one elixir that I just used for this attempt. Okay, fight me game. Do I ignore those souls? I don't care about them that much. I need to recognize the single attack and the combo attack. Ouch. Ooh, the kick. Nope. God damn you guy. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking smash my head up against the wall until this guy dies. Oh wait, I wanted to check on the sandworm. I guess I could go see the sandworm one more time. They're probably not there though. I'm trying to think of Dark Souls 3 if you actually kill the sandworm or you just make the sandworm like fuck off and it gives you an SS shard. I mean, I got more heals now. Okay. Let's just go check on the sandworm real quick. I'll probably die to the spearman right before the sandworm. Let's just take a look. Yeah, the sandworm even had, like, a boss health bar. Yeah, my camera isn't zooming out. Sandworm's not here, I don't think. Oh, huh, okay. Interesting. Sandworm had a boss health bar. Definitely not getting a boss soul from the sandworm if the sandworm just leaves, though. Yeah, my evil eye ring did not give me health from the skeletons. I don't know why I'm fighting this guy. Just leave. Back to the boss arena for me. Ooh, my helmet's very cool. Too bad the rest of the swag isn't there. Uh, the fights in the other area might be easier than this guy. I'll try a couple more times, though. The double fight? Like, there's those statues in the arena that I can use to separate the two knights. Also, the knight, like, on the bridge. I bet the knight on the bridge has a boss weapon. I've never seen this guy stagger before, so... I don't care too much about, like, the quick attacks out of the roll. Baby, a triple, so I can't roll back from the triple. Yeah, like the combos are like way more dangerous than like the single attack that he does sometimes. Sometimes he just does like a single swing like three or four times and it's easy training hits. Sometimes he does like a five or six combo. Oh man. I'm right, getting back in there. So yeah, this ring is kind of useless, so I guess I'll put on, I mean, the blue tier stone ring puts me at 30%. Give me the curse resistance. No way I get cursed in this curseless fight. Then I won't have flame for the skeleton phase, probably, because I'm doing a little less damage during like the first phase. So I, I might have to reapply flame for skeletons just so I'm one-shotting them. Yeah, that's a combo. I kind of knew it was, but I still went for training of hits. Yep, he's gonna combo some more. Check. That's a single. Barely got that dodge. Single. Sip, sip. Well, I guess if he rolls away, it's an easy heal, but... Yeah, the kick does a lot of damage for as fast as it comes out, and it's kind of wonky because usually looking at it like his sword. Ugh. Okay, I mean it's skeleton time, but I'm out of heals. The attempt is pretty fucked, I do believe. One skeleton left. Okay, fight me, gay. Yeah. No, don't roll away from me. Okay, 
Okay, I can't roll into him. Sometimes he does the AoE, sometimes he does the, like, range attack. <laughs> oh, man. I don't know, I've, I've warmed up a lot to the exploration in this game and, like, the... Yeah, like, right now I'm just gonna fuck off, I think. I'm gonna go to some other area. I'm gonna go fight the guy on the bridge, I think. The bridge knight guy and hope that he has a boss weapon that makes me really happy. And then I can remember I can go to the castle and there's two... Lizards running around that I missed if I need to get some upgrade materials. Let's go fight the guy on the bridge. And I bet the, the double knight boss fight is easier than... That desert guy. Yeah, I was hoping there'd be like no runbacks. I don't know, the runbacks haven't been that bad. The worst one so far is the one of the double knight fight where like there's a ballista f shooting you. It's really annoying, but... Yeah, right. Is this dying warrior guy still here? Easy 100 souls from some dying enemy off screen. Oh, I could have gotten more elixirs. Oh well. It's just annoying having to go get there. Might be worth the 5,000 souls for like the bonfire elixir kit. Funny that his like footsteps didn't come in until I got close enough. Everything's on low, so. Not much I can do about any dropped frames or frame rate issues during this boss fight. Yeah, well, it's a little choppy, that's okay then. My computer's overkill as fuck, so I hate to see it, but nothing I can do about that. Range attack? Yeah. Yeah, it's a real choppy. It's a real choppy. Ooh, I miss. Roll back in there. One more damage. Ooh, I miss though. Okay, magic attack. Oh, he's got Ludwig. Sword beams. I'm not sure what's going on with like his leg that's glowing. I think this boss fight's better off not targeting if I'm trying to get... Maybe I don't hit that one. Maybe that one's armored up? I don't know. I feel like I should hit it. Maybe I'm wrong though. I was going to look at the damage I was doing and... But I actually didn't hit him. I've got one heal left. I'm not sure if there's an obvious phase 2 or not. I'm gonna try the no targeting strategy. Actually. Hitting his axe does hurt him. Oh no, give me a note. Oh, phase two? Hold on. Can I get a visceral on his head? No, I just get free damage. Okay, never mind. I smack the wall with my weapon. I think he leaves and teleports. Still living. Nope, not anymore. Yo, this guy's definitely easier than the desert guy. The desert guy's attacks are just like. Not that I'm complaining, but like their power level is like so crazy how like some are so easy. It's just like a singular attack and then it's easy damage for like four times in a row and then some are just like five or six combos. Yeah, like I'm trading hits that entire fight, but it's still like pretty close attempt. He didn't phase two at all. I don't care about those souls. There's a hundred there. Yeah, low settings on like everything, but Still get frame rate issues. Smack. Yeah, he leveled up his foot somehow. I don't really understand. At one point, I think both of his feet were leveled up. Yeah, I think it's better not to actually target him. Oh, I remember that happening last last time too, where <clears throat> he sits on me and hurts me. I did recognize the stagger, though. Maybe I don't target the... 
foot that has like the power up. I think I need to heal quite yet. Nice clean dodges. Okay, now I want to heal. Okay, magic coming in. Heal again. Ooh, I miss. I probably have an opportunity to reapply flame here. Yep. Now both his feet are like got a thing on him. He fell down. I don't think I'm gonna get a ton of damage. I don't have a ton of stamina. That was a fourth hit though, that's not bad. Okay, he's gonna teleport to the other side. Do I top off my health? I definitely do now. <laughs> Let's do a little double sip. Here he comes. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to target him, I don't think. Not sure how different this phase is gonna be. What the fuck did my sword hit? A fucking like sword on the ground? <laughs> the fuck was that? There's still magic attacks coming in. He's really gonna leave the arena again? Okay. There's like a lingering hitbox I need to roll out of the way before he sits on me. Let's just walk out of the way then. Okay. I don't really mind him teleporting. Should have dodged when I was smacking. Can teleport. Shit. <laughs> oh man. He's so close to dying. Oh my god, he was one hit away. <laughs> no. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh man, he was one in away. Oh, it's funny. Oh, it's I don't I don't have the key, but I I remember this NPC now. Now that I've seen a cutscene of them or not cutscene, a loading screen of them. All right, get back in there. This boss is as good as dead. I'll see if I ember up now. I don't know. I might have never beaten a boss while embered before or not embered rather. I think it just gives me an ember, which is kind of the same thing. He's not leaving now. Yeah, maybe he doesn't stagger if I hit the foot that's like leveled up. I mean, I'm still getting damage when I hit the leveled up foot or whatever. This guy has really, really cool attacks. I thought they were kind of annoying at first, but I seem to learn them enough so bad. Okay, that's a stagger. I guess I'll top off my health. Oh, there's magic things around, I think. I wonder if the stagger stopped those going off, though. Might have. He's already in, like, phase two. He's behind me. I'm so bad at dodging this. Late again, yeah, fuck. Actually, he's just walking on me. I want to 
get my flame up. I had an opportunity last attempt to flame up my sword halfway through the fight. Can I just, like, get out of the way? Alright. That's the first time dodging that. That's nice. And my sword did something weird there. I think it hit the ground and hit, like, the invisible barrier. Well, that's some serious screen shake. <laughs> I didn't see an option to disable screen shake, but I don't mind it that much, really. Oh, that's a really lucky stagger. I don't know if going for fully charges is what I want to be doing. Ooh, I think so. I have no more heals. Is he going to teleport away? He wanted to. And then he set staggered. Alright, pretty close again. I could go get elixirs. Eh. Maybe I should go get elixirs. It's probably pretty helpful. I might stagger more often if I do more damage. I just want to get back in there, though. Ugh, I hate having to go back to Firelink to level up. Do all this garbage I don't want to do. But yeah, I'll we'll get more elixirs. I've got tons of flame elixir ingredients. Hey, elixir man, I'm coming with my ingredients. I had to die a certain amount of times for that guy to give me the undead bone shard. You gotta feel sorry for me. Kindling? Yeah, if I had a better kindling, it'd be kind of cool. Like, there's probably, you know, Elden Ring equivalent of, like, boosting all my stats, or... Boosting endurance and health, or... Bloodborne mechanic, HP. There might not be a full cinder. Eh, maybe there is. I have yet to do, like, the main boss in any area. I've only done... Um... Like, optional side bosses. Get kindling from main bosses. Yeah, the way the game is laid out is actually not so bad. Because I think I have to kill five main bosses, then I can go to final boss. It's a weird demo, though. It feels like the whole game's here. I don't know. It feels kind of weird to me. Let me flame first and then elixir. I think the flame lasts longer than the elixir. Probably want to get these golden coins off my hotbar. Two hand my weapons, probably a good idea. Yeah, I still don't know the mechanic of like his leg being shiny or not. I don't I don't really know what's going on with that, but Yeah, I just his shiny leg became shiny now. Indeed. I'm gonna keep smacking this one that's like not shiny. Okay, now they're both shiny. Oh, he's falling down. Okay, that's good. Yeah, I do a decent amount of damage. My elixir wore off. Yeah, the elixir wears off pretty quick. Schmick. Like, the flame lasts way longer than the elixir does. He's leaving. I guess I elixir back up. Alright, sweet. Nice clean dodge. Still got flame on. Okay, he's just putting a bunch of range attacks down. It's very annoying. Ooh, I miss. There goes my flame. Shit, I rolled into that. <laughs> I get double sip. The souls retrieved text almost got in the way. I'm not gonna fire up my sword again, I don't think. Unless I see an opportunity to do so, but it's not right now. Oh, 
Oh, that's not the item I wanted. Shit, <laughs> I wanted to heal. Fucking took an elixir. I used all three elixirs that fight. Fucking <laughs> used one by accident at the end there. Oh, shit, that's funny. Yeah, what's she eat? Oh, he was, he's been so close. Oh, man, the fucking <laughs> desert guy got super close to dying, too. I want more elixir. I wish I could carry more than three. It's, it's annoying to have to go back. Like, Elden Ring's... A mysterious flask. I remember. I forget what it was. Wondrous, yeah. Wondrous flask. Wondrous physique. Like, you don't have to go back to fucking Firelink every time you want to, like, refill it. It just refills automatically. I guess this one uses, like... Items that uh, you need to farm for, but I wish I could just make multiple than three. Maybe that's another upgrade. Maybe let's see no more upgrades later on. Make sure not to get sad on. Okay, I got sad on. <laughs> it's fucking hand. Yeah, some sort of endurance, stamina recovery, ring would be nice, or item. I think it's pretty close to staggering, I think that's a staggering. He's gonna probably teleport away now. Yep. I'll top off my health. Real clean dodge. I got five health left, or five blasts left. Okay, that's a, like, axe buff. Ew, his boss item is probably that axe, which I'm not a huge fan of, but maybe I'd rather use it over the sword. I'm okay to keep going in there. I guess I'll top off my health. I get the opportunity to do so, so I take it, I guess. Okay, this might be kind of awkward to dodge this. You got it, though. I'm getting it down. Fuck. <laughs> Let's take a move slower than I expect. You still like dodging them at close range. Is that a stagger? I think it is. I don't even mind if he sits on me. One more smack. Two more smacks. Alright, we got him, sweet. Alright, nice. What's he got for me? Oh, that's a kindling. Crusader's kindling? Maybe it's like a strength boost? Faith boost? Yeah, so it gives you an ember. It doesn't actually ember you up. It has embered me and gave me an ember. Skinning Ember is better though. 5,000 souls. Alright, good deal. Let's see, check out this boss item. If there is one. <laughs> There's a kindling though, that's cool. Maybe something more useful to me than maximum health. Um, does this guy have anything to say? Not that I killed the most? Is he dead? You're a good listener. Hardly any nobody trusts the clergy anymore. Anyway. Sweet, thanks. It's the emblem of an old covenant. Yeah, the way blue. What do I do with that? There's no covenants in this game, I think. If you seek protection, then offer this emblem to a saint tree. As a blue, it will be my last. Um, co-op. Saint tree? I don't know where a saint tree is. But um, okay. I don't think I can equip it. Yeah, the kindling thing is there. So let's see. Increase poison max equip load and. Eh. I like the max equip low, but I don't want to be, uh, dependent on an ember for that. Poise? Meh. No thanks. This guy disappeared. No, he's still there. Okay. Oh, it's easy 100 souls every time I rest with this bonfire. <laughs> Actually, it's 110 souls. Ooh, even better. I guess it gets like an axe or something that I don't really want to use, but I guess I'll look at it. If there even is a boss weapon associated with that soul. Yeah, there is, Calm. 
Golem Great X, 32 strength. 21 faith. Yeah, I'm not using that. <laughs> Where's the dex weapons at? <laughs> Let me just use this soul, I guess. Or transpose into weapons. Siege Golem? Doesn't really seem like a Siege Golem. Oh, Firekeeper's Charred Ring, Firekeeper's Silver Ring? I don't know why I got those things, but thanks. These rings are unique. The temperament of the first flame. Yeah, nice voice acting, honestly. It doesn't sound amateur, so that's always good. Elucidate? Alright, let's uh, calm down with the big words here. Fire Linker, Fire Maiden. Give me... One point of vitality. Oh wow, well, only one level up. And put on Tearstone Ring. I mean, I don't know which one I want more. I guess the Tearstone Ring. I'm gonna go f try to fight the double boss now. Yeah, I really want the swag, but I'm not swagged up. I really want the plus three weapon too, but <laughs> I can't find any Titanite sh or shards or whatever. They're probably like in other areas, but I want to go to other areas. I want to keep fighting Vouches. Final boss there, final boss and maggot boss, final boss. Two areas I'm really explored, because they're Dark Souls 2 areas, and Dark Souls 2 is a gross. Guess while I'm here, hold on, do you guys sound for me? Nope. Because I'll check this guy too, just in case. Yeah, he doesn't get like more items, it seems. Well, I have the souls, I'll buy this armor, sure. I'm gonna get some more elixirs. Yeah, I, I guess I killed the... Let me get these coins off my hotbar. I'm gonna take these firebombs off as well, but we'll keep them there, I guess. There's no, like, pebble equivalent in this game. Although, this would, like... What was it? Poise and... Oh, equip load. Eh, while embered? Like, I'd be super reliant on being embered, like, all the time if I wanted, like, the loadout. I could test it out, though. I don't know, if I'm just, like, exploring, yeah, maybe I'll go explore a little bit. Dark Souls 2 areas. Change my kindling, though. Boys and max equip load. See how much equip load I actually get. That's double, too, so that's double the effects. Oh, wait. I have to take one. Oh, it's temporary, though. That was dumb. Wait, it also gives me max HP? Okay. Mm, I can barely wear this. That was kind of dumb of me. Um, ooh, that's pretty swag, though. I take that off, I can. But it's like... Let me rest at the bonfire. I, my buff might expire. Like the extra ember. It doesn't. I just have to wait. Hmm. I mean, if I'm embered up... And just exploring with fully equipped load or whatever, that's fine, but... Because the, like, alchemy expires, it's just awkward. I mean, I could just keep doing it, but I don't have a ton of these, like, alchemy ingredients. Uh, this is, like... Which one's this one? I don't remember. They're both Dark Souls 2 areas. Okay, this is the one I want to go to, I think. I'm guessing my alchemy buff will expire. Yeah, what's my equip load now? Yeah, 39%. I'm still like, yeah. I can't, okay, can't change while I'm embered, it seems. And I guess I can take advantage a little bit of the max equip load. Lothric Knight? Yeah, infected commander, I think I want. I don't really look at the stats too carefully. Alright, I guess I'll do a little exploring. Is this guy like a cable guy? Yeah, he is. If I be a big shield guy. Yeah, this guy gets up if I go over there. So he has a machine shield with his sword. <laughs> I don't really want to fight both of them at the same time. Okay, he's already switching things up though. You don't usually go over here. Is that a boss already? 
guy's got a cool mask. Iron Man. Man, that's looking like a boss arena. At least a mini boss. Oh, Fwen! Press one, I think that's a Dark Souls 2 thing. Oh, I forgot to look at my rings that the Firekeeper gave me. Dark knives. Wait, they're not equipable rings, they're... Um, key item rings? Reacts to the world's flame tendency? Flame tendency? Uh-oh, that's not good. Actually, the bear's soul tendency? I can't use it. Some kind of key item. What's this do exactly? Offering to the altar beneath a saint tree. I don't know where a saint tree is. Oh, sorceries from Yellowfinger. I guess I go to this boss arena, sure. I can't elixir and, like, put on better armor? I guess? Like, I got an elixir, like, mid-fight if I want to preserve my quick roll. Hello, mini-boss. Oh, you're not even a mini-boss. You don't even have a health bar. I don't know how you missed that one. You look pretty backstabbable. I forgot to put fire on my sword. I can still do that, though. It's a dark wraith. Cool. Ooh, the kick. My health bar is really big. I don't know why, because, like, this kindling, I don't think, increases my health bar. But it seemed to do it even... without the alchemy thing. Seems kind of weird. There's no way it's, like, a direct upgrade to, like, the normal cinder ember. Thingy. Oh, I have a different thing. I have a different Ash of War or thingy. Yeah, I guess I like this one better. Ooh, Fencer. Up, Hilt Rapier. There's the first Dex weapon I've seen. Oh, not really, but it's definitely a very Dex weapon. Where's the Rapier? Lightweight Thrusting Sword. Ooh, in Dark Souls 2, the Thrusting Sword is the best of sword. Yeah, not a super fan of Rapiers, though. That was like a spear, or a halberd, or a sword spear, or a glaive. That'd be super cute. Little island over there. I don't think that's playable area. Yeah, and I think my equip load... It's still 29%. I guess my alchemy is still activated. I'm surprised it hasn't expired by now. Yeah, I got health from this. Poison max equip load. This doesn't like stack. I'm not sure. Um, yeah, let me drink up. Has this guy anything to say after that guy dies? No. Like, I wanted to explore because I got the Ember to explore, but I don't really care about exploring it, to be honest. Just want to fight the buses. This is a Dark Souls 2 area. This place sucks. <laughs> it reminds me of Dark Souls 2. And that game is bad. Well, these guys un aggroed. That's nice. Oh, this guy staggers all the heavy. Backstab? Sweet. Yeah, I don't get my stamina back when backstabbing or viscerling, which seems kind of weird. Guess I won't fight those guys. Hello, friend. This guy has a cool helmet. Other than that... Yeah, I guess he's got cool armor, too, actually. His sword is much quicker than you think it would be. I need to escape. Yeah, this might be a higher level area. Hmm. I mean, that, like, Dark Wraith wasn't that hard. I'd like not to die because I'm embered. But I think I'm not at light load anymore. No, I am. 
So what does the alchemy do for me then? Weight ratio 29. Yeah, I'm no longer like alchemy. Let me alchemy and test it out. Huh. I guess it just gives me more poise? I don't really care about that though. Okay. That's not bad. I like being fully clothed. Although I have to be embered to do it. Oh, I'm getting free souls, aren't I, by sitting at the bonfire? This is too funny. Yeah, nice. Ooh, that's- I think that's more souls than it was in the other spot. I think that's like almost 150. 120? Oh, that's 10 extra souls. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to go to a Dark Souls 2 area. So... Yeah, there's four bosses I can go fight. Desert boss. Double night boss. Um, Maggot boss and Gwendolyn boss. Let's go fight Double Knight boss. How many embers do I have? Two? I can almost afford one more. I think I need to use the soul item then. I think I actually have enough with the fading soul. I'll buy an ember because I really like this extra crypt load. Yeah, sweet. Give me that. Oh, I need to get some more flasks. Apothecary flasks, I guess. This run back is the most annoying yet. I'm definitely still like light loaded though. Uh, Tearstone ring would be more effective than that for a boss. Although probably still not very effective. You just give me the fire extra damage. I've got better healing now too. Better armor. Yeah, my health bar seems really high for some reason. Like, it's a glitch. I don't think this Crusader's kindling should be like giving me that much more extra health. Is it like stacks? I don't really understand. Give me two of those. Got three embers. Six flasks. Can I get cool armor though? Probably would take the helmet off. Oh, I can't. So everything but the cool armor. Fencer armor is pretty cool. Yeah, it always seems like the heavier, the better it is. I spent money on these, like, <laughs> infected commanders, gauntlets, though, so I'm gonna use them. This overcoat's pretty funny. <laughs> How much do I want to use this, like, overcoat? I can use it, actually. I got 29.6. I'll have to not wear anything else. I think I'll do this. I think this is the most swag. It almost looks like I have a shield on my back, but I don't. It might have been a lucky drop. Maybe it's pretty strong. I don't know. It looks... I think it's the funniest looking. I really get to admire my helmet, though. Maybe I take the helmet off. Oh, 30.1. There's infected. Oh, did I not buy that? I didn't buy his leggings, although I don't think I think they're usually heavier than gauntlets. Oh, the swag is just too important. Is it only Pyromancer Garb that puts me in bloom? I got this fine. Loincloth? The loincloth is like less clothes than the other one, which is kind of funny. Yeah, we'll go with this, I guess. Okay, to the final boss of this area. I got fire boosting thingy. I think I just go to the normal one. Yeah. Low bonfire. I think this is the easiest boss I've got. It's weird because this is like the highest throne in the Firelink Shrine, so you'd think it'd be the hardest area, but I think it's actually the easiest. Yeah, this is like the normal, like, basic area, I guess. This is like the second area in Dark Souls 3. Oh, there's an item over there. I think there's even bonfire over there. I'd like to get to the boss with full health. We'll see if that happens or not. 
Yeah, now my equip load went up because the alchemy thing? I don't understand this alchemy thing. <laughs> I gotta go back. <laughs> right? I'm at above 30% now. But, like, it expires? Do I just use it once and it's good until the ember expires? What if I read it again? Boost the effects of kindling when mixed in flasks. Ingredient which provides a unique effect. Found amongst ash, this morning during dark and almost stages of flares. I mean, now I can't be bothered to, like... I guess I use it once, and then it's good to go? I don't understand. I need to take off some clothes, then. I guess I'm just wearing the fencer armor. So wonky. I just need a pump. Equip load. Yeah, I don't understand the flask. Weird. Because it like expires, but I still have the buff. Interesting. I also wish I could craft more flasks. It's kind of annoying to have to go back to that guy all the time. I need to watch the ballista and not get hit, hopefully. Shit. Have cheat. He doesn't do that much damage. I lose my damage buff from Lloyd's ring, though. Does that have angle on it though too? Uh, I don't think I'm gonna heal to full. Oh, I can summon, but I want to be doing that. I don't really know this NPC? It looks just like a normal person. Okay, let me. Oh, item for me. Long sword. Thank you. That's me. Flame and alchemy drink. All right. I should be able to separate them with the statues in the arena. Actually, blocked me that time. So sippy sip. No, teleporting, okay. Oh, they're playing around like an angel. So sweet. Okay, here comes the second one, I think. Pretty sure they just summoned them. Half my heals. Let me retake this. Yeah, and they're in a weird spot right now. I guess they teleport around the statue, though. Can I tell which one's lower? Do they have a shared health bar? They have a shared health bar. Yeah, I don't see separate health bars. There's spear guy and sword guy. Okay, I thought this health I thought this boss wasn't so bad, but I hate this. I actually hate this double boss. Yeah, just ignore the spear, maybe? Just focus on... Sword? Yeah, they teleport around, so the statues aren't as effective as I was hoping they'd be. Okay, well that was a um, okay first attempt. <laughs> Not so bad when there's just one, but when the second one's just- It looks like they have a shared health bar, so... I don't think it's like you just kill one and then the other one. I think uh, you have to kill one and then they both die, which actually isn't better. Because <laughs> you're fighting two of them no matter what. So my equip load goes back to being not as great, which makes me a sad boy. But I'm not gonna ember up. Let's get back in there. Dun -dun -dun. I'll put all my levels into equip load. Ooh, excuse me. Blech. I have a push to mute button, but it's on my keyboard, and I'm playing with a controller right now, so I don't really want to use it. Too lazy. I used two alchemy potions that fight, but that's fine. 
There's so many of those like pyro things. Guy coming in here. Nope, they're leaving me alone. I don't remember if Dark Souls 3 had like the hold down switch item button to go to your flask, but I know Elden Ring does. I'm not sure if that's just part of this mod or not. Just uh, let me heal. Uh, one heal, please. <laughs> Here's of Gertrude. Uh, uh, that's the run back is Garbo. I hate this run back. <laughs> Alright, just give me back in there. Just give me the fuck back in there. I just want to play Dark Souls. I'm not Embering. I don't know, but there was two of them. I was really just trying to avoid their attacks. Oh, I have no flask left. That's fine, though. Or no, um, alchemy flask, whatever it's called. Nice sound design. That's probably Dark Souls 3 sound design. The, not trebuchet, but ballista, like, firing. I'm timing out. Could summon somebody. You know, it's not a real Dark Souls game, but I refuse. I mean, it's a 2v1 fight, you know? It's only fair that I summon someone. I'd have to ember up, though. I refuse. Okay, um, give me in there. It's close enough to a real Dark Souls game, honestly. Close enough. No follow-up attack from the stomp. Oh, stagger's nice. Yeah, I don't have full stamina when they come out of a stagger. It makes it... Harder to get follow-up damage after the this room. Okay, they start flying around before a second one calls. Oh, here comes the second one. Okay, I got no stagger there. Yeah, shared health bar, so it's not like I can get one down and then kill the other one. Dun, dun, dun. I guess this is custom music. That's pretty cool if it is. It's not like Dark Souls music that I recognize. I just go for like little pokes. A little poker. I give them a little schmicky schmick. And then I roll away. Uh oh. That's you. That was two viscerals phase one. Fuck. <laughs> Oh, I guess it was two staggers. It wasn't two visceral's. I, I missed the second visceral. Just got R1 spamming. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. That's the first summon sign I've seen. And I've embered for, I think, pretty much every boss fight. Does it make sense the one summon that they give you is for the double boss fight? I was doing okay for a little bit there. Oh, ouch. Well, there goes a flask, I guess. Damn it. <laughs> Let's fucking run back. Okay, it doesn't have an angle on me. Yeah, I lose the bonus damage not being full health. I could Ember, although... Oh, this Ember's weird. I'm still Ember now. And yeah, that doesn't do anything to my equip load. It's weird, it gave me like health too. I don't understand the like other ember. But it, it maybe only gave me health when I like I drank the alchemy, like it boosted like that. I still don't want to summon, even though it's not a real from software game. It's real to me. It's real to me. Yeah, phase one I get staggers, like trade hits. Clean dodges. Thanks to it, just all goes to shit. Just 
just gonna do a little sipping of my flask here. Don't mind me, bushy bush. I'm stuck in the corner, fuck. I actually can't leave. Okay, I slipped out. Okay, not so bad. Hmm. I want to teleport out and conserve my ember. I'm gonna have like no health going into phase two. <laughs> God damn it. Yeah, don't mind me. Just going to leave. There's... Arena Geometry past the statues as well. Where's the exit? Yeah, I just go explore. I really don't like that boss. I don't want to explore Dark Souls 2 area, though. There's Gwendolyn. She wasn't that bad. I think she's weak to fire, too. I can go back to Gwendolyn. This is not her, though. I mean... Gwendolyn's throne is over there. But that's a Dark Souls 2 area. Weird. I guess it's not the real Gwendolyn though, it's like a doggy Gwendolyn. I guess I'll go get more alchemy stashes from that dude. Yeah, I'm embered up, damn. Hmm. You don't understand how the other ember works, that's weird. Cause it was giving me health as well, as I guess increased poison and increased equip load. Hmm. Let's Give me this. Let's I guess the ember like boost gives me Ember effects of other embers? Uh, I don't understand. I think it was giving me like more equip load though as well, so maybe it's both. Uh, where am I going? I'm going to Gwendolyn. I guess I have maggot item. I get the maggot off. I have five of them. I just want a torch. Torch will take the maggots off, but I don't have a torch. Plus you don't find one before that boss in that whole area. Oh, I forgot where Gwendolyn is. I think she's here. Yeah. There's only one bonfire this entire area. It's kind of funny. I don't quite understand the, like, summoning guides either. Let me think how I want to do this. Uh, there, there, yeah, this way. Like, I run around and kill them all, but then Gwendolyn is summoned, and she's full health no matter what I do. And then it's like, I think everybody, all those, like, summons die, so maybe I just leave them alone? I could try that, but it seems kind of weird. Just let them summon Gwyn for full health? Because I don't think they do until um, she's full health. She doesn't show up. Gwendolyn. Yeah, Gwendolyn. Lord Gwyn is the king, and Gwendolyn, I think, is the daughter prince. Or her son princess. Son princess? Yeah, I think that sounds the most accurate. There's a doogie here. Hey, the doogie. Oh, I one-shot the doogie. Look at this Lloyd's ring doing stuff. I got like one extra flask since last time I attempted this. I think there was areas. Uh, is the okay? Yeah, the elevators here. Areas I haven't explored completely. Like to the right instead of just going to the boss. I just kind of want to go to the boss then. I could peek my head to the right. Oh, that was a scary enemy. On these pews. Oh yeah, there's Mommy Spider. I wasn't really in the mood to explore. Oh yeah, there's the scary guy. There's something past her too. Another boss maybe? Yeah, there's the scary enemy I was looking for. Let's straight across from this area. Statue? Hello. Do I have blue banner here? Oh, friend. Oh my god, it's a smurf. Hello, Smurf. Ah, a visitor. I'm glad you're different than those heretics masquerading as clergy. Yeah, now your volume seems too loud, My where most NPCs are too quiet. I have existed for a long time. I've been in hiding, however, as I must ensure that humans are such filth, yet the deep their quality of... I am a Felita. My mission Wait, is he an Aldrich the Horror? Worshipper. I think his a dialogue is repeating, but it's not repeating all at the same time. Okay, that was lucky. I found a bonfire here. Sweet. Um, I don't actually need to rest, though. Uh, respec here? What do I do here? What's going on with this cathedral? 
chapel area. Why is there red lighting effects over here? I don't know. Can I interact with the statue? Hello. Guess I can't do anything with him yet. Oh, established covenant breaks vow. Sure. What covenant am I establishing? Covenant established. X now. If you if you happen upon a rosary bead. Hello. Okay. Offer red rosary bead. So that's a covenant item. As an emissary. This might just be multiplayer shit, which I don't care about. I don't know what my covenant is. <laughs> is it just some random covenant? It's not like the way of the blue or anything. Let's check out over here. Okay. With this bonfire, I do like exploring even more now. Because I'm not super scared. Big guy, uh, hello. Deep gem. I don't remember what that does. These chairs remind me of Bloodborne. I mean, I guess this is the Bloodborne area. you scary enemy. So it looks like this just loops around. If I do a little yoinky splanky, give me that. Oh, a lurk skull might work on these guys, maybe. Some Deep gem. I don't think I can un-aggro her. Yeah, she's definitely coming on over here. Hello, friend. Let me just, uh, leave. Although there's another item over here. Let's grab this. I don't want to die because I'll lose my ember. I could just grab that item, spider lands. kind of want to kill the spiders, though. Oh, she is leaving. She doesn't mind. Okay, cool. Fighting me spiders. I almost see Lixard, but it's probably a waste. Oh, they're all coming. It's a spider party. Wait. Did I have Visceral? A spider? No, don't puke on me. Wait, there's a knight over here. What the hell? Who invited you? D did you come from? The bridge? I think the knight came from the bridge. Prism stones. Ooh. Might be a mimic. Knight's coming in here. Guess I'll check if it's a mimic. It is a mimic! Uh oh. I don't like it that. Can I actually leave this room? Looks like I'm being blocked by spiders. These corpses are wonky as fuck. I don't think I'm killing this knight guy. I'm super dead. Yeah, you may not. I'm but a wee hopper dead. I like visceral the spider right away. Uh, yeah, I went to the bridge is what I did and aggroed that knight and made that fight super messy. Even messier than it was before. Alright, I lost my ember. Sad, but I should be okay. I think I need the ember to fight the boss, especially with the bonfire being kind of close by. Ooh, I miss you. Man, this guy is rolling around. Don't expect to see that. Um, so I can't de-aggro this lady, actually. And there's not like... Yeah, okay. Usually there's like stairs there. You get up a different way. Should probably de aggroed by now. Maybe I got the mommy spider like in a vulnerable state like, during an attack. Ooh, I miss. Can't really see what's going on. I'm up against the wall. I don't want to be close to the bridge. I don't want the knight coming over.
Alright, there we go. Sweet. Oh, I got something cool. A ring, I think. HP from critical attacks? Eh. Not really critical attacking all that often. I think I got a second thing, but I don't remember what it was. I think it was a weapon. Yeah, there's the knight that fucked everything up last time. Fight the mimic now. Maybe the mimic will give me something cool. Like, Symbol of Avarice is probably what it gives you if it's the only mimic in the game, but I actually don't really think I want Symbol of Avarice. Alright, sweet. What you got for me, mimic? Ooh, twin spears! I love the spears. They're super dex too. Now how do I use both of them? Yeah, it's like a charge attack. Takes magic. Is it heavy attack? I'm only using one, which feels weird. The only time I use two is for the special attack. Let's read about them. Here's spheres of the Drang Knights proclaimed descendants from the land known for the legend of the linking of the fire. The Drang Knights disbanded, they scattered across the lands of Cell Swords. They quickly became known for shieldless, aggressive- Oh, shieldless! Aggressive taxes that struck fear in the hearts of men. Yeah, charge. Hmm, okay. I mean, it's just a spear. They don't take, like, special upgrade materials either, so it's like, I can't upgrade them. Back to my Flameberg, then. Where that's called Flam- wait, Flamberg? Yeah, flamber, okay. I guess I see flame and I think flame, but it's a bleeding weapon. I'm just gonna run past everybody here, don't mind me. Just going to my bonfire. There's something special. I mean lore wise. I don't know if this bonfire is better for Maggot boss, but it's probably better for Gwendolyn boss. Or dog jewel in, whatever. Yeah, I'm not gonna ember up. Eh, a kid. I don't think I will, though. Just give me to the boss. Oh, item over there. Yeah, I kinda avoided all these enemies and just got to search the bus. Huh. That, like, unique guy that was at the altar does not respawn. I don't care about that at all. The guy in front of the. Desert final boss was unique, but I doubt that guy is. Like, do I need to kill all these guys? What if I don't? Why don't I just let them summon Aldrich, Saint of the Deep? I think that's what they're doing, yeah. I think they all die when Aldrich pops up. Give it a shot. No. Yeah, there's no, like, Ranged attacks coming at me. The ranged attacks are just going to summon her, giving her health or whatever. It's just the other dudes that are coming at me. Hold off on my elixir for a little while. Yeah, summon her, summon her. Uh, it's gonna be annoying to have to wait every single time I want to attempt the boss. I'm tempted to. There's no way I. Flame up twice. I'm tempted to flame up when they're closer to summoning her. Let me hit the bar one more time. Yeah, let's flame up now. She's almost summoned. Yeah, they all just die? Okay. Fight me, Aldrich. Oh, I remember last time I, like, died to instant curse. Maybe I should have my curse ring on. That's probably a good idea. Put that over the tear stone ring. I still got light rolls. Okay. Okay, what's just curse me a ton? I'm not sure. Are there pools of curse around? I do not know. I need alchemy again. No, I guess not. So there's no, like, buff around my character showing me the fire damage buff. It's 
She's covered in like curse dudes. Get out of here, curse guys. Ooh, I miss. I don't even know what's happening. Just a bunch of ranged attacks. Can I get her away from all those like little dudes? <laughs> I'm just dodging ranged attacks. Uh, I'll top off my health, yeah. That's my last fire. Probably will be using... It's hard to, like, get in there for an attack. Oh my god. I don't think she doesn't summon more little dudes if I... Take care of them one by one. Yeah, these guys are just like cannons, fuck. I'm taking care of them though. If she summons more, I'll be very sad. Wait, they... they disappeared into the arena. Yeah, she did summon more. I'm a sad boy. At least got enough stamina to... get shit done. At one point when I was playing this game, I didn't have stamina to do shit. Okay, I'm not sure what's going on there. Bunch of curse. Shit. Run away, run away. <laughs> run away, run away. She's not even like half health, fuck. That's all my flesh. Is that phase over? Seems to have brightened up ever so slightly. Can you come over here, Gwendolyn, and stop fucking around with your simps? Come here. Hmm, more ranged attacks. I could firebomb. I don't think that's gonna be much though. Yeah. I fucking missed. <laughs> yeah, her summons just like leave? I think they resummon like around her. That's what's going on. Look at all this fucking projectile spam I gotta fucking deal with, Jesus. Alright, I'm just dead, aren't I? <laughs> They're just all attacking. I need like a spin slash from like a spear or something, I feel. What the heck the heck? What the heck the heck? Wait, where am I? Okay. Hello. As an innocent, such this one come to have. There's no PvP though, there's only PvE. There's only like co-op. I mean maybe you get red rosary beads from co-oping. I can't just like switch out my weapon though. Not easily. So I'll try again. Yeah, I gotta wait every time for them to summon her. Alright, well. Maybe... Yeah, no. Because the first attempt I'd, like, killed all the summoners. I was thinking maybe she'll summon less, like, cursed dudes if there's less summoners summoning her. But that's, uh, she definitely has the exact same amount of cursed dudes. I'm thinking about my sword spear that I used for my Elden Ring playthrough. I had like a special attack that was like a sweeping attack that would have been really good for all this fucking summon spam. Ooh, fog gate. I'd like to leave now. Dun, dun, dun. Oh. Yeah, put on my curse ring, yeah. Ouch. Ouch. 
Oh, there's souls here. I forgot. Let me grab these. I think souls. Yeah, I actually have a decent amount of souls here. Okay, buff my fire. Maybe I just stay on top of her, keep the damage up. There are all these summons. What's she doing now? She's summoning more summons. Great. Schmeck. Is that their death animation? I'm not really sure what that was. I need to heal. Oh, it's... Um, they're dropping things from the sky on top of me. I'm almost cursed. My curse is not going down either. Okay, now it is. She's only like... <laughs> one third of her health missing. My flame isn't gonna expire soon. I guess I'll refresh it. I have the curse ring, which helps out a lot. But it's not be enough. Okay, that's the last blast going in. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna leave. Well, there goes my last homeward bone. See ya. <laughs> there's there's 5,000 souls in the arena, which I'd like to take with me, I guess. Oh, that's rough. I feel like I need a, a, a different weapon, but like, <laughs> what? Um, could go fight double knight some more. Could go fight maggot boss some more. You go to the Dark Souls 2 areas. I'm not really into that though. I don't really want to play the Dark Souls 2 areas, honestly. I mean, I will. I could say, oh, I've seen enough of the demo. I'll wait for the full game to come out, maybe. I take. I did a breaky break, maybe. I mean, look at all the weapons I've found. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, there's no way this pickaxe is good. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I want to be using this. It doesn't have, like, a swipe. Let's see. It's got a swipe. Actually, this mace has, like, a swipe, I think. Eh, kinda. Not really. Oh. I love the Great Scythe. I use it. Oh. Yeah, I think the... It's definitely not as fast. It's been balanced, I think. It was too strong. Yeah, the Scythe has a different... Slightly different moveset than it does in Dark Souls 3. This thing's heavier, but it's the same damage. How does that work? Next swipe, next swipe. Yeah, it seems like the great size is just better. I see full. S oh, scaling's different. I mean, the great size is probably pretty good against Gwendolyn's summons. We need a faith build for this. Hmm. Yeah, that was rough. I don't know, I kind of do like the exploration, because it's like, oh, I'm, I don't think I can beat that boss, I'll go somewhere else. Oh, I'm trying to back, back step, but I can't when I'm like, <laughs> hold on, let me get some endurance. <laughs> hold on, hold on. When you like back step and you're shielding, it doesn't let you? I guess you cancel it? I don't think that, that's a Dark Souls 3 thing, I don't remember that. <laughs> All right. Man, I wish I had a full stamina bar. I really spam this. Spam the back, back step into cancel, I guess. I guess you can cancel the back step with a shield. It just looks silly when you have <laughs> shield held down. Spam back step. Really cool mod, huh? Still not exactly sure what this, like, 
Yeah, it was weird when I took the alchemy. It was. It also gave me like full HP and stuff. Weird. Maybe it like stacks or something. I should just use this black blade. It is dex. That's the heavy attack. Okay, does that? What's this special do? Yeah, the like sheath and then draw. Oh, that's like the parry. Yeah, that's like the parry too. They're pretty good against the summons. Yeah, now I think I just I just go to all the areas until I've explored all the areas completely, gotten all levels from exploring all the equipment and stuff. And then I do more bosses. That's weird, huh? It works. I don't not like it, but it's just kind of weird. I guess I've never played Demon Souls, so maybe it's kind of similar to that. I don't like the range on this thing. I like axes, but this one kind of has a hole. That's a swipe. Ooh, there's a swipe attack. I can actually equip it too. That's surprising. Thought it would take a little more strength. It's kind of like a halberd, honestly. How's the halberd look? Stab, stab, swipe. Oh, I think it's got the same moveset as a halberd. This has the same swipe. Oh, I think it does. I think it is like a halberd. Okay. Prison X, halberd, DD. Halberd seems better. It takes, I'm sure, Titanite shards like everything else. Yeah, Titanite shard. <laughs> uh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, there's nobody to buy Titanite shards from. I find that very, very surprising. Oh, what's my special on the halberd? Boost poise, okay. Wait, how long is the boost poison for, though? One attack? Oh, very, very briefly. Because it also reduces damage taken. Yeah, I guess I'll take a break. I don't know if I'll return to this mod. Probably when it completely comes out, but I'm very impressed with what I see so far. It's very, very cool. All the custom bosses are cool. I guess my only complaint would be, like, the camera's wonky a lot of times when fighting a boss. The frame rate as well, but I don't think there's anything to do about that. I think it's a Dark Souls 3 thing. Um, give me somebody to do Titanite Shards. Let me have more than three alchemy sips. Or at least let me put some in my, like, stash box, you know? So I don't gotta be running up to laboratory guy all the time. Yeah, maybe I would use Halberd instead. Doink. Doink. Super cool, though. Dark Souls 3 is definitely a good game to like overhaul to mod just because Dark Souls 3 is such like a tight uh, mechanically game like the movement's really good the combat's really good I, all the bosses were you know custom which is super cool you saw the ones I saw oh that Gwendolyn fight though man what the fuck is that what the heck, heck is that I just need more levels I guess yeah I guess I mean I'm kind of one-shotting the summons anyway Oh, there's a bunch of little Gwyns. Aw, Gwyn's family is so cute. But then, why is Guinevere, like, the true Gwyn? Interesting. <coughs> Excuse me. Wow, 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 wow. Ooh, I can go in here. Any secrets? Lock the laboratory. Uh, and it, the maiden does not seem to be, um, barefoot, so that's an issue. I'm sure she'll respawn, right? I'm about to leave the area and come back. Maybe I corrupted my save game completely and I can't level up anymore, making the game super difficult, but uh, that's fine. Eh, yeah, I guess I'll take a break. Thanks for hanging out with me, everyone. I had lots of fun. That was really impressive. That was a really, really impressive mod. Very cool. I'm glad I tried it. Like, I don't know if I'm going to like complete the, the demo and do everything there is to be in the demo, but yeah, revisit it when it actually comes out. It's very cool, though. Very, very cool. Something to look forward to. But I'll take a little break. Bye bye for now. See you, free hey, free heart. See you.